lovely jewellery makers, guess what? What? If I sang this, you'll know what I mean. I think you might. We go together like ba la la dingy 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 dong together forever. Oh, that, that might that might depress you though if I say that that line. We're all back together. No, oh, well, the back back end is well, yeah, the, the front gallery, end's missing. Gallery, yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> but it has been genuinely over a month what since is... I've seen Adam. I know. What well, he's been gallivanting, hasn't he? He's been off gallivanting, and I've been gallivanting, and Ross yeah. been gallivanting. But you know what? Always a treat to have this beautiful lady in the studio as a Tazza. Morning. Oh. Hello, gorgeous. How are you doing? All right, thank you. you How a, are you? You had a fairly wet trip down, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, stay in with us, guys. It's horrible out there. It is, it is miserable outside. <laughs> I normally watch the sunset, sunrise at this time of the morning, at this time of year. Yeah. On the way down, I usually follow the sunrise and it's gorgeous. You watch it all develop. This morning, no. Nah. No, just grey. Grey. Just grey. <laughs> grey and wet. Yeah. Yeah, well, you can see like about about three meters in front of oh, you. Oh yeah, it. and you've got to pass the lorry, and you're like, oh, ready, steady, go! Oh, I hate <laughs> driving in weather like that. I agree with what Alison just said. Stay Same. indoors, guys, because it is miserable outside. <laughs> really yeah. miserable. You know when you go out Stay and you pull safe. this face. Just, Run, just, open the door. Eh. 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 John, just get the door for us. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and you stay I, inside till the door's I, open. Yeah. Not 3 a.m. I don't. Um, we're also graced by the lovely Jimmy. Yay! Hi, hi, hi. You're all right. Come and poke your head in. Put your head in. Say hello. Hello. It's Jimmy. <laughs> and we've got Michael Wolf. Woo! Oh. Hello. Hello. Not eating anyone's sandwiches today. <laughs> Not planning on it. <laughs> oh, jewellery makers, we have got a Super <gasps> Monday show. Start of the Haven't week. We? Um, it's going to be absolutely incredible. Full, jam packed, full of inspiration. Um, at eight o'clock in your early bird hour, jewelry maker, lots and lots of goodies already locked and loaded on the website, including your early bird, which is oh. the most beautiful glitter ombre threads. Brilliant. Coming up for Christmas. Coming up for Christmas. For all your knotting. G get for those all of your parcels tassels. wrapped and. Oh, very nice. Yeah, get it on the tree. Very nice. Get some on the tree. Why not? Absolutely. Like this idea. You certainly get oodles of mm. it, don't you? Because they're spools. Spools of thread. Mm. So you can shop ahead on those jewellery makers. Um, and as you can see, you've got that lovely glitter, metallic beauty in mm, there. Um, we've got loads of those, so do make sure you shop ahead. Um, and remember in the eight o'clock hour, it times out at nine o'clock. So there's a menu <gasps> ah. of goodies, um, but make sure you check them out. Some of them will be more lower in stock. Nine o'clock, it is the return. Your jewelry is incredible. Oh, thank, it was so um, easy, so easy with those. The return of the clover jump rings. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Stunning. Absolutely. The the, the, the jump <coughs> rings are fabulous. And they're closed jump rings, which is brilliant. That. No, they're closed jump rings, so it's absolutely fabulous. You could literally just put those on the shepherd hook, couldn't you? Well, I did. Did you? Well, I put three of them. They're, they need shaking down. The the gold ones. Literally, oh, yes. just jump rings between them. Oh, yeah, of course, because you get them in different sizes yeah. as well. They're lovely on the thread rings. They've been in the bag, so they're a little bit... Not nice. quite hanging, but um, a bit of a spin on the Van Cleef and Arpels. Yeah, you watch, they're going to be stealing your designs. Oh, now, well. <laughs> um, so that's the project. And um, oh, what's the gemstone? Um, we have black Guatemalan, no way, yes, jade, Guatemalan jade, yeah, and malachite. Oh, I mean, wow. look at that, that's stunning, isn't it? Yeah, I love those gemstones as well. What mm. gemstones? I'll tell you what, what a 9 a.m. kit, yeah. Um, then at 10 o'clock, jewelry makers, <gasps> can't wait. Nor me. Cast your mind back a few years. Mm -hmm. Our most popular cut for one period cubes. were cubes. Oh, cubes. Do you remember? Yeah, but we're going back quite a few years now. Yeah. Probably pre COVID, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And the reason why I'm saying cast your mind back is because we haven't been able to get hold of mm. them. They are oh. finally, a bit like, do you remember we saw it with the satellite cut as yes, well? Yes, yes. Um, it went crazy. We yeah. can't get them back in stock. Jewelry makers, we have the return yes. of the faceted cube. And my, oh, look at them all. I need my that. My goodness me, the gemstones are off the chart. Mm. We were get, uh, we've been getting excited about these this morning. Mm, because too right. you have natural aquamarine on your screens right now. Absolutely gorgeous. Natural oh, kyanite, which is, you know, so richly saturated, it's Nilamani. Yeah. Natural Amazonite, check these out. Oh, I know. Wow, look. Natural. Oh my gosh. 
Oh red God. tourmaline, which I'm sorry, oh. is rubellite. That is it's natural incredible. And it has the red and pinks. That's what defines a rubellite. If it holds red colour and pink colour, that's what defines a rubellite. Um, I can't, I'm blown away by the fact that, we've got this. Yeah. And type A Burmese that jade eye. I want every single one. So do I. Every single one of those strands. Are Imagine those mixed, like just <gasps> one of each. Oh, yeah. All the way around. Yes. How beautiful that would be. Imagine it has those been in a bubble years, style. Alison, hasn't it? It has been years. And imagine that in a bubble style. Oh, beautiful. A, an ombre bubble style. One runs into the next, runs into... You could do a gorgeous... That's something gorgeous. else we've got to see the return of, a bubble style design. Yeah. I haven't I, seen those in ages. I did one, but it was with two mil gemstones. Oh. Go bl blimey. I bet that looked was amazing. Work. But yeah, that's a lot of work. A lot of work. It, it's about... Uh, 300 gems to do to do a couple of inches wow yeah yeah well this will but progress a lot quicker wouldn't it because quicker. they're bigger um, i'm going to say they're about four or five mil in their size so I that's your four to five literally check me out Yoo -hoo! check me out with my measurements it's like i've been here before <laughs> um so it's been years since we've had the cube uh cube selection um that's coming up as your deal of the day are they going on pre-order by any chance mm, i don't know are they going on pre-order no maybe in the nine o'clock hour we might think of it might get now cramp. um in the 11 o'clock hour oh my goodness me what a lineup ross this oh my goodness me isn't that stunning <gasps> look at the colors in that We've had this show scheduled four or five times prior to the show, and it has actually been pushed back because we want it to be the right, mm. the right, yeah, the right occasion. Today oh. is the day. Look at the quality. Oh. This is the beautiful, natural, type A quartzite jade. Wow. Natural. So, yeah, these are insane. The colour of quartzite oh. jades, the newest variety of jades, Ooh, I love are that. insane. Um, yeah, they are very paparazzi colours, like the sunset that we were mm. missing this morning, yes. Alison, aren't they? And we've got them in, oh, an autumnal. Oh, do you know, we've got conkers. Yay, conkers by us. We've got loads of trees with them on. We haven't got them yet. Uh, <laughs> have, have your conkers not started falling? Well, they have, but they're not ripe yet. They're not ripe yet. No. So we've got... <laughs> We've got conquer trees sort of on the way down yeah. to our house and they're, they're all falling already. Oh, are they starting to fall? Yeah. Oh. So the girl's like, can we go and get some conkers? Yes, when it stops raining. Um, yeah, God, I mean, it is all those beautiful autumnal colours. These have been scheduled five times before That's today. Stunning. We're not pushing it back again to, uh, after... For, it is playing today's show, look at your dial. Um, so that's at 11 o'clock today. Um, finally, your <sighs> midday hour, your masterclass is all about... These are gorgeous, Alison. That necklace Thank is you. insane. Chunky Knot Necklace bra uh, Masterclass with our lovely Alison. Alison, that's amazing. Thank you. I can't claim credit for that design. I won't claim credit. <laughs> no, that 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 was um, inspired um, by a, 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 a tutorial from. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. What's the name? No, I know. Nothing wrong not, with that. But look so, how cool so that's that not is. your. That's not your. That's not your demo. Yeah. However, if people want to know where the tutorial is on YouTube, I can. You'll point send them in them the right link. direction. Yeah. How amazing is that? But it's How incredible, isn't it? How comfortable is that going to be? Oh, it's super, super uber comf comfortable. These cords, these cords are amazing. If you suffer with dexterity issues, I mean, my mum has trouble gripping anything. <laughs> yeah. And my niece, who's only 29, is struggling now with arthritis. Mm. So she's struggling oh, to hold a fine her. needle. These are perfect. You yeah. can still craft with these. Of course. They're great to get hold of. They're really easy to use. We've got findings to go with them. Amazing. Um, they're absolutely stunning. Love it. Loving the colours as well. Mm. Yeah. Well, Lovely. jewelry maker, sorry, just had a sip of my coffee. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> it's going to be an amazing Monday show. Do get your text messages in, lovely jewelry makers. Should we get cracking? Yes. Shall we? Go you on. remember? I do. You remember? start of the show oh what ross's start of the show exactly i do remember we're going to start with what sorry shell pearl donuts got it 
I've never seen those before. Oh, these are beautiful. Wow. You threw me with the butterfly. <laughs> oh, okay, is it probably because it's a kaleidoscope of colour? That's oh, what it is. Oh, look at that. Yeah? Do you reckon that's what it is? Because there's a kaleidoscope of colour in these. You know what's going to happen, jewellery makers. Ross goes in the hot seat. Those with this cord. Oh, lovely. Perfect. <clears throat> Jimmy, warm up your vocal cords. Because it's a burn. A burn. It's a burn. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. Very good, Jimmy. Love it. Love it. Love it. It's like he's almost here in the studio. It's a band. It's a band. They've sold out. Well done. Well surprised. done. Well done. Next up. Next up. We have a hedgehog. Oh, I love hedgehogs. Where's the hedgehog? Oh, yes. In a pendant. Mm. I love hedgy hogs. And it's their time of year. Be it careful. It is. It is. Protected as well. They're protected mm. our, our hedgehogs, aren't they? Look at this. You've got a one carrot citrine in his little tum tum. Wow. Oh, look. He's Isn't that adorable? Gorgeous. That's beautiful. I love them. I think they, I've, I've held one. Have you held a hedgehog? Yeah. Oh. We used to have them in, in my old house. We used to have them live under our decking. Mum's got a load in the bottom of the garden. She's Great thing got to have a nest in the down there. Yeah. Great thing to have. I love hedgehogs, yeah. They're really noisy as well. Oh, they can be, yeah. yeah. Sold out. Well done, everybody. Yeah, we love hedgehogs. Uh, moving on to... Calcedony. Ooh. Is it? Oh, yeah. Nice. Got it. I haven't seen Calcedony in a while. No. That's beautiful. Oh, azure blues. It's like, like the sky that we haven't got today. Yes. <laughs> That's beautiful. I think summer's done, don't you? Yeah. I think it's done now. I, I was hoping for an Indian summer this, you know, during September. Yeah. I think it's good. I think we're well and happen. truly into autumn. Um, when is it officially autumn? 21st. Today! So oh, it's it? it today. Oh, okay. Happy autumn, everyone. I like autumn, though. Everything just gets a little bit cosy, doesn't it? Guess what, Alison? It's a band. It's a band. <laughs> uh, yeah, we used to be really band. good. We, I think it's because it's really hard to talk like that. It's band. Sold out. Well done. Well done. Well done. If you like these types of deals, by the way, you may not know it, but at seven o'clock in the morning, we actually load an hour ahead of the show. Clearance deals. Wow all below cost price so it is definitely worth looking um, in. in the seven o'clock hour we might not be live but they're there on the website so make sure you tune in have a shifty yeah definitely do you want to check it out yeah here i'll tell you some more did you know that you can shop for pre-show deals on jewelry maker head over to jewelrymaker.com every day between 7 a.m and 8 a.m click on watch live Scroll down for brilliant products, last of stock items and amazing deals. But these deals are only available for one hour and once they're gone, they're gone. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Happy shopping. One hour only. There's a song in there. There is a song in there. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but after all the one pound yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think I can do it. Um, so <coughs> it's worthwhile checking out the website at seven o'clock because they're all below cost. I do. Do you? Get bargain. Too yeah. right. Yeah, absolutely. Pickle bargain. Absolutely. Bargain town. Indeed. Um, okay, we've got more amazing deals to bring you. Don't forget your early bird jewellery makers. All about these amazing these cords. These are fabulous. Here they are. Did you know uh, you can crochet with them and oh, knit with them? Oh, that's a nice them. idea. Mm, they're fab. You can kumahimo with you with them, and if you mix them up and have three strands, one of each, you can kumahimo with that as well. Could I use these with your masterclass? Yeah, you could. Why not? Why not? Indeed why not um so do shop ahead on those and you get all three so you haven't got to choose the color um there you go sorry it was just bothering me that there was just a little gap that's my ocd coming out oh no no there you go <laughs> <laughs> there you go right then should we do some more should we do some mookite mookite in a beautiful ar um archer ring oh Love i like it. that i saw this for the first time the other day it's amazing mm. look at that Look at that, all the way from Western Australia, gorgeous mooka. I have, I have, I, I tell you I have. I'm 
come in. I brought, I brought, I brought <laughs> archer rings the other day, but not this specific. Uh, <laughs> not this particular one. There we go. Go for an easier <laughs> word. Um, okay. Apparently, I haven't seen it. It's gorgeous, though, isn't mm, it? I mean, carved lovely. out of one amazing gemstones. I did. You're right, Roscoe. Sorry, I should never doubt you. Um, Ross said you did Red Tiger's Eye L and uh, Chris Crazy A. Sake. Nice. You didn't do Mukai. My apologies. So this is the first time I'm seeing your beautiful Mukai. How lovely is that? I'd wear it as a thumb ring. Mm. Isn't that gorgeous? It's lovely, isn't it? Cool as a thumb ring. You nice can... alternative to a wedding band. Yep. Great for wire working round. Yes. Great for... Um, Chain mailing round. Nice. That's nice yeah, because it could almost be like, treat it almost like a donut, couldn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, totally. Um, yours today for just £9.99. pence. Wow. You think how challenging it is to actually carve a, a, a bangle? Mm. Um, now imagine it on a smaller scale. I oh, imagine yeah. archer rings are actually harder. Um, if you're wondering why I'm calling it an archer ring, that's because it was first, I think, with Jade that they started doing it. So carving rings like this, because archers... They used to get blisters on the inside yeah. of their hand when they were obviously put, drawing the bow. Um, so they used to wear rings to actually... Protect uh, their fingers. To prevent it, to protect their fingers. Because if you can't do that, then you can't aim straight, can you? So nope. uh, genuine gemstones and all their durability were used to actually uh, to protect the skin. £9.99 pence, jewellery makers. You can get hold of it today. I've got Nora, Pauline, another... Uh, Paula, sorry, Mirtha Tidville, Sharon. 30 second clock. We're going even lower. Wow. It's a nice little gift, this, isn't mm. it? What about um, scarf rings? Yep, scarf ring. Use some cord and just have it as the centre of a two lark's head knots, one nice. either side, and have That'd it as a nice. bracelet. That'd be nice. They're so versatile. Because it's not, it's a nice size. It's not big. You could do all sorts with that. I love it. Amazing. I think I did um, a dragon once that wove its way round. Oh, cool. That was back in Ivy House days. That's cool. Well, we're going even lower, Alison. How many do we have, Roscoe? 50 available within the vault. And for that reason, we're not even stopping here. What? I'm very excitable this morning. Oh, I might need some of these. <laughs> We've got beautiful, genuine gemstones. Of course we're excited. We've got faceted cubes back. I know. You know. I would like to say I'm easily pleased, but I'm not so easily pleased because it's taken us years to get those, isn't it? Um, years and years and years to get hold of them, jewelry makers. Justine, Hello to you, Maker, Neathport, Tolva, Irene, Andrea, Nora, Pauline, Paula, Mirtha Tiffel, Sharon. We're going even lower. I've got 15 available. 7 99 for a genuine One five. gemstone. Huh? 1 5 or 5 0. What do you mean? 15 or 50. 5 0. Oh, I've got a chance. You have got a chance. Ooh. Six pounds, 99 pence for 18 carats of beautiful mukai. But guess what? Until nine o'clock today, you can have it for less than a fiver. Really? Mm hmm <gasps> I might need some of these for a workshop I'm running. Oh, they will get, get, get With your... chain mail. Get your, your iPad it's out. It's out there. Oh, it's out there. <gasps> Rookie mistake. I know. Could you put it with the Amazonite? Please? I certainly can. It will go lovely do, with the Amazon loop, night. Yeah, Under £5, pounds, but you need to be quick on these jewellery makers. It's available until That's the lovely. top of this hour. Yeah, lovely. Mm. Well, you could almost use... If, if, you, if, if you, like, packed it out, you could almost use it like a like a slider. Oh, yeah, you could. That'd be quite nice. I'd just, I'd just pop it on, do a loop and pop it on. Lovely. Love it. It's going to work amazingly with all your deal of the day pieces. Well done, jewellery makers. Yeah, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Lots of multi-buyers. Until nine o'clock this morning, you can have it for less than five pounds. You think what five pound gets you these days? Mm. Not a lot. Not a lot. Parking if you go shopping in some places, isn't it? Mm. More, actually, if you go to if you go to Birmingham, go to the Bull Ring. Oof. Goodness me, four ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Five Atia. Hello to you, Justine. Hello to you, Irene. Hello to you, Neith. Hello to you, Rachel, Joanna, and John. Hello to you, Andrea, and new customers. Um, available until nine o'clock. So, or until stocks last, obviously. Uh, make sure you do check out your basket, though, to guarantee your success. Um, if you want to do more, that dong was that was my heel on the chair. Don't worry. Oh. Um, oh, no, nothing to worry about. Just being a bit musical. The clock's out. There you go. Dong. And you find a digit, don't you? You do. Find a digit that fits. Toe ring. A toe ring? Mm. It's a very posh toe ring. Mm. Why not? Why not? I mean, it's 4 99 Why not? 
I agree with you. Make sure you're checking out everyone to guarantee your success. And again, don't forget your early birds. You can braid them, kumihimo, knot them. You can do all sorts with them. Make sure you're checking out everyone. There's lots of you with it still in your basket. It's no good leaving it there. We can't go any lower. It's a beautiful, genuine gemstone carved to perfection. Mm. Carved to perfection. Yeah, there's your early birds. They're locked and loaded in the hour as we speak. Um, item number one, so do shop ahead. Yeah, look at that. It's really cool. It's really comfortable it to wear as well. Feels nice on the skin to wear a gemstone ring, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it does. I used to wear a thumb ring all the time. Yeah, let's pass them to a thumb ring. You stri I strike you as a thumb ring type of person. <laughs> what does a thumb ring type of person... Cool. I like <laughs> Good save, cool. Adam. <laughs> let's do a, a, a close-out deal, shall we, jewellery makers? Natural. <gasps> I've got these. We've You're got right five. I literally wore them on holiday all the time. So it's like a mini make jewellery maker. So I'll hold one pair. You do get the two, obviously. All you need to do, Alison. Yeah. Hang on. All you need to do is literally attach jump ring wow it is that simple i mean i'll put the other one down here i don't know if jimmy can get it all in but there you go so literally put a jump ring onto your earring post attach your natural blue marbe wow. pearl and, a, and it's job done it is literally job done they are framed in sterling silver in the past, I have actually shown you marbe pearls on first dibs, haven't yeah, I? Yeah, yeah. And the blue ones in particular are incredible. They're like thousands upon mm. thousands of pounds. Uh, marbe pearls are uber are rarer, actually, than many cultured pearls. And that's because you uh, you only see the marbe when the oyster has actually come to the end of its life, yeah. obviously. So, um, and not all, as, um, all of them will actually produce a marbe. Sometimes referred to as blister pearls, but I don't really like that. So we do something extra special um, because, I mean, that's high-end oh, jewellery if ever I saw it. If ever I saw it. We're going to do something yeah. massive. It's the final few um, set into solid sterling silver. When these were first launched, I can tell you, jewellery makers, it was on May. There you go, part of the birthday. And we'll show you the launch price. I love these. I think they're such quality. There's only five available within the vault. Once they're gone, they're gone. The fact that wow. you have got the, the mother of pearl on both parts as well. Yeah. We had 50 commissioned in the world. I've got five left. Your birthday deal was £199. It's amazing. It's amazing, yeah. You weren't, uh, look, those ones on first dibs were not £199. Mm. They were not three figures. They no, were all four, four figures. figures. Today, in 30 seconds, we are going to take it. <gasps> under 100 pounds what? yeah i wore them all the time on mm. holiday they're amazing so beautiful so 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 beautiful i mean you get such a, a kaleidoscope of colors yeah. from the natural iridescence marbe pearls incredibly incredibly rare like i said you only ever see it if oh so when the oyster dies so um and not every oyster will actually produce a marbe particularly if they've got the blue color yeah here we go so these are marbe earrings that are off first dibs three thousand eight hundred and forty six pounds you can't say that it's, it's like oh it's all the diamonds you can't say oh it's the diamond that's pushing that carat no. weight up or even the 18 carat gold it's not it's the marbe pearl that's push uh, commanding that four figures are you ready for this? Wow. I have five available. That's it. Now I have. We're super over allocated. Not surprised. They're stunning. Uh, it's a birthday deal at £199, which was amazing. Today, we're closing out the final five. It's no good to us having five um, sat within our vault. Look at the pink now. Yeah, it's incredible. Yeah, I like keep... it. Oh. I keep. Wow, it's amazing. Incredible. And it's natural. It's totally and utterly natural. You can get hold of it still with your 0% interest split payment. We've got a clock to close because that is literally a giveaway deal, jewellery makers. It's just basically because we, we, we can't have five sat there. Um, we should have really put that in the 7 o'clock hour. So once oh, they're gone, can't. they're gone. Yeah, you want to talk about a marble, yeah. don't you? I know, it's one of those. Um, but it's the reality beautiful. is, and they were hugely popular. The Princess of Wales, uh, Princess Diana, mm. was a big fan of marble pearls. There she is. 
She used to wear them quite frequently because they sit beautifully on the ear. Um, so because they, because they're uh, basically flat, flat back, back, but also they? our current Prince of Wales, of course, um, Princess Kate. Yeah, they're absolutely gorgeous. Um, yeah, bet she didn't pay ninety nine pounds, ninety nine pence for hers. Yeah. Maybe with a, with another couple of figures on the end. Yeah. Mm. And, uh, unless she uh, she might have made them. You never know. She might have. She might have done. She might be a jewelry maker fan. You never know. You never know. I'm gonna look for the next cape that comes up and see if they're from well, Windsor. You know, yeah, it's not. It's, it it is true that the royal family have worn Gemporia Jewel. gemstones. Mm. They have. They have. So. Um, Queen Camilla's got some of our jewellery. I she? she certainly has. Why not? Certainly has. Um, shall we sit with the clothes out deals? Oh yeah, go on. Shall we? How about oh, a faceted sorry. Tahitian pearl? We launched it with Dave. And Ross says, I remember exactly. Oh my goodness. Have you seen how big it is? Mm -hmm. Dave's I in India at the moment. Too. Oh yeah, of course he is. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I can actually, I'm going to have to use a piece of paper because it's so big it won't sit on the on my hand so a faceted pearl once upon a time jewelry makers we used to say wow. that you can't facet a pearl didn't we we did we were like no no you can't facet a pearl um you can but it took decades multiple decades to actually achieve there's only a handful of people in the world that can do it you have to start with the finest quality um pearl so what i mean by that it has to have a really nice smooth nacre not big sort of lumps in it because effectively then when you start faceting yeah. um you'll it'll just chip away basically um and also there's two things to discuss here actually to discuss the rarity of a t uh, of a faceted pearl but also the fact that the future decade harvest of, of tahitian pills are bought out so we can't buy tahitian pills full stop what's available is what we have within our vault mm -hmm. that's it um uh, 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 we don't even know who it is but a very wealthy collector i assume um has literally bought the future harvest of all tahitian pills so it means opportunities like this jewelry maker um are going to be very few and far between but look at what the faceting actually does to or how it actually achieves um, it almost looks like it's wrapped in like a glass, doesn't it? Yeah. It's not. It's totally and utterly natural jewellery makers. So um, actually having those facets, incredible. It's such a skill. Like I said, only a couple of people on our planet can actually do it. Um, and it, it, in, historically, like we, we talk about this originally from Carl Fabergé. That's a big name, isn't it, in the gemstone yeah. world. Back in uh, 1910... Um, a journalist was actually interviewing Carl Fabergé. Now, if you don't know who Fabergé is, he's famous for his uh, eggs, of course. Um, so, um, and he said, what in your opinion will be uh, the popular jewelry in hundreds of years from now? Fabergé answered, faceted pearls. Of course, wow. everyone thought he was joking. That's back in 1910. Wow. Because obviously then, I was saying it, when I first started to do a jewelry maker, like, no, you can't facet a pearl. Mm. You can make shell pearls, of course, yeah. but you can't facet a cultured pearl. So back, imagine what it was back in uh, 1910. But again, yeah, we have discussed the fact that it, it closely resembles also, you know, like a peony, which mm -hmm. is my favorite flower, actually, a peony, um, before they bloom. Yeah. The I had those in my wedding bouquet. Oh, did you? Yeah, oh. peonies. Um, before they actually bloom, because they've got like, it almost appears to be like thousands mm. of petals, don't they? It just, it's absolutely miraculous. So um, it featured or launched rather at the AGTA Spectrum Awards. That's the, the world's finest jewelry uh, and color gemstone competition. That was the first time the world really started seeing them. Um, and it was pieces like this. Platinum Honours, sponsored Platinum Guild International, uh, recognised for outstanding use of platinum in coloured gemstones and a pearl jewellery with five uh, AGTA Spectrum Awards. Um, Katerina Perez wrote about them as well. Can I just say as well, your wow. faceted pearl is faceted so much better than those. Yeah. So much better. Um, but that's Katerina Perez, who's a big name in the jewellery insight, in the, in the jewellery world. Amazing. So much better, so much more precision in your in yours so much more luster as well in yours um but there was one gentleman as well he's got the most incredible blue eyes 
um, who um, who became um, sort of well the, the world's recognized name in this um, but anyway uh, rewind a little bit the Japanese factory uh, Komatsu diamond industry specializing in diamond cutting and have done since 1967 were the first to pioneer the technology their original goal was to find a way of sprucing up an ordinary looking Akoya pearls and that was because back then um, the Akoya pearls were on the decline in terms of desirability um, and they wanted a way to reinvent them and in um, one of their uh, experiments they tried applying diamond cutting technology to a pearl it took them 20 years to achieve the desired result mm. 20 years yeah, yeah. that's so, a lot of investment yeah exactly um, this gentleman um, who is Viktor Tuzlikov um, he said there's also exclusive exhibits showing um, showing off the work uh, of this amazing pearl cutter um, he is indisputably the master of it effectively um, Victor has cut in his in his career 20 pearls the master has only ever cut 20 pearls in his pursuit of perfect symmetry half of which can be seen decorating the jewelry of the Rus Russian designer I'm not Ilgiz I can't pronounce that um, some of which he donated to the Russian State Depository and the Kremlin Museum as prime example of top quality modern jewellery art and two have found their way into a private collection in America mm -hmm. 20 faceted pearls in his entire pearl cutting career so all of that information, big names and then on top of that the fact that this is a Tahitian pearl and the future decade harvests are, have all been bought out and we of amazing quality look at the overtones mm. remember tahitian pearls have never been more expensive than they are right now and that is because mm. there simply is no supply of it simply no supply when we were over in uh hong kong i say we like it was me it wasn't me um when the team were over in hong kong at the beginning of the year around about march time they were seeing individual tahitian pearls for five figures and that's what and that they were non-faceted how many of these do we have available, Roscoe? We have 15 available opportunities. When we say a closeout deal, if you've always wanted a faceted pearl, then this is the opportunity for you. If you're sat on the fence, I'm actually gonna say to you, don't dial through. Leave it to the people that really have always wanted a faceted pearl. Because I think the story the, the history of the faster pearl yeah. how it's developed plus the fact that it's a tahitian you need we want it to go to people that absolutely have, have wanted appreciate it. yeah um i've got 15 available and you will never 15. see a better deal than today wow we originally had 170 170 wow. when you consider the 20 that the master mm. actually cutted cutted cut cut <laughs> we're going to do a massive closeout deal the auction oh my gosh is live and the reality is 499 pounds is already absolutely incredible we've got 15 available wow 15 available opportunities once they're gone they're gone all you need to do is attach a peg bail that's it yeah attach a peg bail we've got Susie shopping well done Susie she knows her pearls yeah and, and or Susie as a member of staff, you are better off shopping right now. In this auction, you are better off shopping. Because we get perks with, as members of staff. We do get a little bit of discount. On uh, Quite often, though, the show price is actually less than a, um, our staff discount. So it's something that we do regularly check. That's why yes. we speak to our call centre quite a lot. Um, what's, the, what's the lowest price that it's been to previously? <laughs> um, so jewellery makers, Susie, you are better off shopping during this auction because you're going to get a massive closeout deal. You aren't alone, by the way. I've got other collectors getting involved. It's half drilled. Susie's got three in the suite. That's only because Susie's only allowed to get three. I'm yeah. sure she'd have got more if she could. If she could. Are you ready? A huge closeout deal. That's unbelievable. <gasps> what? It's nowhere near the closing. <gasps> what are you doing, Ross? That's why Dave closed it. I mean, that's epic. That's absolutely epic. The fact we're going even lower than that today. Wow. I see what you mean now, Ross. I see why you said, look, if you are on the fence on this, don't. Yeah. 
Leave it to those people who absolutely do, have always wanted to own a faceted pearl or a Tahitian pearl and never had the chance. I, I think of all the pearls I've seen faceted, I've seen a couple faceted. The Tahitian, the colours you're getting yeah. from that Tahitian. You see the, un uh, you see the undertones, yeah. don't you? For the Gemporia birthday last year, this was played with Dave at 99.99 really today for the last 15 oh my gosh oh no 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 i'm, I'm no oh i knew it ross what and with everything that's happened with yeah. tahitian pearls we should have elevated our price shouldn't we we can't you've got to remember in the jewelers jewelry jewelry industry it's how much is it going to cost to replace it mm. we can't replace it quite simply so it's not going to be 99 pounds definitely not going to be 49.99 we oh had gosh. look look, look take, take, check this out so for reference these strands that we have provided in uh, with the colors that yours display are selling right now for fifty thousand dollars wholesale right now the tahitian pearl industry has changed overnight whole harvests have been reserved for the next 10 years a genuine conch necklace would be more affordable right now so we should be raising our prices shouldn't we because the demand globally is so 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 high uh, it's madness actually that we do this i know that's the whole ethos of the company and that's really what we've been built on but seriously it is actually madness because when have we never been able to replace tahitian pearls before mm. it's sold out congratulations um to every single one of you by the way the marbe pearls also sold out the tahitian faceted is sold out as well i've got oh these are beautiful um jimmy can you pass me this the second largest gold, the, the gold one. Not that one, that one, yeah. These are amazing. Today is going to be a wish list day. Oh, I can feel that for out, me. If you miss out, yeah. You will, don't, hopefully, just dial nice and early. You could use your early birds to knock these. You could. Oh, that would be interesting, wouldn't it? I know. I said this the other day when I was in... Um, when I was in the gem, I was chatting to our Gemporia colleagues the other day, and I was like, and Dave and, and Caroline was there, and obviously some of the team behind the scenes, and they were, we were talking about our favourite gemstones. I was like, well, it changes, doesn't it? It does change your favourite gemstone mm -hmm. on a regular basis. I said, but easily pearls are my number one at the moment, and this is why. Look oh, at, look, look at, at that, that pink from there. Look at that pink. <gasps> That's the most beautiful powder pink I've ever mm -hmm. seen. Pink pearls, I'm right in saying wow. pink pearls. Well, Charlie certainly used to say this. Pink pearls are the most desired. Oh. Which tends to come with a price tag. Uh, well, yes, usually. And these are natural. 10 to 11 millimeter, totally natural pink pearls. Remember your virtues, jewelry makers. I know our viewers are, you know, very, are very knowledgeable on things like this, but remember your, fi uh, your five virtues, size, shape color ideally you want it natural nacre luster so those are the five virtues mm -hmm. technically there's more but we narrow it down to those another one though matching it yeah. will have taken years to acquire enough pearls to match a pink a natural pink strand it's easy to take culture pearls and bleach them and dye them that's yeah, fine yeah. not a problem that's why you can get it you can get it pretty uh, affordably however natural is where um the quality lies and the yeah. rarity lies look at the perfection of those this or how many do we have ross five this auction oh. is live even here, Ross, at £2,000 is already an amazing price. Straight away, four of these left. Congratulations, Hazel, not leaving anything to chance. These are absolutely breathtaking. Because it's got a really, oh, a lovely, soft, pinkish colour. Look at that. And obviously, this is just different lighting conditions, jewellery makers. Here in the studio, it's probably the most unsympathetic lighting yeah. conditions that we could possibly be in. Literally, we're under floodlights. Oh, and then... Durable. Yeah, yeah. Um, and yet they still look this breathtaking. Oh, look at that. That looks stunning. They really suit you well. Oh, Alison, I bought pills the other day. <laughs> I bought pills the other day. In fact, if I, I bet if I looked back on my staff orders, it's been pills, 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 <laughs> pills. Look at the quality. 
Look at, yeah, jadeite too. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely some of our sterling silver components. Look at those. And this is why, jewelry makers, we should have 18 karat gold. There, I've said it. Mm. This is why we should have 18 karat gold. Because if you knot this on a silk, keep it traditional, put it on 18 karat gold class, you're only complementing the quality of the pearls. There's nothing wrong with silver, don't get me wrong. However, when you've got pearls of this grade, I personally believe that they should go on, a, on an 18 karat gold class. Yeah. Um, that would be thousands of pounds if you were in Bond Street or Place Vendôme or Milan or any of those locations. 2,000 pounds is already an absolute steal, jewelry makers, already. But you can bet your bottom dollar that's not what we're stopping. They're massive too, aren't they? They're beautiful. Wow. I love those. I'm going to show you a previous closing price. And then we're going to go even lower. These are big pearls. Anything over double digit millimetres is a large pearl. And that'll be one pearl per oyster as well because of the size. That's the previous closing price, which is absolutely ridiculous in the best possible way. But today I've got five. We're going to bring you a closeout deal. It, again, for us to replace pearls, the pearl industry has been completely rocked lately. Obviously, it started really in the pandemic when supply obviously dr drastically reduced. It's going to, the estimate is going to take about a decade to recover from that. The demand went literally erupted overnight so the supply of pearls well china simply won't export them because mm. they, you know, they've got such an insatiable appetite for pearls in china and um, they can command whatever price they want remember we've shown you videos of of dave chatting to pearl suppliers freshwater pearls like these that the thousands of pounds at wholesale we're at 299 and we're going even lower wait 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 I'm going to put another 60 sec uh, 30 second clock on your screen we previously have closed these at 299 but we will go lower today. I've got three available. It's crazy to even suggest going lower for than 299. 10 to 11 millimeters and you get a full strand. When we've, we've even passed on experiences, I think it was Mark. Yeah, it was, it was Mark who was saying, who lives in beautiful Oxfordshire. And he was saying that I walk past a luxury jewelers and they even have a sign in their window saying there's no ju pearl jewelry available due to supply issues. Yeah. We are seeing it now, literally on the, even on the high street. I'm not saying these are high street pearls, jewelry makers. These are Yoko of London. These are Asile. Yeah. These are, you know, Blue Nile quality. These are, the ones that you would find absolutely in in uh, Hatton Garden, etc. Today, we will take it to a closeout deal price. Janet in Merseyside, Cumbria and Jane, you're all there. And I've got people on the phone lines as well. Madness. It's complete madness. Let's just have a little moment while you're making your confirmations for the full strand of natural pinks. They're not dyed. Natural pinks. What 199 will get you if you were to go in somewhere like Ernest Jones? It will get you potato pearls. It wouldn't get you pearls like this. No. Here we go. Have a look at this. These are purple. Okay. But that's not a bad price, actually. 3,150. 3, uh, we had to pull this production of the planned strand. The price went too crazy and the factory had quadrupled the price even after we agreed this collection, which has never happened. Oh, this is a supplier and basically it's happened before. Mm. Basically, a gemstone goes up. Remember Dave said the other yeah. day, if it's not physically on the water, then a supplier can go, no, you're not having it at that price anymore. Um, it's happened to has, us. Has happened it to has us. literally with peacock angel it's yeah. happened to us as well with the bangle wasn't it with the bangle yeah um this is in those realms anything that has natural color in the purple tone is thousands and whole harvests have been snapped up for years for lavender pearls we can only offer dyed moving forward um which will be the standard in the west i i mean oh that makes me sad isn't it they're like, no, the West, that should be your standard. Um, even planned orders are being cancelled because of the huge price increase since Hong Kong. Natural lavenders are through the roof. You're getting natural pinks. Natural mm -hmm. pinks, which comes under the lavender umbrella, obviously. Through the roof. We have spoken about this before, you know, unless, unless I think Dave said it the other day when we had black uh, Cotan. Black Cotan. Black he was Cotan. Like, yeah. Wow. 
Had this have been intercepted, if you like, prior to it being on the water, he doesn't think it would have even landed. Yeah. Um, you can do it, jewelry makers, but you need to be quick. It's a clock to close because we're not going any lower on these. The size, the fact they're natural, they're not dyed, the spherical beauty. I know it doesn't. I know it doesn't say it on your graphics, but I would call these near round pearls. Mm. Most definitely. Um, so the measurement for sure, the luster, let's not forget that, the quality of the luster, it would have taken them years to yeah. match this strand. Um, 40 seconds, we're gonna have to move wow. on. So, um, I mean, I'm tempted, Ross, to be honest. Well, it's such a good price. Exactly, 199. I'm not gonna get natural pink pills for no. 199 anywhere else. Um, Dorothy, you've done it. I've got one left. Janet, you've done it. Hazel, you've done it. I've got Jane, Joan, London, Cumbria. Who's gonna get that last one? Gone. Well done. They're absolutely stunning. You beat the clock. Well done. Now your early bird coming up, jewelry makers. Um, love it. I absolutely love this. And I love the fact that jewelry maker, we can bring you the finest quality gemstones, but we'll also bring you the components that bring it all together. Yeah. Um, these are your early bird. You get all three of them. Um, metallic threads. Just Bunkin. masses that you can do with these, Alison. Oh, I mean, these threads are stunning. So you can macram it. Well, you can, you can, you can uh, thread them. Mm -hmm. Use them as threading material. Like you say, if you want something a bit more glitzy with your knotting, they'd be great with your knotting material. Very nice. Macrame with them. I've macrame with them before. Stranding is massive. Multiple, multiple. Um, they're called um, abacus. Yes. Jewelry. So you've got multiple strands with oh, a nice. few beads yeah, yeah, yeah. on each. Like an you they said look, crochet uh, earlier on. You I can like crochet. That idea. You can knit with them. Um, you can you can um, kumahimo with them. Yeah. You can get the finest finest kumahimo uh, braid, or you can bulk them up by doing multiple strands yeah. Yeah. in each in each. Well, uh, you know, we need our cords and our threading mm. materials. And actually, it's been a good period of time since we've had any. Yeah. So um, this is coming up as your early bit at the top of the hour. You can shop ahead on these. Um, we've got quantity of these, right? Oh, we have. We've got 220, but I was expecting it to be about 400 mm. to 500. Because people won't just buy one. You know no, you're going to need the thread. Buying. You know you're going to need the cord to actually knot it together. Um, mm. So do shop ahead on those lovely jewellery makers. And don't forget, you've got stunning kits coming up in the 9 o'clock hour with our lovely Azatazza as well. Um, the return of the Clover Closed Jump Ring. Say that fast. No. Clover Closed Jump Ring. No. No. <laughs> Shall I'm we? Not. Look at this beautiful jewellery coming up with our lovely Alison. Shall we do a box clasp? Oh, yes. But oh my goodness me, this is some box clasp. Oh. I can't. And we're going to stick with the closeout deals. Oh. I can't quite believe this has even been created. I don't even know how you would go about creating something like this. Something for your high end jewellery, most certainly. A box clasp. Mm hmm. In a gemstone. Oh, that's so clever. In a gemstone. Wow. That's a beautiful, rich, regal, love natural that. red garnet. <gasps> and then if I hold it, here we go, I'll hold it in that direction. It's brand new. How, what, why why are we doing it close out then? Seriously, you can see the box class there. That's amazing. It's almost like a door wedge, literally internally. Yeah. How do you do this? Very carefully. This is right up there. I mean, you've got a you've got a, a tiny little gemstone. Well, it's a big gemstone, but by comparison, mm -hmm. but you've got to get in and carve. This yeah. is this is one of the do you most. Think the mechanism of the yeah. box class. Okay, jewelry makers. We are at nine ninety nine already, and we're not done. Should we go lower? Should we stick with the closeout deals? It's been one of those Mondays. Oh. I like it. I like it. I, I, I like I like the closeout deals, Roscoe. Even though this is technically brand new, yeah. never been on your screens previously before. I'd put that with those rose pearls. Yeah, they'd be lovely. I was thinking mm. with the pearls, they'd be really nice. But what? That, I mean, that's that's a quality class on another level, isn't it? Yeah. Can you imagine? It's like, say, somebody comes to you for like a um, for a commission, mm -hmm. and they're like, okay, I'd love to have some knotted pearls. I'm saying, just using pearls as an example. Okay, yeah, amazing. Well, we can bring it to you on a tog, or we can put it on a magnetic class. We can put it on a bolt ring, or um, I do have bolt bo uh, box class, which are quite traditional. Amazing. Um, if you want to go up another level, then we actually have box class in a gemstone. 
seven pounds and 99 pence what? only 7.99 i know i would oh not be surprised. yeah i've just looked up there's loads of multi buyers on this yeah um, i would be doing exactly the same stock up because this has never been on your screens it's a brand new premiere have we got quantity of them 60. Mm. do you know what would be lovely and um, it's obviously not going to happen today wouldn't it be great if we could do these uh gemstone class in a different variety in lots of varieties yeah so if we actually had it in maybe malachi or yeah spinel and look amazing they would be incredible i shouldn't imagine many people can actually create them i've got 60 available jewelry makers oh. on your screen for the first time and most likely to be the last time uh makers bought two kate's bought two anna's bought two Dorothy's bought two, Renfusha's bought two, uh, Conway's bought two, Heather's bought two, Patricia's got two. You get the general gist. Third of the stock is gone. They're going to sell out today because I, no, I don't know how Ross is doing this, but we're going even lower. <laughs> Here it is, the box class. So hopefully you can see this. That's so clever. Look. So clever. Because it's one thing to drill the hole, but to actually get it so you've got that hook. Yeah, and and it be strong and secure. Yeah. Imagine that on your uh, on your pearl pieces of jewellery mm. or jadeite pieces of jewellery, because red always looks lovely, doesn't it? A little extra saving for you all, jewellery makers. I had sixty. I don't have sixty anymore. No. Six pounds and ninety nine pence. That's amazing. And I think you know the fact that you're able to offer. Um, I know I'm very much talking about sort of commissions and businesses here, which we're, which we're not all. I don't. I haven't got a business, but I do make jewellery to actually gift. Um, you know, um, from time to time. So imagine being able to say that. You know, that's a. I don't know. That's a. Um, that's an Amazonite necklace and that's a natural garnet clasp. Imagine that. Ooh, How look, beautiful. That would look lovely with the Amazonite. It would look lovely. And just being able to say, you know, it, it makes it almost invisible as yeah. you go round, yeah, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, that's a good point. It looks you almost invisible. Yeah, Absolutely good point. stunning. We had 60. Alison, they're not hanging around, are they? No. There's loads of people there. Patricia says, give me four. Elizabeth, give you. me two. Isla Man, two. John, two. And two. And in West Midlands, three, you get the idea. I think probably 80, 90% of you have chosen to multi-buy on this, and I don't blame you at 6.99. Well done, there's a little bit of a queue on the phone lines for me. Maker in Kent, if you want seven, I would definitely check them out. I only had 60. Um, so, and there's a lot of multi-buyers getting involved. <laughs> Sorry, I think I just, uh, Steve's just walked past. It's probably looking at, looking at Ross's silly deal. Like, what's that? Ross, you've just done a box class, 6 99 What are you doing? A gemstone box class. A genuine gemstone box class. What are you doing? Are you mad? Yeah, we're coming down the stairs now. Are you mad? Um, well done, everybody. Uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets, everyone. Again, visualise the piece of jewellery. Visualise it maybe it's with... Look amazing. Some black spinel. I think this would look incredible. Would. Oh, it's sold out. Um, no it's sold out. There. Should we do one more naughty deal? <gasps> Let's do it. A ready. A oh yes. Oh, I love this. Um, I thought these had sold out. I was going to get one of these for my <coughs> husband. Oh, excuse me. Roscoe, can I ask for that information on bamboo? Because this is a made-up piece of jewellery, and I think this is a great gift for someone, particularly the men in our lives. And let's be honest, ladies, we get spoiled with jewellery, we don't do. we? We do. Uh, the men in our lives deserve spoiling as well. Um, this is natural, Olmec Guatemalan jadeite. The mine closed. Um, it has closed, not, not because it's deplete, it hasn't deplete. However, they have discovered an ancient Mayan mask, which does mean that um, the mining operation hopefully temporarily, and I can't say that for certain, um, has stopped because obviously this is hugely significant historically. Mm. But as you can see, you have this amazing piece of carved bamboo. If you want to deconstruct this, you absolutely can, but I think it'd be a shame to do so. I think that's a lovely bracelet that's lovely. as is. So what is it about bamboo and why is it so symbolic? Um, because it has got great meaning to it. And I love this write up. So we'll read it together. Uh, what can we learn from bamboo? Both China and Japan's cultures have long regarded bamboo as a defining element because it provides the means to sustain all aspects of human life, including food and shelter. 
Bamboo is the most popular plant in China, where it is considered a gentleman with vir perfect virtues. It combines upright integrity with accommodating flexibility, and it has the perfect balance of grace and strength, or yin and yang. Bamboo personifies the life of simplicity. Bamboo is used in every phrase of Chinese living, yet it needs very little to grow and flourish. It produces neither flower nor fruit, and the hollow trunk reminds us of humility, with an open heart free of arrogance. Bamboo is a symbol of longevity because of its durability, strength and flexibility and resilience. It survives the harshest conditions, still standing tall and staying green year, uh, year round. When the storm comes, bamboo bends in the wind. When the storm ceases, it resumes its upright position. Its ability to cope with adversity and still stand firmly without losing its original ground is inspirational. Its flexibility and adaptability are lessons to us all that the secret of a long and happy life is to go with the flow i love that write-up and i think it says so much about this mm. gemstone this is beautiful too the young branches at the top of a bamboo trunk will not grow at the same angle as the older branches below in order to allow sunlight for their elders. When the young shoots emerge from the roots, they are under the shade of the older bamboo branches. Such a spirit reflects the young respecting the old as well as the old protecting the young. Oh, I love lovely. that. And who knew just, you know, this, this, this trusty plant could mm. teach us all so much, so many lessons in life. So, I mean, if you, again, if you wanted any of that information, I could certainly send it to you. But what a lovely, lovely uh, meaning behind the yeah. actual bamboo plant it is. It's a stunning piece of jewellery. I've got five of these available. I thought these had sold out because I did want to get hold of one for Tom. Um, I think it'd be a nice gift for him. It would be, yeah. I might have to de-strand it, maybe add a few more gemstones in there, but that's easily done, isn't it? Yeah. You could put maybe a couple of, I don't know, maybe some of our quartzite jade that's coming up either side of the bamboo. Contrast it nice. with a little bit of yellow, maybe. You could put some of your faceted cubes in there to, to, to make it that bit larger or smaller, whichever way you wish. We're at £799. Now, again, let's put our jade hats on. Whether we're talking Burmese, Kotan, Guatemalan, whichever it might be, whether we're talking your quartzite jade, we're talk looking at colour yes but also translucency remember we want to be able to see that light absorb in the gemstone it should look like a melting ice cube effectively um tick. and you can see that surface <laughs> luster yeah big tick i've got five and already i've got collectors getting involved now it's 799 pounds for guatemalan which is the only place in the world that forms in this beautiful teal color the carving on its own 799 is not unrealistic and these are seven millimeter rounds, jewelry makers. At Jewelry Maker, this is a phenomenal deal. But not today. I'm gonna miss out now, aren't I? Yep. <laughs> That's a, it's a phenomenal deal right there. Again, to put this into perspective, we only ever made 29. Wow, yeah. There was only a that's how that's how rare the gemstone is. Remember Guatemalan jade forms much smaller than other varieties. So that would be a big piece of Guatemalan rough to actually create the bamboo on its own. Um at 149, that's an unbelievable deal. Again, look at the quality of the jade, look at the lovely translucency, the water content, which is often why we refer to sort of snow, ice. Um, water jade or fei chi jade you can really see it with the guatemalan location today close out deal <gasps> at 99 pounds and 99 pence unbelievable not wow. the meaning behind the bamboo but you might just like bamboo you might not care about the meanings of the actual gemstone uh, sorry of the of the shape or the um design itself you might think oh, yeah, i'm not bothered about that bamboo meaning longevity i just like the plant i like the design i've got barbara there on the phone lines janice you've got yours as well i've got new customers getting involved well done barbara i only had five libby and diane on the phones we can see you there libby's presser option one well done libby it's absolutely beautiful christmas is not far away if there was more i'd get this for my nephew because he's ever since he was a little boy he's collected pandas he's got hundreds and Has hundreds he? of pandas i mean he's now six foot five and and 25 but he's still got That'd all his pandas and that would be he does wear he wears a leather 
uh, cuff, but that would be a lovely addition That'd be a lovely to that. Lovely gift to it, to her to give him. Yeah, it, it's ninety three <gasps> days oh until my gosh. Christmas. I mean, Adam, Adam, <laughs> I've ordered my turkey. <laughs> I like to be organised for Christmas, okay? I do, yeah. I like to be organised for Christmas. Just but also, you know, I've got to watch the purse strings. That December paycheck's going to last a long yeah. time. A long time. <laughs> and we're all there at the end of January, literally like that. Uh, Beans on toast, everyone. Yeah. Beans on toast. You tonight. can afford toast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna push the boat out and sprinkle a bit of cheese on there. Oh, um, get you. your Christmas presents in nice and early. I've got one of these left. I've got Norman there, Janet, and I've got an anonymous maker. You can all do it. It's the last one. We've taken it a third off that price tag for you wow. today, jewelry makers. If you don't, I will. And, and if you like Guatemala, make sure you're watching the next hour. And it's on four way slippy. It is on four way Wow. Slippy amazing isn't it that yeah we've got fab. the most beautiful guatemalan uh, jadeite coming up in the next hour as well jewelry makers so make sure you're watching at nine o'clock um has norman done it no i don't i know um okay oh is it time it's time for <gasps> your early bird jewelry makers we're gonna get just a little bit sparkly why not as it's 93 days till christmas but also these are absolutely integral for every single jewelry maker aren't they you know mm. we will need it's easy <coughs> to get swept up in the romance of your beautiful gemstones which you know never never i hope that never changes but we must never uh, forget the essential components that bring it all together your findings your threading material this is coming up jewelry makers right now your early bird you get all three spools coming up next <laughs> just dawned on me i'm just thinking out loud uh -oh. now and it, uh, yeah <laughs> exactly sometimes when i do watch uh, when i do think out loud you're like i come out with something and everyone pulls this face at me <laughs> what are you talking about no but when you buy silk mm -hmm. which silk is obviously traditional yeah yeah you buy it on the cards don't you and it's yes. two meters usually you get two meters on a card yeah how many meters do we know are on these spools because there's got to be hundreds You look, you're looking at 90 metres. That's a lot of knotting. Oh gosh, yeah, that's a lot of cord. That will go a long, long, yeah. long way. And even more than that, I mean, I love silk, don't get me mm -hmm. wrong, because I love the fact that it's very traditional. I am literally still thinking out loud, but you've got that beautiful metallic addition into this yeah. as well. So it's gonna really add that pop, almost like there's a, um, a precious metal bead in between. Yeah, it's almost like um, shot. Sh you, you've got the silver thread through it it's almost, through haven't it, you? Yeah. It's Absolutely beautiful. unbelievable jewelry makers. Now, and I'll open one of these if you want. I say that, now I've said that, now I've got to put myself under pressure, haven't I, because I've got to find the end. Oh, there it is. I have put myself under pressure. But you can, you can use this the threading material with all of your gemstones, certainly your pearls as well. But can you see on that tweezer if I do it that way? Do it that way. It's a lovely thickness that will go through all of your gems. And even when you single it down to one single piece, you, you can see that silver running through the, uh, the, the cord itself. Totally. Ah absolutely amazing but Alison you touched on this earlier on I could use this for macrame kumahimo tassels yeah, yeah. oh a tassel That'd why not nice. you can use it with your bead embroidery you can actually use it to embroider with yeah that's a good point you could almost sew yeah. with it crocheting I think that's a great yeah. idea as Crochet well with it. and and you know as we have 93 days till Christmas you'll be going to be looking for that extra sparkle aren't you yeah could you imagine um, instead of using that sticky tape actually doing some kumahimo with this and getting some beautiful cord that you're going to tie up your presents with that's going to look amazing lovely yeah really beautiful i all every year i struggle with christmas cards because mm -hmm. you've only got so much 
space, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. And back in the days, well, certainly when I grew up anyway, you used to hang them across the wall, didn't you? Yeah, we still with a, do. With a piece of string. And um, I, do you remember that? And I keep thinking, why haven't I done that again this year? Literally just hang them ac across, mm -hmm. across the wall. You could do it with this, yeah, couldn't you? Yeah, be good. Now, these are already going on pre-order. You are looking at 90 metres in length, 0.2 millimetres. So it's a nice fine silk, but you could very easily double that up. I think that's per spool. I think know. it is as well. I think it's 90 metres per spool. Yeah. Yeah. I think you're looking at there 270 metres. Mm. Just because you can feel it, Ross. You can feel how thick it is. There's a lot on that spool. Jewelry makers, we always need our threading material, don't we? There's nothing worse than wanting to make a piece of jewellery. I don't know whether it's a knotted necklace, whether it's a, ma a mala, whether it's kumahimo, whether you're incorporating it into Alison's designs that are coming up, both in the 9 o'clock and yeah. the 12 o'clock. Yeah. You know, and you haven't got the threading material there. And, and actually, of late, certainly, jewellery maker, we've been a little bit light in threading, haven't we? Now, we are going to bring it to you the most epic, unbelievable early bird deal, jewellery makers, as always, true to form. Straight away, we've got people trusting the process. That's £10 a spool. No, I don't know. I haven't been there lately. But if you pop into that other very big hobby place, well, you can get threads and cords, can't you? Mm -hmm. I don't think they're a tenner each. No. I think they're probably more. No, not a tenner each. I've bought ribbon before Jewelry Maker had ribbon back in the day. Um, and now I'm still well stocked on ribbon. And you buy it by the meter. Yeah, absolutely. By the meter. Are you ready? Because we are not stopping anywhere near that price tag. The next price crash is still, wow, sorry, I had a little sneaky peek. It's still not your deal. You know that you are gonna need thread. Yeah. You've got that beauty of that wonderful silver running through it. I thought of something else. Go on. Well. I can't remember, was it your girls in a party and they had their hair braided? Mm -hmm. You could use this. And that's a nice idea slightly off the wall um my friend's got a very, very full beard and he would buy he does bind his beard he could bind it with oh, that yeah, and perfect. he would bind it with that perfect yeah you can almost braid it into your hair yeah not what you're paying jewelry makers we're not stopping here true early bird price tag never mind 10 pounds each you're also not going to pay five pounds each wow that's a lot of meters of thread that you that can create is. with your jewelry makers and if you think about a classic knotted pearl necklace for example um you'll use two meters at be at most at most you've got i think it's 270 meters in total i i think that three spools of all your three colours there. Janice, Elaine, Gigi, uh, Justine, Tamina, Cheryl, Irene, Cumbria, Joe, Jill, Maker, Angela, new customers. Multiply, absolutely. You're not restricted at all. You can get as many of these as you wish. We haven't even got sort of a cutoff point. You know, sometimes with certain, certain auctions we have to, we have to say, okay, nobody's allowed to buy more than three or 10, for example. There's no cutoff point on these. And it's definitely something we're gonna use over and over and over again. Um, it's been, I can't remember the last time I actually brought you any kind of threading material like this on a spool. Mm -hmm. Silk we sometimes see in projects or in kits. Yes. But I can't remember the last time I brought you an individual threading material opportunity. When was the last time you saw Fireline? When was the last <laughs> time you saw Wildfire? Or Flex Right? Or Tiger Tail? 12.99 wow that's for all three spools that's the purple brilliant. the teal what i would describe as a teal um and then that lovely sort of chocolate brown um multi buyers getting involved there as well with that wonderful wonderful glistening sparkle perfect for this time of year when we start reaching for it i suppose yeah start yeah. needing that little bit of extra sparkle little bit of sparkle well, yeah it does, and it's subtle as well yeah. at the same time almost like they have that precious metal presence also if you decorate for halloween this would make great um cobwebs oh that's a lovely idea mm. yeah the purple in particular would be mm. absolutely fantastic oh gosh yeah oh we're working halloween this year you know that yeah we work in Halloween. Yeah. I love Halloween, but it does mean I have to go on the school, uh, school run looking very questionable. <laughs> <laughs> I have to turn up on the school run dressed up as whatever it is. Um, I, I remember once I needed to put petrol in my car after a show and um, I forgot to do it in the morning. 
and then had to go to a petrol pump, um, literally dressed up. And I was like, I know. Eh? What were you? I was, it was with Mark and I was dressed up as, oh, I can't remember. We had the hat and the, and the it's like Beetlejuice almost. Um, okay. Today, we're not happy with the twelve ninety nine price tag jewellery makers just because, you know, eh, it's a funny price. Eh. Should we get it under £10? Yes. Should we, should we last Go a nice on. easy figure, isn't it? A nice easy sum. Um, also makes my math a lot easier as well because under £10 today, Mary says, give me two. Carol says, give me two. Denise says, give me two. Cumbria's got three. Well done. Loads of multipliers have got full rows of names, jewellery makers, because we know that we will use them. Yeah. We know we will. Crocheting, I think, is a lovely idea. Crochet is going to look amazing. Whether you're going to do, um, you know, like um, the Katie Parker, Parker yeah. style necklace or whether you're going to do um, a full on bit of crochet with it. Yeah. You could actually crochet a top with it. That'd be nice. Mm. Crochet. Yeah. Now, the purple definitely for crochet gloves, fingerless gloves oh, for Halloween. Wow, that would be absolutely beautiful, yeah. wouldn't it? What about crocheting like bracelets yeah. and necklaces? Crochet nice and bracelets. soft to wear as well. We're going even lower just because we want it to be a nice round number, jewellery makers. It's already epic, isn't it? At £12.99. Mm. I mean, what's that working out? £4 something each. Um, unbelievable. For a, for a spool, basically, you get all three, all three colours. You haven't got to choose. It's not, it's not um, this price tag for just one. It's nine ninety nine wow. for all three of them. Three pound thirty three. I don't know if you can get a reel of cotton for that, can you? No, I don't I know don't. if you can. If you pop into your supermarket, quality. can you get no? Can you get no. a reel of cotton for that price? Um, but here we are bringing you beautiful metallic uh, metallic thread, 0.2 millimeters in its thickness. Um, plus, you've actually uh, got the three three colours. Sorry, I'm laughing because Adam has just said this might surprise you, but I've never bought a reel of cotton. Have you not? No, you, Jimmy. Have you never need? Have you not, Ross? Have you never had to put like a button on? But there's always some knocking about. <laughs> well, who buys it then? It's it's the cotton fairy. The cotton fairy. <laughs> it's always in a chocolate tin. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. So have you never had to like hem something or no? Unbelievable. <laughs> no, no, clearly not. Um, um, oh, yeah, I've bought cotton loads of times. Uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets. I am a cotton fairy, clearly. Uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets, jewellery makers. Now, coming up, <laughs> Adam says, I'll just use yours. Coming up after the break, jewellery makers, it is the return of the absolutely yes. beautiful closed clover oh, the jump, jump rings. rings the jewelry that Alison has made is absolutely stunning i mean these are connectors in my head aren't mm. they i know we've called yes, them jump rings but they are connectors they are and you get different sizes as well which i think you is do. absolutely wonderful um that gemstone that you're admiring there we've actually got it in two separate projects so one of which this one right now is natural type a guatemalan jadeite unbelievable the inkiest of blacks that you get from guatemala and then in the other project it's some of the finest malachite that you could stunning. wish to own stunning quality and this, they're both graduated jewelry makers as well the strands which we don't see very often do we nope. so make sure you tune in don't go anywhere wonderful inspiration and talent from the gorgeous allison coming up next <laughs> Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Are you ready to elevate your jewelry making to new heights? Join us for season three of Britain's Next Gem and bring your creative vision to life. Our expert panel is on the lookout for one outstanding jewelry maker to invest in. Think you have the talent and drive? Apply today and make your dream a reality. 
To apply, you must be aged 18 and over and be available to travel to the Jewellery Maker Studios on the 18th and 19th of September. Please send your name, your jewellery making specialities, images of your designs and a bit about yourself to guestdesigner at jewellerymaker.com. Good luck and we look forward to seeing you in the next round. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know that you can shop for pre-show deals on Jewelry Maker? Head over to jewelrymaker.com every day between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m., click on Watch Live, scroll down for brilliant products, last of stock items, and amazing deals. But these deals are only available for one hour, and once they're gone, they're gone. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Hi, Alison Tarry here. Just giving you the heads up of what's coming up on Monday's show. It is going to be amazing. We've got um, what's left of the uh, quadrifoils, the Alhambra inspired jump rings. They're coming up in the nine o'clock. And then in the 12 o'clock, oh my gosh, look at this cord. It is incredible. Hang on. That, is that. that of course is my favorite, obviously. But I don't have favorites because they're all gorgeous colorways coming up in the 12 o'clock we've got findings to fit it's going to be fabulous if you have dexterity issues perfect for you and just just tune in don't miss it bye sorry <laughs> As a tazza. sorry about the framing of that vt that's all good so we should have done it for you well i didn't like to disturb people people were all working you i was so excited about the cord i know they're gorgeous Absolutely. they are gorgeous coming up at 12 o'clock that's what alison was talking about today it was but now i tell you what i'm looking forward to this hour though <gasps> this i remember stunning. the first ever time we brought you what we would describe as a clover jump ring because as jewelry makers that's what they are i suppose but this is also a connector, isn't it? Because mm. it's a really lovely feature and a design. You could literally just lark said not onto either end. Which is which is what I've done on most of these. They're just stunning. Those earrings are gorgeous. So easy. I mean, those those are just jump rings between. Those are the easiest makes you're ever going to make. Add two jump rings and you're done. But look at them. They're absolutely stunning. Yeah, high end. Yeah, very high end loving that mm. and it goes to show doesn't it you know if you look at places like van cleef and arpels and you go to places like um i always pronounce it wrong bucolati with, with the opera which i think have got similarities then most definitely most definitely uh um their jewelry is is quite simple in terms of yeah. its construction oh oh jewelry makers before <gasps> oh. we go anywhere sorry um have you clocked it? Yeah. Um, I bought, you get that? I bought, I bought it on the weekend. It was played <gasps> on the weekend. I saw those. And um, it just arrived. And I want to show you because it's absolutely insane. This that is Bullseye is Malachite. Stunning. 
So a ready-made bracelet. I know. Look out! Look at the quality of that malachite. Oh, it's incredible. A uh, really. Ross is just saying <gasps> um, because obviously on the back of your purchase, Sally says we've got a small quantity of these left. So we'll repeat this what auction time? tomorrow. Probably <gasps> in the nine o'clock hour. Right. Aren't they lovely? Well, if it's raining in the morning, we won't be moving. So you're going to get to watch. As so long as we get a signal. Look at that. And beyond. Look, look that's at that. just amazing some of the best marks I've seen <gasps> look at that one look at that one there that yeah. one there put every single one's a bullseye look which is him. like the centre of the rings of a tree yeah. if you like. that's the that's and it's natural and well, you can't I mean we've 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 discussed this before a few years ago you can't fake that no because it it looks fake. It looks fake. I've you seen can't some of the, fake that. I've seen some dreadful fake yeah. Malachi in my time. It actually makes me angry. Yeah. I was like, stop it. The gemstone's so beautiful. Yeah. Don't absolutely. fake it. Don't fake it. Um, yeah, we're actually going to play it tomorrow. And <gasps> if you love Malachi, we've got incredible Malachi coming yes. up in this hour as well. Um, so the return of your beautiful four-leaf clovers. Yes. Gorgeous. We've brought you more in gemstones than we actually have in precious metal mm. um, recently. But... I mean, Alison, every single one of these pieces, I love these earrings where you've just got one at the yeah. bottom of, a, uh, of, of a, a gemstone round. Well, no, because the top of it's all the little ones. And what, these are? Yeah, yeah. No way. Yeah, yeah, so you've got the little ones above. So you get masses then, Alison. Yeah. Get absolutely masses of them and the different sizes. Mm -hmm. All in your one project. Obviously, I've shown you these earrings. But look at this beautiful necklace as well made by our lovely Alison, which has... The gold-plated sterling silver. You see a little bit of the, the, the graduation as well of that necklace. Um, and then you fe put feature clovers here. Amazing. Now, you get everything that you need, really, Alison, mm. in this project. I mean, you might want to add a clasp, I suppose, yeah. or the occasional yeah. timing, depending on what your You could do a sliding is. clasp if you wanted. True, true. But like you have done with this amazing yeah. bracelet just here. I love that here. as well. Um, but I have to say, each of these components really comp. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. I hadn't realised they were clovers too. Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, look at that. How have you got them on there then? Because they're all jump closed. Rings. Yeah, well, I've used little jump rings between. You've used a little teeny. Yeah. Ah, oh, clever. The smallest jump rings I could. Little three mil jump rings. You're a clever egg. What I haven't done, which I'd like to try as well, is soldering them. Yeah. So you could solder those, have a big one at the front of a ring and solder the little ones together to make the, to the make ring the shank. shank. That would look amazing. Yeah, just what, a little bit of your um, silver paste? Just a little bit of paste, yeah. Oh, that would be, oh, what about a bangle? Yeah. Wow, wow. You're not soldering a solid bangle. Yeah. Because you get masses, don't you? You can you get, always graduate you get it round. Yeah. Would look amazing, wouldn't it? That was Adam, that was. I know. See, I Adam, you are a jewellery maker. You are a jewellery maker, Ads. <laughs> You've got no, all the ideas. He'll be a jewelry, he's a jewellery designer. He'll be a jewellery maker when he makes the bangle. When he makes that bangle. In theory, <laughs> he says in his head he's, he can do it. Um, right, I just heard Ross go, right, okay. I think, I think that's because he's just... I think I, I'd like to think I know Ross. And, he's, and I think that right, okay, is almost like acknowledging how good the price is. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to think that's him acknowledging, oh my God, this is an amazing deal. It is, isn't it? See, I do know you. I wouldn't say you're transparent, I just know you. Know you well. There are two projects, two gemstones for you to choose from. If you can't choose, I would encourage getting both. They are, it's all precious metal. And the two gemstones are some of the finest that we actually have within our vault. Mm. That's not an overstatement, jewelry makers. So. We are talking about natural type A Guatemalan black jadeite. Incredible. Firstly, can I just say, if you were to ask my humble opinion, it is only my opinion, you don't have to take this information um, if you don't wish. Of your black jadeites, I mean, it's some of the most lustrous that I've ever seen. Some it of the is. most transparent. It's almost like liquid black. Yes. Isn't it? Isn't it funny how it's like, like, not all blacks are black. No. Not all blacks are the same. Well, There's well, different shades. Well, look at the black board, and then you've put the black Guatemalan on top of it. And it's blacker. And all, it's blacker, yeah. It's darker in colour. Yeah. The quality is... I, I want to show that, actually, Alison. You've just made well, a really good Well, add the cord. Point. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. So here's your... Black. Beautiful 
jet, what I would describe as a jet black cord. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, lovely. Blacker. But that is blacker. It's great, isn't it? And that is also totally natural. You have a full wow. graduated strand. That's amazing, isn't it? Now, for those of you that maybe, I don't know, maybe you've been traveling around the world and haven't seen Jewelry Maker for a while, and uh, you've stepped back into the family and, and we've said, okay, oh, news update, Jewelry Makers on Guatemala and Jade. You know, it was kind of, uh, the lost treasure of Guatemala was rediscovered in the 1980s by the Ridingers. Um, fantastic, but, um, and at first nobody believed them and that, that they'd actually rediscovered it bring it to fast forward to the current day now obviously the burmese mine closed so what literally happened is the burmese closed mine closed in 2020 um the bulk of the mining uh um miners actually literally up sticks and relocated to guatemala because okay that's got the best the most burmese quality in the world so we're going to go there and we're going to use our experience to actually mine this gemstone and to uh, carve this gemstone. That's why you've seen some amazing Guatemalan carving. So they've done that. They've relocated. And then a discovery happened. Um, during the excavation of these beautiful gemstones, of course, um, it's much smaller operation than that of what Burma, uh, the Burmese mine yeah. was. So much smaller setup they discovered an ancient Mayan mask. Amazing. Now, historically, yeah, it's incredible. The Mayans are quite uh, um, an unknown entity, I would yeah. say. We know very Mysterious. little about them, yeah, as a civilization. So this is hugely significant historically. So what basically your archaeologist, which I always imagine this, do you th have you ever watched an archaeologist? Yes, I've got a few friends who are archaeologists. Have you? Yeah. They don't rush anything, do no, they? Let's be honest. No. And they're not Slow going to. Slow and steady. Well, you can destroy stuff if you don't, if you rush it. Literally, the little, little brushes. Little brushes, you've got to brush it all off. Yeah, you can't go, come on, chop, chop. Photo it in situ. Yeah. Make sure you and get all... And can't even use yeah. your standard photographs and things like that, nope. can you? It's all very, I know, amazing. So, so basically, here is the photo of the discovery of the ancient Mayan king's mask, which they've discovered. 1,700-year-old jade mask was found inside a tomb of the Mayan king. Located in Guatemala, the tomb also held rare mollusk shells, carvings, and other funeral offerings. Now, I don't know. Wow. Again, this is just all in my head. This is obviously a documentation from the Smithsonian Museum. In my head as well, they're not going it's, to... It's, if it's in um, a king's tomb, mm -hmm. funeral tomb, it's not just going to be those bits, is it? No. They're no, going to find lots of offerings. More. Yeah. So um, I don't. We don't know. The reality is, we don't know when or even if it will actually resume. Mm. So the lost treasure of Guatemala that was discovered, rediscovered rather in the 1980s, they might have to close it. Yeah. Because if you find enough significant artifacts, if you like, then that's surely becomes like a historically yeah. relevant location. And if you think about it, if you go to Egypt. Yeah. Where they found a tomb. Yeah. You've now got a whole valley of them. Yes. So what happens if this isn't the only king that's buried there? True. Very, so, very true. So, you know, you started off with one with one pyramid. I, I just think for me... And they're still discovering it, them. It would almost be naive of us to think that this operation is going to set up again anytime mm. soon. I think it would be quite naive. Um, anyway, yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. I think maybe w what we have at the moment, certainly it's irreplaceable. There was no Guatemalan jade at any of the big gem fairs this year. None whatsoever. Right. Because the mine has literally, literally shut the doors. Not because it's deplete. We're not saying it's deplete. It's not deplete, but it is closed. And it's closed because of this, these yeah. huge news headlines that are actually impacting the gemstone. Massively significant finds. The GIA write about this quality, the quality that you're about to see, which is, remember, all jade is um, technically not black, black, black. It's actually a greenish black. And that's because it has, it's actually that, like the, um, it's transitioned through all of yeah. those colors. So... It's actually a very, 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 very a very, very dark, inky green. Um, and they say in recent years, 
a new kind of Guatemalan jade has entered the Chinese jewelry market when it is called Fei Chi. Fei Chi, you've certainly heard me use that, mm -hmm. um, use that description before. Uh, prior to the availability of Fei Chi, uh, Chinese consumers had a negative impression on Guatemalan material and preferred Burmese jade. However, the recent emergence of this new high quality blackish green jade has, jade has attracted the attention of Chinese buyers. And Stanley Chu has been writing about it, hasn't it, and talking about this variety as well. Stanley Chu is like a, it, it, well, he's one of the biggest names in the jade world. Stanley was saying that now, top jade is top jade, whatever the country of origin. Do yeah. you remember Burmese mine closed, 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 800 years history, gone, done, dusted. Um, but again, let's just quickly read this out as well. Um, talks about sort of what your, whether it's Burmese, whether it's Guatemalan, wherever the location, whether it's Kotan that we launched the other day, um, what is dark jade and why is it is so highly valuable? The reason dark jade is very rare is because it requires a long time and very special conditions to form um, due to its natural chemical structure. We need to know here the color is not black, nor is it charcoal or gray. Dark ink color is not a natural base color in the universe and um, it takes a long time to grow from an emerald green to a deep black under the influence of cosmic rays so we are talking about a gem you know i've said this about uh um oh, i've gone blank what's the gemstone that's like tealy one of the rarest gems that we have grand did you right grand did you right so, so grand did that teal color is one of the rarest colors in the universe Right. Um, this is a similar similar color. It's very very rare to naturally form, naturally form, not dye. Um, but it still carries the nature of dark green under strong light. So technically speaking, a, pre a piece of true authentic dark jade requires billions of years to form from a dark green. Uh, sorry, from a green to a dark green, finally to a dark ink color, three times longer than all other jade colors in the world. It's and amazing. it cannot be replicated or accelerated time is the best evidence so you can't if you like take it to a gem lab and then encourage that color it has to happen literally by mother nature itself um, and again there's articles being published even though the mine is actually closed talking about a lot of Chinese jade miners now mining in Central America this was written by the way before the closure of the mine um, this is the greatest potential of all jade currently the future is Guatemala the acceptance is now certified here in Asia um, uh, this is Stanley by the way Stanley's words and is also listed as Fei Chi which was historically reserved exclusively only for Burma um, however like I said lots of Chinese miners relocated and now, then that Maya mask was discovered. We are bringing you Guatemalan jade, but jewelry makers, what we have is what we have. We can't replace it. And we can't, you know, we'd have loved to have said, yeah, don't worry, we went to Hong Kong and we got loads of beautiful Guatemalan jade. <laughs> Wasn't the case. There was literally nowhere selling it. Now, so you get the beautiful graduated strand. You get the cord, which I haven't seen one of those in absolutely ages. No, that's long cord. And then you get all of these closed four leaf clover jump rings which are are connectors in my head i think they are ross see these three here if they were an early bird what price do you think they would be you reckon we might do a deal like 14.99 for those three which would be unbelievable they're connectors aren't they mm. you don't just get those three we're not really talking about the clovers because we've got the Guatemalan, but really, yeah, we're almost doing them a disservice. But the deal on this is absolutely epic. You get, I agree, it's one of my favourite kits, I think. It's, it's stunning. The gold of the black gorgeous. Oh, so classy. Let's do clock to launch. So, wait a second, I get five of the large uh, clovers. Is it ten of the, of the medium size? Yeah. And then ten again of the small? How lovely are they? Even if you literally just connected them like Alison's done on a shepherd hook, job done. Yeah, thanks very much. Thank you very much, gorgeous jewellery. They are gold plated 925 sterling silver. These kits oh, would mix totally. beautifully. Yeah, you could use the gold with the, with the Malachite easily. You could use the silver with the Guatemalan. <laughs> Absolutely. You could mix them all together. Yeah, that would be Have a nice. super kit. That would be lovely. I actually can't remember, Ross, what you're taking this to. Do you know, I can't remember what it went to either. But you know what, I've just, I've just got in my head, you've got Guatemalan type A mm -hmm. jadeite, black jadeite, and you've got 
what is it? 10, 20, 25 connectors and the cord and the instructions, which I'll show you in a second. In 10 seconds, we've only got 50. It's a very exclusive kit though, jewelry makers. We haven't got that many. Um, look at that. Absolutely beautiful jewelry. Lovely components. 50 available. I think they're gonna be gone in a heartbeat, Roscoe. The strand alone, the strand alone, I think you'd be paying triple figures for. You get nine of the four millimeters, four of the eight mils, and then you get three of the 10 mil as well. Originally, we, were, we think about the launch of Guatemala and Jade, we were doing little packs of three, weren't we? Doing like packs of threes. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, we had 15 already, there's collectors getting involved. I, so in my head, Roscoe, the fact that we've got the connectors, which I don't want to call them jump rings because they are connectors, 25 of them. Wow. We normally do like a single motif. Yeah. Let's go really low and let's just say 10 pounds. Some of them might be 19, some might yeah. be 15, but let's go really low and say a tenner. Wow. I mean, yeah, yeah. For just one motif. That means for the jump rings alone, that you'd be talking about this price. Yeah, I don't think that's unrealistic. No. Even if we said five pound per clover motif. So that would make it 125 pounds. I'm not even factoring in the Guatemalan jade here. <laughs> we said those yeah. three, that's why I've singled them out over here. These three, if I was to bring them as an early bird, I'm sure we've done something similar. In the past, how much do you reckon, Ross? Fourteen ninety-nine. Just for these three. Yeah. There you go. Five pound per clover, and everything else for free. Wow. And but the Guatemalan jade for free. Like, when, on what planet are we? The mind's closed. Future is Guatemala, says Stanley. Or oh, it was the case. I genuinely think the strand with the graduation, which how often do we see that? Mm. Is going to be three figures, hundred pounds. That's epic. Let's say then, jewelry makers, you're buying your Taipei natural Guatemalan black jade eye. Yeah. And then you're going to get all of those connectors. Wow. And the cord and the instructions for free. Wow. Well, I reckon those earrings, the gold earrings near you. Yeah. You're looking at three figures for those. Yeah. It's one of the most popular motifs in the yeah, industry at the moment. Totally. The Falling Clover is one of the, you can't deny it, is even, even on our sister channel, massive. Yeah, it's everywhere. The Four Leaf Clover, absolutely everywhere. Would, I mean, let's be honest, if you were to look in any, any quality jeweler and you saw these earrings, one, two, five? Mm. Definitely. Yeah. I'd pay that, for sure. You could make these earrings multiple times over if you wanted yeah. and then use your gemstones for, for something else. The whole project today, jewellery makers, the whole project, close beautiful connectors. Wow. wow. I can't believe you've just said, buy the strand. <laughs> you're buying the strand. I think the strand would be more because it's graduated. And then you're getting 25 gold-plated 925 sterling silver four-leaf clover connectors. They're not open. They are closed as well. Um, and the cord and the instructions. Pardon? So if you pay a pound per jump ring, that's £25 off that price tag, and then you're getting that strand of natural type A Guatemalan jadeite for £75. When have we ever done that? That's incredible. This is one of the most affordable kits for what you're getting. And you'd never pay £1 no, per no. clover, would you? No, because can you imagine how to make those? <coughs> yeah. They're not, you know, it's not, not an easy. easy shape to make. Okay. How about if we said two pound per clover? Right. That's 50 pounds. Now you're getting the strand type A natural black Guatemalan jadeite for 50 quid. It's absolutely outrageous. But you're still not factoring in the cord and the instructions. No, I'm just disregarding the cord and okay. the instructions, aren't I? Which is ridiculous. Yeah. Not disregarding, that's the wrong word. Leaving them out of your calculation. Yeah. I know you're not disregarding them. You pay fifteen pounds for uh, an instruction. Mm -hmm. How, ma How many stages have I done? Do you know I can't remember? As a tazzer, it seems pretty weighty. Twenty-five 
29 steps Does in it? Alison's beautiful project. Look at this. You get that for free. On our sister channel, you don't get it for free. No, on the sewing street, you have to pay for your instructions, don't you? We're nowhere near our price, Alison. Can I just say, every single remember. one of those lovely viewers, Alison, that's taken the initiative, yeah. shopped ahead. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Yeah. Sit back. Because Smug we're look. literally, exactly that. That face. Smug. We're not stopping there. You've got a minute. If you haven't yet dialed, then now is the time to do so, jewellery makers. You get 25 of your closed clover i don't want to call them a jump ring no because for me they're a connector aren't they yeah um you could literally just pop one on a chain yeah absolutely you? Just one on a chain you and sell it for the price that's on your screen you get type a natural black guatemalan jade the mine is closed and i don't know when the mine is going to reopen and you get the cord and you get allison's amazing talent all those instructions for free <laughs> And we go even lower. Anna, Pauline, Marcia, Maria, Brenda, Margaret, Janet, Cumbria, Patricia, Kent, Ayrshire. There's still time, but it is running out. I only have 50 of these. If you love the Malachite, that's coming up. Nobody is paying 99.99. Oh, Ross. You're getting nervous now. I am starting to get a little bit anxious because it is Guatemalan jade. Mm. <gasps> Yeah, that's two pound per jump ring, and everything else for free. <laughs> or a pound per jump ring, and twenty five quid for your Guatemalan jade. Wow! And then your cord for free, and your instructions for free. I agree. I agree. Ross has just said it's one of the best price projects we've done. Yeah, twenty five pound for a Guatemalan strand is it's, ridiculous, that's madness, isn't, isn't it? it? And it takes billions of years. Mm billions of years to form Amazing. in this natural dark color it's not dyed it's not bleached i only have 50 jewelry makers you can get hold of it on your split pay as well for the strand alone that is absolutely ridiculous for the connectors alone that is absolutely ridiculous i'll go back to my original statement if i was to bring you these three mm -hmm. as an early bird which i'm fairly sure we've done or done something similar these three and we would say oh 15 pounds epic they would absolutely fly you're getting three of them we're get bringing you today in this project 25 oh, no. Gold plated 925 sterling silver. If you want to maximise, if you're selling and you want to maximise return on investment in these, I'd make them all into pairs of earrings. Yeah. And the smaller what jumpers. You, what would you sell those for? Probably getting. I'm I'm out of the market. You know me. You, you shouldn't ask me that because you know me. I would probably. I'd have a look around, depending on where I was selling them. Probably 60, 70, maybe yeah, that more. Yeah, a great price. I'd buy those. Yeah, 100%. I love them. They're very, uh, like, 100% I would wear those. Same with the Malachite. Yeah. You know, stunning. probably a similar, similar price. Absolutely stunning. Um, I know, I agree. Um, I could almost feel you thinking this, Ross. I, I could almost sense it. Ross is saying, I'm amazed that this hasn't sold out already. It's yeah. one of the best deals I think we've ever done on luxury components. For the it's Strand fabulous. alone at 49.99, it's ridiculous. We always say though, don't we, that our projects are the, some of the best value. Yeah. Because you get the inspiration, but you also get luxury um, components. You know, if I was to sit here and say it was deal of the day and go, okay, I've got type A, black Guatemalan jade and a graduated strand and we would take the strand at 10 o'clock and it was 49.99, it would go crazy. Yeah. It would go absolutely crazy because that's an unbelievable deal. You're getting that and everything else. Um, amazing, make sure you're checking out. And of course, if you have any questions for our lovely Alison, do text in. We've got the Malachite one coming up. That's with silver, by the way. It's available um, on pre-order as we speak. So Alison, my lovely, what are you gonna show us? Well, I'm gonna show you how to make the, the choker. Oh, lovely. Which, which will also tell you roughly how to make the bracelet okay um so i've started off i've literally just tied um one of it well one of the big ones in the middle two of the next size and two of the small ones mm -hmm. between two now you could just pop that on chain and you're good to go yeah that, that that could be it um obviously i haven't um glued these glue or glue or nail varnish the ends just to stop that um not coming undone um 
and that's all you need to do and then you just trim it being careful to cut the right cord so then then that's good so that's your center part of your choker i've then done all the other sections so i've got either sides and again i've trimmed them back so that you can't um see you can see what's in there so i've got um some some what's it called macrame mm -hmm. sorry basic macrame twist um with one in the middle so i've sort of used them as sections so i'm going to show you a how to attach the cord so i'm just going to knot it you only need sections of the cord do a simple overhand knot pull it tight and then just do another one again I didn't want to do a lark's head, a double lark's head. I didn't want to do um, anything that took away from the design of the clover. So I have done it quite tight to it. Um, but having said that, the whole thing's fluid. Your cord isn't going to, isn't going to suffer for that. I always say um, when you're doing it, make sure you've got something to protect your cord but your cord isn't going to be rubbing because everything else will give but that won't that you know you're not twisting that so dab dab that with your nail varnish or glue and then we're going to add on the rest so i'm going to pop this in a macrame board and then i'll take you down to the other end i just lift this up i go through there and then back up and if you've got enough just go back down so you don't need massive pieces of cord however you do want to have enough to secure it so if you can get it quite tight but actually raised so can you see how that's got a slight raise that's because you've got the beads on it now for the top bit and I've gone I've gone through in here how long I've made each to make the size so on this one this is kind of the other side of it if you imagine this has got the macrame bit on it i've got um, a middle sized one and two of the small ones and then on the last part of the choker i've got the two sections of macrame with just the small bead in so i've kind of graduated it as i've gone wrong gone around as well so to make the macrame we're going to take a little a, a bit of your cord oop come back sorry now this is this is probably the most basic form of macrame the earliest form there's 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 the spiral knot and the square knot basically the square knot is is all the same direct uh, alternating direction the spiral is all the same direction so i've taken a, um, a small piece of cord and i'm going to take it underneath i've got too much here so i've probably got about half a meter or something like that you don't need that um, and again I'll, I'll tell you how much inside so I've just done an overhand knot a simple knot and I'm going to take it and I want it to be right up there don't worry at the moment if it moves because you basically push it up later on to secure it so our basic macrame you form your your four or your kite um, and then you're going to take your other cord and go underneath now it doesn't matter if you do it right hand or left hand so it doesn't matter if you do it that way or the other way so long as you're consistent so by consistency i mean it's always going to be in the same direction so if you're left-handed you might want to do it and i'll do it um just to show you the difference of what i mean so i mean by doing it that side so with this form of macrame it doesn't matter which direction you're going to do it with that direction or the other but it's always got to be the same so you don't alternate you don't swap sides so for me it's left over right right over left now this this comes up um in the 12 o'clock demo as well so left over right right over left and you just keep um doing it the same direction now what you will find is because this has come straight from the the reel it's all curly what you can do is steam it or just wet it and leave it to dry the small pieces and it will just straighten out oh, okay so you can straighten and that's what you do when you do a tassel 
if you make it, this stuff's great for making tassels. So if you made a tassel with it um, and you wet it and leave it, you know, just sort of pull it out a little bit, wet it, yeah, lay it flat, mm. it will dry and just stay flat. And I've never had any problem with uh, colour leach or any like that. Um, and it just, it's just brilliant. I think I seem to remember actually um, these being colour fast. Yeah. I've not tried it in a washing machine, but certainly running it under the tap, I've never had any yeah. any um, leaching problems. And you can see you're getting this spiral forming. Yeah. Um, if you um, get so far, and can you see where my cords are trying to now come up? So what's happening is the spiral will form and these cords will end up almost vertical. And you'll get to the point where you're really fighting against it and your cord's telling you I need to swap over mm. so when you get to a certain point all you do is swap the cords you're just carrying on in the same direction don't swap cord you just keep going in the same direction and it'll still carry on with that with that stitch but it just see how my cords are now yeah, going twisting, horizontal it's again twisting around to it's, the other side yeah so you, yeah so just so you, give it just let it yeah when it when it the cord will tell you because it you you'll you'll find your cord sort of doing that it, it's almost yeah. crossing over on itself and it's like oh you want to swap over again don't you so you keep going like that and we'll imagine we've done the full amount like i said we can slide that up to the top now mm -hmm. and make sure that's nice and snug we're going to feed on our gemstones which have now gone all over the desk riveting tv if you're ironing up the malachite, by the way, it's coming up in uh, the next next kit. I tell you yeah, what, yeah. Whilst, while you, I'm, whilst, whilst I'm you threading. thread those on, we'll yeah. do it. Swap the graphics over. There's only a handful of this one still available now, jewelry makers. There's about ten. Um, oh, have we? We've got a bigger quantity of this project now. I was just setting it out whilst um, Alison was discussing with you um, demoing. Now, this is not going to hang around jewelry makers again. You've got that same graduated strand that you saw in the Guatemalan. Um, but this is with the silver and I, it's always the most popular, isn't it, Ross? Always, oh, always the most popular of your precious metal. That is why we've got a bigger quantity. Again, you think about the deal that we would have brought you. That is epic quality Malachite. I have to say our quality of Malachite has always been good, but it's, mm. uh, it's the best now I've ever seen. I have ever, ever look at it. Remember the, the article, the words of that jewelry editor, um, publication and they're talking about those bands of green yeah. you know that, that that outlandish eccentric that brings you once seen never forgotten it's that isn't it oh totally they're they're stunning i'd say specimen yeah 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 perfect. specimen bits of, of malachite they're absolutely gorgeous and honestly we've shown you pieces from piaget we've shown you pieces from shopard we've shown you pieces from van cleef and arpels and honestly ours does not lack the quality that you see in such luxury brands it doesn't it really really doesn't because you want to have those different brands of color that's what's so exciting about malachite as a gemstone malachite shallow forming very rare very much in the in the in the moment now this has been on pre-order okay and a similar amount of what has gone on the guatemalan has already gone on this one wow so I wonder if you bought both both projects. Okay, are you ready? You get twenty five of your sterling silver clovers. The auction is live, jewelry makers. You get your S long, which is point five. By the way, I don't think I've mentioned that. You get the five, eight, and ten millimeter sterling silver clovers, and you get that beautiful graduated strand. I mean, look at the quality of that malachite. And it's you, amazing. oh, it's Congolese. It's the best in the world. Um, and you get Alison's amazing project. So um, we will get back to, Mal uh, to Alison in a second in a okay. demonstration. But whilst she's just threading on the gemstones, we want to bring you an absolutely unbelievable deal. I I've got to repeat what we said earlier on. You know, if I was to bring you three connectors, even the ones I've got on the, on the tweezers here, for yeah. example, I've got the graduations on the tweezers, haven't I? Yeah. So that means you could easily make those earrings, yeah? yeah in silver and if i was to bring this away okay ross let's be really cheeky because we do sometimes drop the price a little bit on the silver what about if i said these three 9.99 yeah 
Are you saying you could make those earrings in, in the silver for roughly £20? You've got a, a shepherd I am being it. cheeky there. That is, yeah. I'm definitely, wow. definitely being cheeky. But Ross, would we do nine ninety nine? You hesitated to answer me then. Let's say we did. That would take 25 of them to round about this price. But that's just the silver jump rings. That's not even factoring in the malachite and the cord and the instructions. You've just seen what we did with the Guatemalan jade. Yeah. Let's match that price. Nice. Congolese malachite. It's such a rare, beautiful gem. So it forms all around the world, but Congolese is the finest. The finest in the world. And you can, my goodness me, if ever you wanted a textbook example of that, it's this strand. It's epic quality. Our malachite has always been good, don't get me wrong. But I think what we actually have at the moment is the best I've ever seen. Ever seen, and that's not just here. You know, I think you could you could put our malachite literally next to Chopard, oh, next gotcha. to Van Cleef, next to Piaget, and it would be toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Yeah, totally. We're not done there. We're going to go even lower. Wow. But be quick. I've got 85 of these available jewelry makers. You get the Allison's instructions as well. They are solid 925 sterling silver. They're closed, so not open. You could literally... They are connectors, aren't they? Yeah. Would we all agree? I love the idea of soldering with them. I love that idea if you are yeah. a silversmith. You know, you could just literally solder those onto some wire and make a, a ring. Totally. A clover totally. ring. Yeah. Or a bangle. Yeah. Certainly your earrings. Are you ready? Solder a post and you got studs. Studs? Oh, and that wouldn't be hard to do, would no. it? What? Whoa. For the strand alone, that's absolutely unbelievable. For the malachite alone. Wow. For the sterling silver alone, you get 25 connectors. I mean, these used to be best. How much did they used to be? Why have I got like £10 in my head? I, I was just thinking that. Either eight ninety nine or nine ninety nine. Something like that. On their own. And when do we see these? No. Nope. So Not very often. Unbelievable deal. These projects, absolutely epic. And the quality is luxury quality. Pauline, Lynn, Ayrshire, Claire, Brenda, Sheila, wow. Linda, Cheryl, Jenny, Barbara, Anne, Lorraine, another Anne. I've got Merseyside, Anna in Derbyshire, Irene, Hilmer and Cornwall and Jill and Angus and Buckinghamshire, uh, Lorraine. Make sure you're checking out everybody to guarantee your success. I only had 85 opportunities for the strand alone. That's epic. That's what our projects are all about. Um, and uh, for the silver gram weight alone, mm -hmm. that's a good point. 60% of the stock has gone. Two thirds. No. Oh, no. I'm so going to repeat. They used to be, I'm sure they used to be about a tenner. Maybe, mm. maybe like eight ninety nine or something like that. Keep that in mind, because what, what Ross has just said, L. the deal you're about to see is outrageous. It's outrageous now. We had a bigger quantity. Only 85, though. So, so let's say you, you're paying 20 quid for the cord and the instructions. Yeah. At the moment, you're paying £19 for all that sterling silver. Yeah. And that amazing, that amazing strand should be over £39.99. Oh my gosh, the strand alone should be mm. more than this project. 60 seconds, we're going again. Wow. Don't hesitate, jewellery makers. Do wow. not hesitate. This is one of the best, best kit hours I think we've done in years. It's fabulous, isn't I it? I genuinely think so. I think, I think the, qu the quality of the components, mm. the jewellery that's been created, one totally. of the best deals that you could do, you that you can purchase for luxury components. Yeah. Closed clover jump rings or connectors, whichever way you look at it. Yeah. You get twenty five of them in the graduation. That's why I'm holding the three on the tweezers here. So you get, just to clarify, ten of the small, ten of the medium, five of the big. You get the strand of malachite, which is off the chart. You get the threads. You get Alison's amazing instructions, jewelry makers. At 85, I don't blame you for multi buying. I would do too. Are you ready? I, I mean, I, I don't know how you've got any wiggle room in this, Ross. 
I don't know how. And mm. also, I don't know how it's not sold out already. We well, still honour that price drop. But look, people have people have gone out and oh, get second out. ones. Yeah, well, why wouldn't you? <gasps> no. That's one that I'll, again. I'll say it. That's one of the best price kits I've ever seen. For what you're getting, these aren't base metal; they're silver. That's malachite, the gem, one of the gemstones of the moment. It's everywhere at the moment, isn't it? It is. What on earth, Russ? Yeah. Crazy! That will sell out. It will sell out. No doubt about that, jewelry makers. There are so many people who are joining us. Epic! I didn't. I, I mean, how you had wiggle room from thirty nine no. ninety nine? I do not know. I don't think it did. Maybe not. It's it Ross, can't have had wiggle room. It's Ross. Unbelievable. There's loads of you there, jewelry makers. Make sure you're checking out. Back to you, Alison. Oh, yep. Yeah, okay. So, oh, uh, by the way, sorry. That's a pound of clover jump ring. The spool, which is usually best part of ten pounds, you can have that for fiver, and then the malachite and the instructions for free. It's ridiculous. Oh my god, that malachite's stunning. Yeah, the malachite it's, should be way more just, than yeah. The malachite, I would in my head would be like a here at jewelry maker would be like a sixty seventy pound strand. Yeah. You've got both kits for way less than what the Guatemalan strand should have been. Wow, isn't it? Let's be honest though. The Guatemalan strand should have been £100. Yes. You get both projects for 80 today. That's wow, amazing. that's incredible. That's amazing. I told you. That yeah, what an hour. That's unbelievable. Mm, that um, is amazing. Back to you, Alison. Right. So I've done a little bit below. So I put my three beads on. I've done another little bit below. So you would make these sections match, yeah. obviously. Um, I've just done it for speed and I, was, I got carried away, carried on going. So then what you'd do is you'd then attach your next um, jump ring. And they're lovely. Well, the one thing we haven't said, I mean, they're a square profile wire, but look at the depth of the wire you're getting. We haven't... There's they, a big amount actually, of silver. Yeah, they're yeah. actually deeper than most, most wire we'd have. Good point, they are square wire, it's not square round. It's square wire, yeah. yeah. So you're getting that flat surface, which is why you're getting such... I hadn't really noticed till I've just picked that up how how much yeah. depth you're getting on that. So, again, you're going to finish off the same. Now, to, to avoid getting a, a, a gap, what you can do is you can compress your macrame down a bit. Just, just slide it down and squash it. And then when you do your two knots through the end... Hang on, let me just trim those two off. My ends are getting in the way is same again you're just just going to do an overhand knot twice so just pull it through pull it as tight as you can to it and then do another one you want it going in that gap pull that through pull that tight and then ease that macrame back out so it, it pushes that, you don't get your gap, you've, you've um, used up your gap space, for want of a better word. And then you can, you can ease that back out to where it should be, not all squashed up. And then again, you're just going to glue all your ends or put your, na your nail varnish on all your ends. Mm. I would leave them all till you've finished if you can, and then trim it. And then the same again, so you've got your three sections, and on this last one... Um, I did, uh, I've attached that to a jump ring and just put, I put an extender cord on it. Okay. Um, and yeah, then I've I used. Can, I can turn that yeah. around. And then I've used the other end of the extender. I've just uh, attached one of the other clovers and one of the small um, beads on that, on a head pin. Just finishes it off. Because it's a choker, you're assuming that um, people are going to see it. Yeah. Uh, so I just wanted that, that. And also, if you're selling a choker, it, it's hard to do it. One size does not fit all. No, no, that's so true. So if you use the extender, you can sell them knowing that someone's going to have generally somewhere within that space. And also, I think sometimes you'll be happy with it quite close to the neckline. Sometimes, sometimes you might you want, want it, it to lower. be just that little bit lower. So as you can see on the bust, it will sit lower mm. and, and it will drape. You can also, if you're making it for yourself, you can do it exactly by altering the amount the yep. length of your macrame sections to fit perfectly but because you don't know 
having the extender gives you that option to have yeah, it lower on the, yeah. on the neckline. Yeah, so. I agree, that versatility. Alison, absolutely unbelievable projects, amazing it, jewellery. Fabulous jewellery, easy jewellery to make, very easy jewellery. The only difference on the bracelet is I've thre threaded some um, seed beads. You could use sterling silver yeah. spaces on it. Look at those. I know. That's Guatemalan jade. I know. They're amazing, aren't they? Absolutely inc incredible. You can still get the Malachite. You can still get the Guatemalan, but they are both very limited. I'm not surprised with those no. deals. Fabulous. There are loads of you. I don't know why. There are loads of you with it still in your basket. We cannot go any lower. I think that's one of the best yeah. price projects that we've done in years. Honestly, for the quality that you're getting, yeah. you know, that's like, a, that's like me going into a jewellers and saying, okay, I want the finest quality, I don't know, sapphire. But I only want to pay like the lower grade price. Yes. Do yes. you know what I mean? It is. Because like you said, our malachite's gone off the scale. It really We've has gone off the scale. We've always had great malachite, yeah. but now it's unbelievable. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And that would be an incredible price for our, we've always had great not the unbelievable yeah absolutely absolutely i've got 15 of these left jewelry makers wow. i mean look at that Amazing. Uh, it's it's incredible and and to say that this gemstone is in, is current right now would be an understatement oh it? gosh yeah everybody's using it every dior mm. um honestly dolce and gabbana yeah. all of the designers yeah absolutely What's Louis the, the C's? Ca uh, chanel cartier i was thinking i was thinking cartier, cartier using it, yeah absolutely they do C's as well. Yeah. They just, uh, yeah. Lo uh, pretty much every high end designer is yeah. working with it. Yeah. And also very relevant in interior design, too. Oh, yeah. Massive in interior design. Well, they photographed it and printed wallpaper out and tiles. fabrics out and tiles. Yeah, sounds amazing. You know, obviously, it? if you wanted to tile your place with, with malachite, it's going to cost you an absolute I I've arm said, and a leg. I've but... said to um, Caroline, who's one of the buyers on mm. our sister channel, I was like, you so need to do malachite wallpaper. Wow, yeah. You so need to do like a wallpaper range. Yeah. Uh, we could get it printed because sewing, sewing streets have uh, printers. Yeah. <gasps> now, can you imagine we, fabric for it? Can you imagine? Oh like my gosh. Like soft furnishings gosh, and things yeah. like that. It would be absolutely amazing. Um, well done, wow. everybody. I've got the final 10 opportunities. £29.99. pence is insane. There's still time. It's not. You don't just get this beautiful strand, which, by the way, is three of the 10 four of the eight, 10 of the four, is that right? Yeah. You get 25 sterling silver closed clover connectors. It's amazing. You get the real, the spool, which um, this cord is so fantastic and we haven't seen it in ages. S1, S1 is the best. Yeah. I love it. I've got seven of this project left. So if you are Barbara, Maker, Kent, Sheila, Celia, Maker, David, Merseyside, Hilmer, London, Cornwall, Jill, Angus, new customers, oh, loads of new customers. You need to check them out, your baskets. That's just a few of the names. Make sure you're checking out. More than seven of you have this currently sat in your basket or in the, pro, um, in the process of confirming. Um, you have to check out. Now, I just want to do a quick recap on the Guatemalan project. So basically, the same strand where you get that graduation, let me show you. It's madness, the price Ross. Is madness. It's complete madness. You've put all those away very tidy. I had tidied away, yeah. It's all good. Here you go. They're fabulous, I love those. The quality of the of the Guatemalan jade. You can get both kits le for less than what the Guatemalan jade strand should be. Honestly, this strand on its own. We've had to source the different sizes. Mm -hmm. They're incredibly wasteful as well. That's a hundred pound strand. Totally. For 80 pounds, you can get this strand and the gold plated 20, the 25 gold plated clovers and thread and the instructions um, and the malachite and the sterling silver clovers and the other black cord. For 80 pounds, you can get it all today. Crazy. It's amazing. That's how many I've got left of the Guatemalan jade, by the way, seven. And how often do you see black Guatemalan jade? Jade eye. Very rare. Yeah. Very, very rare. Well, it takes three times longer, that's yeah. why. Very, very, very rare. You can get both projects today, jewelry makers, for £80, or you can get this one for £49.99, which is complete insanity. Um, I've got five of this one left. Oh. Again, again. Huge list. Yeah, when it's gone, it's gone. Um, I can't see your names as I think we've. 
It's on split pay. Yeah. Well, it should be because it should be a lot more expensive than that. Yeah, absolutely. The people recognising how unbelievable this deal is. Um, well done, everybody. Amazing. Should we stick with the crazy deals? Mm. Why not? It has been like that from start to finish, Roscoe. Hasn't it? Why ch change the habit of a lifetime? Right, let's not mix those up, otherwise Michael will shout at me. Let's do what? <gasps> oh, that oh. cute... Uh, this quartz is not just any quartz, though. This is Angola quartz, so this is the very last of it. Um, Carol got the opportunity to launch this, and it went completely crazy. For me, you can get quartz in lots of different colours, thank you. Um, quartz in lots of different colours. However, when we're talking about white quartz, it has to be the purest. My way of always defining the difference. So most quartz, quartz as a mineral is not rare. Quartz as a gemstone is rare. Yes. Yeah? So um, for white quartz, what we most often will see is something that looks a little bit murky, a little bit like compact snow. You know, if ever, you, if ever you've seen snow and it's sort of pushed against the side of the road, or something dirty. like that, a bit dirty, just or maybe you've had you know people walk through it and whatnot, just a little bit mm, not nice. Um, however, when it's freshly fallen, mm. crisp and untouched, that's what you want your white quartz to look like. That's what takes it to gem quality quartz. Wow. This is exactly that. It is like freshly fallen powder snow. Yeah. I could ski on that. You could. And it wouldn't hurt if you fell over. <laughs> <gasps> Look at that. It's How stunning. amazing. Now, this is the very last opportunities that we actually have. Everything else is sold out. I've got just 24 <gasps> left of this parcel. That's it. Wow. See what I mean? It's the purest, isn't it? You know? But you know when you wake up, or you used to wake up, particularly as a child, and look out the window and you'd be like, oh, look at the snow. But it's just a blanket of pure Love white. It. And you just want to go and run through it. Yeah. Or let your dog run through it. Yes. <laughs> Look. That's just gorgeous. And everybody will be like, yeah, no school. They still well, we always had to go. Did you? Yeah. Uh, we. Uh, I remember some very really big few. snow days. Mm, remember the one in 84? Remember the one in 84? <laughs> we literally walked to the local farm to get our milk mm. from the cows, direct from the cows. Um, honestly, true story. We've got 25, totally digressed. Look at how pure that white is. Stunning, isn't it? Now, um, just so you know, there was a WhatsApp conversation uh -oh. about this opportunity. And Wayne, JM, there we go. Hi, Awayno. This is Carol and Wayne, yeah? Looking forward to the launch of the Angolan Quartz. It's so beautiful. Anything in particular that I need to know? Hey, this goes back three years. The first time we went to India, I think they were um, showing it off, showing us um, his unique material, but said they couldn't let them go. When we went back last year, every day we asked to see them and on the last day he finally cracked and said we could have three strands. So this is a one-off closeout deal. He said when he got them, he'd never seen them and he's never seen any since, um, which is why he is so keen to keep them as it's so rare to find. Now you might be thinking, okay, hang on a minute, this is quartz, you've brought quartz before. It's the colour that sets mm. it apart. Look at the glow. Yeah, it's it's un, that's why they the, the, even the seller was reluctant to mm. let it part, let it go. It's the colour. Do you know when white is so white it almost fluoresces? Mm. It has a glow, a presence about it. Now you see, that looks like it's got a it's backlit, but yeah. it's not. It looks like you're shining your torch through, but it's just the normal lighting. For once, mm. it's. It, normally we say the lights are awful but look how that is performing yeah, just under these worst conditions yeah illuminating and it's a full 38 centimeter Stunning. strand jewelry makers we've only ever got three strands of angolan quartz you are not paying 39.99 for a full length strand imagine this with some of your finest white white pearls or <gasps> maybe with the aquamarine cubes that we've got coming up at yes. the end of the day it'd go with any of the cubes 19.99 what 
There's 25 of these. It's a close-out deal, isn't it? It's another close-out deal, Roscoe. That should be the red clock. Yeah, I agree. Clock's closed. Mm. Yeah, I totally agree. I've got 25. Once they're gone, they're gone. Wow. I currently can't see your names at the moment. We're, we're that busy, we've actually clogged the, uh, my TV monitor. There's no more after this. All Wayne sweet talking. He can't get hold of any more. <laughs> what we've got in is gone. Never say never, but it's unlikely. There is something so distinctive about there Angola is. and Quartz. Quartz. There is. It's beautiful. Today, we go even lower for the final 25 opportunities, wow. lovely jewellery makers. 0800 655. Good luck to each and every single one of you. Yeah, imagine this knotted with a pure white silk. Oh, oh. beautiful. There is a queue on the phone lines. I can't see you currently. Get it whilst you can, jewellery makers. Twelve ninety nine. <gasps> what? what for natural pristine white quartz? Wow. Unbelievable! Absolutely unbelievable! It would go. Oh, it would yeah. go stunning. Yeah. With the malachite with that. that we've got coming. Oh, look at that! And we've literally scheduled this last minute. It's going coming in tomorrow's show. I hopefully in the nine o'clock hour. Oh, I'm, I'm there. I'd swap one of those malachite. And yeah. make two stretchies yeah. and put one of that that white one of the white quartz in with the malachite and one of the malachite in with the white quartz. Yeah, lovely. Swap it out. Yeah. Um, we've got only twenty five of these available. Everybody at twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Um, keep on dialing through, everyone. Wendy, Susan, Marion, Sharon, Olivia, Janice, Brenda. Candy, Linda, Debbie, well done. Christine, Brenda. Can't keep up with I them. I can't see your name, so Ross is literally reading these to me in my <laughs> ear right now. So uh, make sure you're checking out everybody. We've only got 25 available opportunities. And also, can I just say, these would be lovely with the projects. They would go great with the projects. Hang on. In fact, they'd go great with all the projects. Oh, look at that. Oh, sorry. That sounded oh, awful. Yin, yin and oh, yeah, definitely. Stunning, isn't it? Yeah, nice. On the verge of selling out, yeah, alongside your beautiful Guatemalan jadeite projects. That would be stunning, wouldn't it? Um, and the four-leaf clovers. Epic! Well done, everybody. Um, amazing. Love that. That's the difference between Angolan quartz. It has the level of purity unlike anything else that we have seen previously before. Um, okay. Can we? Oh, please. So, so in the break, this is going to be the last auction of this hour. And we're going to, we've got your cubes so for your Wall of Fame no. and also your Deal of the Day. Um, but jewellery makers, in the break, before we started this hour, yeah. something caught my attention. Now, those of you that know me know I'm obsessed with jewellery maker pearls. This was actually a project. I've never caught seen this too. before, Ross. I've never brought this to air, have I? And it's only been on air once. Stunning. Was it Linda? These... Uh, if you're a big fan of the Barack or Fireball Pearl, yeah, who's not? You will love this strand. It's not just strand, though. I, I have no idea what this goes to. But I know that if it comes like that, that it's going to wow, be special. Wow, that's, that's a special, special box as well. <gasps> but I'm just going to ask Alison, this is quite an obscure thing to say with pearls, but Alison, just hold it for one second and feel the weight. Ooh. Yes. It strikes you, doesn't it? It does strike you. That's because the pearls are massive. <sighs> I'm still not going to show you yet. Look at those. Are because I want to show you this first. I'm going to tease you some more. Oh. Oh. Okay. Nice. You get this. Oh, I like that hammered effect. Isn't almost. it lovely? Textured. And gem encrusted. And then oh, can you yes, see? Yeah, so you can easily attach. Yeah, literally nice. not direct onto. And yeah. it's going to sit beautifully flush with the pearl. It will. I, I love the fact that it comes with that as well. Yeah. I don't know what this project goes to. It was, it was a previous project, effectively. So I'm assuming there's some instructions from Linda. Will there? There are 26 available. Oh, no. Well. They're insane. No. I know, I'm sorry, we're going to miss out on these. Oh, obviously. look. Oh, 
look at those. The pearls are absolutely breathtaking. Oh my. Natural, golden. I think they're fireballs, they're personally. Fireballs. Oh, look at how golden they wow. are. They literally look like 24 karat gold. They're mad, aren't they, Ross? Can you see why I <gasps> wanted you to include them in today's show? <gasps> wow. Oh, they are stop look traffic. At, beautiful. Look at that one that's almost bent. The bottom one by, by your little finger. That, that one. No, the one below it. That one. You turn that. The purples in that, as you twist it round, so the, it's round the other side, it's just incredible colours. I don't know whether it'll pick it up. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Look at that! Yeah. Wow! And They're amazing. Oh and the one that I, it's, it's yeah. hard not to show the, uh, the quality oh of these bills. Oh my gosh, that's insane. They are breathtaking. These are, I mean, oh. Do you know what fireball pearls are? I know, we're not calling we, them fireballs. Always remind me of the World Cup trophy. Yeah, 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 they are a bit. They've got those sort of legs coming down that the display but the I also want to go back cast our mind back to pre pearl mania as I always yeah. refer to it okay so cast your mind back wow. to before the the pandemic yeah no sorry it was just post pandemic oh right so we knew the supply of pearls was going to be impacted yes we knew that yes. because you cannot walk away from pearl harvest and, no. and then be unscathed effectively yeah. you lose the harvest you the oysters die or return to the sea the pearls get lost yeah in the in the tide so we knew it was going to take and they estimated about 10 years to recover in fact um okay so that's like literally on 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 the eve of the pandemic however what we didn't foresee is the the world going nuts for this gemstone mm -hmm. particularly china with its booming economy yeah when we saw strands of fireball pearls like this the at wholesale they were so expensive i seem to remember a discussion being had with a pearl supplier when i was at tucson uh, i was stood alongside dave and it was like four thousand dollars per strand yeah per strand what is it what's this one of our pearl dealers and i don't know when this was how long ago but it still absolutely is relevant oh was it this month okay so he's talking about your fireball pearls he says the fireball production disappeared a long time ago so whatever is in the market is uh, is final supply finite supply um it was a 10-year window and their price has skyrocketed since especially for the colors um so if we get access to these they have been harvested a long time ago we feel that these will continue to rise in value because they are oddities they only existed from one or two harvests do oh. you remember when we were talking about purple pearls there's they mm. are what we call hybrid uh, hybridized pearls. Yeah. so only a few oysters will actually produce a purple pearl yeah this is the parcel I was talking about that I remember th three, four years ago almost. And it's like 4,000 per strand for a selection if you cherry pick or two and a half if you take the entire lot. And then Dave hesitated. I remember, yeah, that's per strand. So not, not for the whole box, that's per strand. So, but Dave hesitated on this. Can you see the gap in yeah. the time? Sorry, this lot is sold, my friend. And that's pre-pearl wow. mania. We're just learning Two now hours. as well that fireball pearls are oddities. Yeah. And the supply is gone. Another one for the big collectors. I'm so them. obsessed with pearls at the moment. And you can literally just knot these, make that perfect bracelet. Mm. Or if you wanted add some of your existing golden pearls to create a necklace add the class you've got it all there i'm holding two four hang on two four six eight nine fireball wow. pearls when they normally are sold individually yeah and my goodness me aren't they breathtaking they are naturally like a pink gold aren't mm. they so metallic i want to buy these ross me too I'm really drawn to that one. It looks like I'm a very flame. jealous, Linda. They are. We could easily go here, say that's our prize, close the auction. How many have we got? <clears throat> 
16. Ooh. I want to join you on this. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I don't think we're going to get the chance. No, I think we might miss out as well. There are 16 available. This is, look, I've brought you papaya pu before. Yeah. I've brought you purple before, but I don't think I've ever actually had such a blend of colours and yeah. such quite a, a saturation of colours. We have brought, brought these to you and trying to give you as much warning as we possibly can. 799 is already absolutely unbelievable. The reality is, look at the quality of that one. Mm -hmm. You try and find a, a, a fireball pill, that one on its own for 799. Yeah. Are you ready? Because the next price crash. Look at that sheen. Wow. Have you ever seen overtones like that? No is not what you're paying these are metallic pearls wow i don't want anyone to miss out if you love pearls and you want the best 499 is not the price oh this is crazy that is actually crazy ross for the size the quality the natural colors the golden looks more golden than a golden south sea pearl True. does that make sense yeah yeah totally and then you've got that because Purple they're fireball. And, yeah. There's, they're, more, wow. they're more metallic because of the fireball. Mm. I think because those undulations and curves <gasps> really uh, sort of attract the light. In 30 seconds, jewelry makers, one for the big collectors. I've only got wow. 16 available. As soon as I saw that box, I knew its contents were going to be special. Um, but I, I wasn't expecting it to be quite like this. I was like, oh my goodness, that's insane. 499, we're gonna take that price low, and I don't just mean by a little bit, jewelry makers as well. This is going way lower. Massively lower. Brenda, well done, you're not alone. I've got jewelers shopping with us right now. I'm not surprised, because what's a jeweler gonna do? Are they gonna knot it with silk, put it on a clasp? They're well, not gonna sell it for 249, I can tell you that for certain. They wouldn't even sell it if you stuck a note on the end. No, I agree. I reckon that's at, at least a five thousand pound strand. Well, we've had we've had lovely customers who've mm. messaged in Alison and literally said, oh, "I bought some pearls from you. I took it yeah. to a jeweler to buy a class. They uh, they offered me. I think it was like two and a half thousand pounds. I turned it down. I don't blame you. I would as well for something like mm. this. I'd be like, let's be honest. Even if you went double it, because because if you think about it. And this is what you have to remember. And these were genuine calls because we had someone yeah. else saying they, they'd message in and said, since that person went, I took some and I got offered. And I, I can't remember the exact, but it was thousands. Because can't get hold of them. Yeah. That's because jewellers yeah. can't buy pearls. But you, you, you're looking at, you know, you've had Lady Gaga wear yeah. the, the, the necklace. That's 10, 20, 30 grand's worth. Yeah, yeah. You know? You're easily. looking, you're looking at, at those sort of prices that yeah. a jeweler's going to be selling them for those sorts of prices. So for, for to, me, it speaks volumes that you've got the likes of Asile, you've got mm. the likes of Yoko, who have literally reached out to us. Where are you getting your fine quality pearls from? How mm. have you got these pearls? So that speaks volumes, jewelry makers. And make no doubt about it, you're you're shopping with the same grade pearls as, as what you find in those establishments make no doubt about that you can get hold of it on your 0% interest split payment as well jewelry makers i i want to join you on these they're absolutely incredible um good luck never seen such golden colors nothing like this i mean like we've brought you fireballs haven't we but never this golden mm. it's like a pink gold it is you remember doing what fireball strands about the same size and length and it was 1499 yeah 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 1499 that is yeah yeah I, I, yes i agree adam saying i remember one fireball pearl yes. singularly was was about this price yeah that's the reality and it's absolutely unbelievable that we are still bringing you this gemstone given everything that has gone on absolutely unbelievable right i've got to move on jewelry makers your wall of fame is coming up your fantastic creations um and also the cl uh, the cube selection is <gasps> back yes. it's taken years it's all on pre-order right now natural aquamarine amazonite jadeite rubelite and also kyanite natural shop ahead on yours and secure yours haven't been available for multiple years well done on those pills they're absolutely insane Absolute. we'll see you after this <laughs> Offering Alan 
Alison. We are. Best part of the show, all my. I agree. I love it. Totally agree. Would you like to start us off today? Oh, I'll go first Anybody today. Anybody feeling a bit musical? Yes, this is lovely. I, I, I commented on this as soon as I saw it. Oh, this is nice. uh, 596. This is Deborah Frost. And she says, my entry this week's Wall of Fame, a simple wire wrapped treble clef uh, made in silver wire with two accent beads, silver chain and a toggle clasp. I buy my wire from jewellery maker. The beads, chain and clasp are from my stash. Good luck to everyone. Isn't that beautiful? Very clever. Yeah, lovely. Very clever. Love that. Well done, Deborah. I've got number 597. Ooh. And this is from Jade Cousins. Hello to you, Jade. Uh, Jade says, hi, jewellery maker. I'm entering a lilac cultured pearl necklace and earring set this week. I've had to go, um, I've had a go at pearl knotting um, with a dark purple silk. Not the greatest, but I'm happy with my first attempt. Good luck to all. Well, it looks pretty perfect to me, Jade. That's a fab attempt. Never mind, first attempt. That's I know, fab. amazing. Good luck. Well, You're 597. You. That's lovely. Ooh, grrr. Oh, bit of Did a you bit just growl? A grrr. A good pussy cat here. <laughs> wow. Um, and this is 598, Karen Hawksley. Um, my entry for this week's WAF are two bracelets, both made from beautiful plum blossom tourmaline. Ooh, yes. That's nice. With different components added. Don't think the photos quite does the colours justice. Good luck to everyone. Do you know what? I love that that people say that because we say it a lot yeah, on, on TV, set. That's true. And then when you try and photograph it, you're like, oh, it doesn't do it justice. And we're like, yeah. That's true. And I'll <laughs> that looks uh, fabulous, though. I'll vouch for you, Karen, that that I launched those strands they're absolutely beautiful aren't mm. they and your makes are wonderful too That's lovely well done I have number um 599 oh, wow. wow wow seriously um my producers just said I thought we were doing the wall of fame not necessarily looking at not looking at Yoko of London or Asile or some of the finest pearl jewellers in the world. Lovely. Joni, this is beautiful. Um, and Joni says, my beautiful ripple pearl necklace. I've got a pearl addiction, um, as has my friend. Made for her, and she's oh. even named some of the pearls. All from Jewelry Maker, of course. Thanks to you all. Joni, wow. can I also just say that's very generous. Yeah. Generous. Uh, now, yes, I agree. Um, producer Ross says... Go and get that valued. Guarantee it's significantly more than what you paid. Amazing. 599. Well done, Joni. Well done. And your insurance. It might be over your single value for your insurance. Definitely. Um, I've got number 600, Sharon, wow. Sharon Lockwood. I love the photography. Um, hi, all. Please find attached my entry for the Wall of Fame. Earrings from JM, photographed by my, by my collection of Malachite. Fingers crossed for a win. What a beautiful collection. I've got a few pieces of malachite. I Ooh, just love it. Just a couple. It. Just a couple. Yeah, Hope I agree. Hope you were watching. I think it was yesterday, was it yesterday? <coughs> it's a lovely malachite. Yeah. Amazing. Lovely. Um, I have number 601. Last oh. but by mo no means least. And this is from Jill Taylor. Wow. Oh, is that memory wire? That's beautiful, Jill. Mm. And Jill says, hello, everybody. Here is my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. Gorgeous bronca onyx with wow. black onyx and silver hematite beads in a memory wire bracelet. The white onyx has such a soft colour. Um, it's lovely. Good luck to everybody in the draw and best wishes to you. We sometimes forget with the higher end gems, putting them on a, a memory wire bracelet. How, how absolutely gorgeous does that look? Very effective. Yeah. Loving those. Do keep those entries coming into the Wall of Fame jewellery makers. You've got to be in it to win it. Yeah. I know it's cliche, but it's true. Um, and it's very simple, very, very, very simple to enter. Um, so every week, send in your entries to studio at jewelrymaker.com. If you do it by Tuesday at 12 o'clock, you'll be entered in the Wednesday draw. If you miss that cutoff point, not to worry, you will be entered in the following week's draw. Um, so just all we need is a photograph, a little paragraph on the back there, and the only rule is that they are jewellery maker components. Yes. The only rule. It doesn't matter whether you're you're very established or whether you're brand new to jewellery maker. Um, we do it out of a good old tombola, so it is luck of the draw. The winner. What does the winner receive, Azataza? A hundred pounds. One hundred pounds credited to their jewellery maker account. What about the runner-up, Azataza? They get fifty pounds. Ah, oh, it's amazing. Credited to their jewellery maker um, account. We worked it out the other week. That's over a hundred thousand pounds that, that we've, we've given, given away. away. 
And we've done it from, from the start, haven't yeah, we? Yeah, week one. Amazing. And I never won. I did get a job. I won a job. Yeah. That's even go. better. There you go. Uh, yeah, we won, <laughs> we won big by seeing your beautiful pieces of jewellery. And now we get to see you on air. Yeah. I know, I know. Uh, well, you know, you've got to be... And we have had people who win repeatedly. A couple of times, yeah. yeah. We've won quite a few times. But they, they enter a lot. They, they enter a lot. You see that some names come up every time. Frequency. Get, get you waffling. Frequency is key. Key. Um, so make sure you do send your entries in, Jewelry Makers. Now, um, coming up, your deal of the day. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. We have, yeah, the most amazing these. selection of faceted cubes our favorite cut is finally back it's taken us this long do you want to know what we've got go on type a gray burmese jade stunning <gasps> natural love that. aquamarine which is insane natural oh. kyanite which is insane mm -hmm. yeah nilamani like colors natural amazonite stunning amazing insane and very exciting natural Red tourmaline. Is that, it red tourmaline? Well, that's rubellite then. Wow. Rubellite, along with your paraba and your indicolite, one of the most valuable gemstones oh that exist. Oh my gosh. You've got rubellite in our deal of the day. In a, in a strand in like a that? In a full strand. Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. Stunning. Yeah, when, 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 a, when a, I'll get my words out. There you go. When a tourmaline is natural and it has a strong intensity of red, it's rubellite, which there's... I, I was, <laughs> it's so red, I thought that was ruby. Yeah. So, yeah. oh my goodness wow. me, so that's coming your way, jewellery makers. It's back, the faceted cube. Woo! After a very, very long time. Don't miss out on these strands. They're absolutely beautiful. It's coming up after this. Welcome back, jewelry makers. Yes. <laughs> oh, you see me? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's little things like that that just remind me of acorn. We are like acorn antiques, you know. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> where well, you see somebody like from the crew literally Mrs. behind. Pinafore? Was it Mrs. Pinafore? I can't Julie remember. Rob Julie Roberts. But like the set used to wobble ah, and things. Yeah. And they used that to be, like, make a joke of the fact that it was just that little bit. Every so often you see. <laughs> Do it again, Michael, for this time. Look. Go on. Go on. Oh. Anyway. Um, you got to love it. Jewelry Maker, believe it or not, has been established for 14 years. No. 14 wonderful years. Amazing. Where's that time gone? Hello, I've been here for 11. 11 of those years. Yeah. So uh, I've been here, gosh, this must be coming up my 13th, 12 years. Yeah. Coming up to my 13th. Wow. That's amazing, isn't it? It's um, Where would do you know be what? what you? Yeah, exactly. It's been, you know, I've loved every single minute of it. But there's certain launches that we bring you, and that could be a gemstone, that can be a design, that can be a cut that really take off. Do you remember jewelry makers when it was all about irregular drops? Yeah. Remember them? Yeah. Irregular drops, they were huge. Do you remember the launch of the satellite cut? Oh yes. Yeah? And they yeah. were huge. Do you remember the launch of the faceted cube? I do. And it was huge. It was one, our number one most popular cut. And of course, the powers that be will look at those. They have the, the information and the numbers to uh, quantify that statement. However, it's not a guarantee that we can always repeat them mm -hmm. as much as we would like to. I mean, I think with certainly with the satellite cut, we reordered as much as we could. And then it was a case of that's it, that's it, it's done. A lot of the times when it comes to a cut popularity, it also boils down to the fact that you've got to remember that this certain cuts can be very wasteful or can't maybe only a few people can do can actually achieve mm -hmm. 
most gemstone cutters or carvers will be able to do a round or a, ca or, or yeah. a cabochon, for example. But when you're starting to do things like checkerboard faceting, which we kind of just, oh, checkerboard faceting. Yeah. That's actually a real skill because it has to be almost like mathematically precise across the surface. Now, not just once, you need to do that on all sides of the cube as well. Six sides. Six sides. So it has been, I estimate, about three years. Yeah? Three years since we've had a collection of faceted cubes. Yeah. Now, judging by the response on pre-orders, they are flying out and you have been eagerly waiting for these. I would suggest, jewelry makers, because I actually don't know what is in the pipeline so i don't know if after this collection if there's anything that will follow i don't know it's not always a guarantee but can i mention am i right ross they're all natural natural type a wow. burmese jadeite natural look That's at the stunning it's amazing natural aquamarine wow i'm going to come back to that one natural amazing kyanite do you know it's weird it's so weird ross when i was getting ready for the show this morning i was like mm, must, i must ask wayne to actually get some really amazing kyanite again mm. literally <laughs> literally that was in my head this morning i kid you not it's like, no. oh, do you remember that those strands of kyanite those amazing natural strands of kyanite that we had once upon a must ask wayne and see if he can actually get hold of those and here it is natural quality kyanite Natural Amazonite, after Louis Vuitton Stunning. has just launched their collection, mm. the quality, David German, Louis Vuitton, the quality, I'd say shoulder to shoulder. This one here, the reason why I've come, I, I want to come, I, I said oh, I'm going to come back to it. Because our graphics, I'm going to take it off for a second. Our graphics will say red tourmaline. Technically, there's no such thing. Sparkle in it. Technically. You can have a pink tourmaline, sure. That's you can have a pink tourmaline, but if your tourmaline transitions to have a red colour saturation, it's no no longer. It will always be a tourmaline, but it doesn't just doesn't get called the colour red because it's one of the world's rarest colours. There are three of the tourmaline gemstone variety that are the rarest in no particular order: Paraba, Indicolite which is a, like a, a navy blue and rubellite, which is the red. This is natural red tourmaline, as our graphics say, which means it's rubellite. I was going to say, there's no way could you say that's pink. No, there's it's not no pink. way could that be pink. It's rubellite. Yeah, absolutely. As if I'm bringing you a strand of rubellite today. It's crazy, isn't it? Matt, I don't know if we've done a, have we done a rubellite showcase ever? No. No. Now, Jewelry makers, these are already going on pre-order. They're all totally natural. For example, can I just say, how amazing would that be as a piece of jewelry? Oh gosh. Rubellite and type A jadeite. Lovely. How amazing would that be? I'd ombre the other three. That's so Christmassy as well. Oh. We're actually gonna start, jewelry makers. I just wanna put them all on the back of my hand for a second. Oh, look. I want to bubble style them. I so badly want to bubble style them. Look how beautiful they are. Stunning. That's incredible, isn't it, Ross? Mm. How, one thing I don't know, Ross, is how many we have of each of them. Sixty of the Burmese. Sixty of the Amazonite. Oh, not enough. Fifty <gasps> of the Kyanite. Oh, no. 75 oh. of the aquamarine and a hundred of the rubellite, which is madness. I, I can't, oh I like, they gosh. are limited quantities. Listen, jewelry makers, we will have more than those numbers watching right now. And we will certainly have more than those numbers who have been waiting for a faceted cube. It has been, I reckon about three, four years since we've actually brought you any significant quantities of this cut. What is it about the cube that we love so much as jewelry makers? You know, we all know that a round is lovely and you can use it, you can knot it, and it will make lots of gorgeous traditional designs. But for me, a, a cube 
is 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 a modern twist yeah um it's a modern twist but you also get that wonderful surface luster there is no treatment in any of these strands oh my gosh. none when we first did cubes and i'm going way back when the first yeah, time it's got to be about cubes. four years ago no no when i, I mean before that when they were smooth yeah oh, they were just they weren't checkerboard fasted they, yeah, yeah they were they were like a cube of sugar yeah i didn't like them you know yeah i wasn't a fan of the cube i wouldn't say didn't like them but i wasn't a massive fan of the cube as soon as we started faceting them like that yeah no, I agree. oh my gosh game changer unbelievable and they're like they're like a puffy cube yeah they, they are they, they curved they it's sort a, of it's slightly a, a, a bulbous cube yeah it's a talent they're just I'm going to start stunning. with the Amazonite jewellery makers. We need to start with this strand again. Um, we know that we've said, gosh, since what, the beginning of this year? Um, Amazonite's a, one of the gemstones of 2024, isn't it? Mm. Lots of the big designers are wanting to work with it. It's about time um, that it gets the recognition. I think it started really with the uh, uh, Monica Veneda. But big news when Louis Vuitton, who let's be honest, has got very deep pockets, uh, Louis Vuitton unveils its new fine jewelry collection, Color Blossom Amazonite. Night. Um, and they're not using masses of it, not masses of carat weight, lots of headlines talking about this. So Louis Vuitton presents new Color Blossom, five of the best fine jewelry collections of 2024, um, redefined and joyous, they're saying. Discovering Amazonite, a stone of legends, Amazonite journey begins in the heart of Brazil, where it's believed to have been discovered along the banks of the Amazon River. Known for its captivating color and unique inclusions, Amazonite has captured the imagination of gemstone enthusiasts for centuries. Its translucent beauty and soothing hues make it a favorite amongst jewelry designers who seek to harness its natural allure in their creations. The introduction of Amazonite to the Color Blossom collection marks a significant milestone in Louis Vuitton's legacy, showcasing the Maison's ability to embrace innovation while honoring tradition. They're using this same amazing quality. Don't you almost think as well jewelry makers a bit late to the party just saying you know we've been celebrating and really recognizing the beauty of Amazonite night for, yeah. for many a years totally um as has monica veneda by the way um louis vuitton by the way if you want to get hold of one of those uh, color blossom necklaces it's going to cost you 31 and a half thousand pounds love to <laughs> wow my car's not worth that no <laughs> Um, another one, Mishka and uh, Bouchera collaborate on an exclusive new collection. What is that beautiful turquoise blue that you see? Amazonite. Of course, it's Amazonite. Of course, it's Amazonite. And again, these are price points that are way beyond my budget. Mm. We have, did you say 50, Ross? 60. Oh, by the way, if you want <coughs> that piece, uh, the Mishka move iconica okay forty thousand pounds please let's call it 41. cartier working with this gemstone if you want the ring 13 and a half you want the bracelet 60 and a half thousand pounds <clears throat> if you want a single earring just one oh really Fourteen thousand eight hundred pounds and if you want the necklace, by the way, which is teamed alongside Lapis Lazuli, 150,000. And that's a Fine, stranded yeah. necklace. It's a stranded necklace, yeah. Just a stranded... But the others have got a certain amount of gold, goldsmithing work. That's a stranded necklace. Everybody, all of you can make that. 100%. All you of know, you. I always think this is interesting as well, that, that actually Amazonite is so current and recognised now that they're even using in their descriptions. Look, these jade beads have been dyed, they're jade, a light Amazonite color. They're dyeing <laughs> jade to look like Amazonite, Amazonite now. Wow. Wow. Crazy. Okay. When the Obamas met the queen, Michelle oh, Obama, wore these beautiful earrings, which are Amazonite earrings. Oh, wow. Picture of above celebrates two very important subjects, uh, foreign affairs and fashion. First Lady Michelle Obama impressed once again, she, yeah, so stylish, isn't she? With a shimmery uh, printed ensemble and earrings to match from Philips Frankel collection. Um, on the first couple's uh, meeting, the role 
Britain's royal couple as well as Prince William and the new Duchess of Cambridge, Kate Middleton. The costly pair of jewels Mrs. Obama donned were uh, constructed with Amazonite gemstones, 14 karat gold and 206 rubies. Yeah, two and a half thousand pounds. There you go. But beautiful, absolutely beautiful. It's wonderful that, that this beautiful gemstone is actually finally getting the recognition it deserves. Um, you want it to be natural, by the way, jewelry makers, of which yours definitely is. I have 60 available. We have waited some years to get this back. Um, in all the Amazonite that we have seen of late, we haven't had any cubes. No. No cubes whatsoever. They're stunning. And that's because it's a, it w might not appear it, but it's actually very difficult because you need to be precise. You also want to have almost like a pillow shape and you want that fat checker. It's mm. the checkerboard fasting that makes it really challenging. Um, what's that? You'd be teaming this with the red tourmaline. Yeah, definitely. It's not red tourmaline though, is it? Let's be honest, it's rubellite. Yeah, that's lovely. Look at that. Vivid, two vivid colours together, aren't they? amazing or if you wanted to go flying on pre-order i also think it would look lovely it would look lovely <gasps> oh the aquamarine hang on hang on oh hello what about that like a tropical sea says adam oh my goodness now yeah, while we're at it look if we're going for blues look yeah they all work together they do I don't know, they're all amazing, all absolutely amazing jewellery makers. These are going to sell out today, I'm certain of it. Um, it's been, it has been years since we've brought you faceted cubes and any um, big parcels of anyway. And just to open up this deal of the day opportunity, we start at 900, uh, sorry, not 900, 99 pounds and 99 pence. No, but the reality is, better. yeah, the reality is, look, you get 31 grand if you mm. go to Louis Vuitton and they're not even massive amounts of Amazonite. Um, wasn't it like 150,000 if you go to, if you go to Cartier? Mm. Yeah, you know, not, not, they're not small, low prices by any stretch of the imagination. Make sure you are checking out everyone. We have 60, because this is not your price. Already we've got people trusting the process like Denise and Tamina and Tracy and Anna and London and new customers and West Midlands. Well done to you all. 49.99. 49.99. Not done. Oh. We're not done, Alison. We're going even oh. lower. Bubble styles, how lovely oh, would this be in a bubble style? It would look great in a bubble style. Mix it in with others, get that uh, shape texture going. Yeah. Mix it in with some pearls, it's going to look absolutely stunning. Yeah, I love it. Or just keep it all pure cubes. Don't you think it Anything's brings like a look... contemporary twist as oh, well to your jewellery? It really adds like a modern edge to yeah. it, I think. And and, it, and and you only get that surface luster in a cube. I think that's one of the reasons so many of us absolutely adored it. Love those um, together. Yeah, that is gorgeous. That's a little bit like the Michelle Obama earrings, isn't it? Where hers is with rubies, yours is with rubellite, so actually rarer. Um, and again, shows you the actual quality of mm. the Amazonite that you're getting here as well, jewellery makers. Good luck. Shop ahead. We are not stopping. Can you believe it? At 49.99, we are going wow. even lower. Well done to those of you that, I mean, rosary link in between these. Oh, that would look amazing. Rosary link them. Use them in your with your um, endless loom and do and do nice. loom bracelets with them. These are going to be so versatile. Twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence. Am I right? And I'm happy to be proven wrong on this one. Am I right in saying that these we didn't have thirty eight centimeter strands before? I, d I don't remember cubes being a full no. 38 centimetre strand. I might be wrong, but the fact that these are exactly that, and it's yeah. natural, and it's Louis Vuitton, and it's Cartier, and it's all those big designers gemstone in their collections, and we're bringing it to you at 30 quid. We only had 60 though, so you will need to get a little bit of a wriggle on. Denise has got two. Tamina and Tracy and Anna and Brenda and Atia and West Sussex and Jane and Ali and Patricia and Maker and Surrey and Mary, well done to you, and Janice and Irene in Swansea, uh, a Maker in Lancashire, uh, Forest Dean, you've got yours, amazing. Congratulations, there's 60 available opportunities. I mean, you can take inspiration, save yourself the two and a half grand, take inspiration from Michelle Obama's beautiful earrings. Yeah. Bead embroidery, you could do that, couldn't you? Oh, yeah, totally. 
And I always think the, 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 the square gives you more versatility for unisex jewellery. Yeah, I totally agree. Yeah, I think it, it just has that more. Like, uh, whether it's more modern, I don't know. It's but certainly, yeah, I agree. It's more modern. I do agree with what you're saying. I had 60. At the bottom of the table. We are, oh yeah. We are launching or relaunching your cube selection. Love it. We appreciate that you have waiting, waited best part of three years, maybe even more. Believe it or not. Can't believe we're going lower. Yeah, it's it's been a long time in the waiting, hasn't mm. it? We go lower. This launches, relaunches. Wow. Your faceted cube collection. And it's not stopping at 29.99. I can't emphasize enough how the world, the popularity of Amazonite, how drastic it has been over the past few years. You know, there's a few gems that I would put in that same category. Amazonite, Appetite, Malachite. Yeah massively popular gemstones that would we've got ones that have always been that constant but gemstones that were almost almost in the shadows yes not the case anymore we go even lower jewelry makers um make sure you're there 60 for a deal of the day that's a very limited quantity jewelry makers so you will need to be quick checking these out those beautiful tropical blues that have turned the head of all the big designers the likes of louis vuitton at 31 and a half thousand pounds these will absolutely fly out the door they should be here well they are to be truthful they also um, are introducing or reintroducing your faceted cubes to your um to your portfolio and it is your portfolio it's not a stash it's a portfolio look at the quality and it's <gasps> natural 19.99 jewelry makers you'd be wow. hard pushed to go into places like like Monica Venado, which I love Monica mm. Venado. I love her designs, firstly. And I love the fact that she's designer, but not quite at those silly prices that, you know, become un uh, incomprehensible. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like 31 and a half grand. Who's got that? Yeah, yeah. Knocking yeah. around. I know there most, are some most of people. Us, most of us. Most of us don't. Yeah. Whereas Monica Venado is achievable. Yeah. She has always, she has always championed this gemstone. But even she is not this price. No. Even she. I mean, three of those on 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 some of the cord we've had um, as a friendship bracelet. Hmm. Amazing, absolutely amazing. There is so much you can do with these. They'll go through. I mean, with your with your metal your sheet metal work. Could you imagine channel setting these? Oh, that'd be gorgeous. Yeah, I they look amazing. Alison, did you know we used to supply Monica Venado at Amazon? Oh, did you? Did you not know that? Yeah. Yeah. And that as well. And we used to use the same building for certain things. Same building to make some sterling silver pieces. Yeah. But her, her Amazonite was literally the same as our jewelry yeah. maker Amazonite. Literally the same. I, li I remember going to, um, to India where Dave is right now. Mm. You look one way, jewelry maker. You look the other. Just Amazing. saying. Just saying, 19 pounds and 99 pence jewelry makers, Weldon Shoe, Lorraine, Vera, Northamptonshire, Diana, um, Anne, Norma, Elaine, Jane, Brenda, Barbara, Hello to you, Janice getting three, Karen, Tracy's got two, West Sussex and Jane and Ali. Um, hello Vera, I Aww. love these faceted cubes. They are my favorite cut. L, you are right, usually 30 centimeters. I usually add sterling silver two millimeter beads between each cube. Thank nice. you, Vera. Do you know when you have that little thing, that little thought? I was like, were they this length? Mm. And my, I've got a really, I've got a great memory for strands and gemstones here at Jewelry Maker. I can't remember what I did last week, but <laughs> you know. But in terms of what we brought on air, yeah. I seem to remember things like this. Thank you for that, Vera. Nineteen ninety nine. They will sell out. I've only got sixteen left. There is a queue on the phone line. So Lucen, what a pretty name, Lucy. Is that Lucen or Lucine? Lucine and Kent, Maker, Maker, Sally, Sandra, Kay, Norma, make sure you're checking out. I'm going to leave it with you. Stay where you are. Oh, I really love this next strand. I love them. Oh. It's so bizarre. I mean, I'm a big believer in fate. Hello, Caroline. Cubes are fab for earrings. Oh. Yeah, I totally agree. Hope I, you're doing well, Caroline. Sending love. Sending lots of love, yeah. Um, 
I'm a big believer in fate and I often think like, like for example, I remember watching Gemporia before Jewelry Maker start and thinking, oh, I'd love to do that job. Ta-da! <laughs> and I, I came for an interview, I didn't even know where I was going. I didn't know what, what it did. Anyway, it's weird because I actually sat down this morning and I was, of all the gemstones I could think of, I was like, we well, must ask Wayne to get some lovely quality kind like that. My very first wall of fame was with kyanite. Do you was make it? a kyanite? Fate, that is, Alison. It is. I need that strand. I love this strand. The quality of Stunning. the kyanite, it's all down to that. Think about like the Royal Engagement Ring, which is a sapphire, granted, but you want that colour in a kyanite. Yeah. This is the most limited of the entire collection. Look at that blue. You could dive into it, couldn't oh, you? Oh, you could. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. And I love the fact that Sometimes you're getting that silvery sheen and then you can turn it the other way and you're getting that depth of it because of the that, way it's yeah, created, the dual isn't it? dual axes, yeah. It's, a, it's what we call, a, it's a polymorph gemstone, but it's also, it, it forms in different hardnesses. So it's very difficult to cut kyanite. Mm. So I'm, I, I would never have entertained the fact that we'd have kyanite in faceted cubes because it is so difficult to cut. It literally, one side of the gemstone, in one direction of the gemstone will be four on the most scale. On the other, it'll be seven and a half. Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? It's amazing. So then we've faceted a cube. We really see kyanite. And we really see it natural. Yeah. yeah. It's normally either filled or heat treated or... We've had dyed variety kyanite, and I'm okay with all of those. But the ideal is natural. Here we go. This is what Alison was just referencing. That's how the crystal forms. Can you see how some are like vertical, some are diagonal, mm. some are horizontal? And you've got to cut that. Yeah. And you need to cut it so it includes dual axes. That's what high, um, increases the hardness. So difficult and complex. Oh gosh, yeah. Just over half the stock has gone, jewelry makers. Yeah, exactly. This is the kind of location that it comes from. This is why we rarely ever see kyanite. Um, it is one of the most difficult and complex gemstones to source because it forms in, at extreme altitudes. Um, and still to this day, it's done by hand. Obviously, you can't get heavy duty machinery up there. Um, you can't get, you know, your diggers and things like that. So it is pickaxe and shovel and literally then brought down on, on wow. backpacks or something like that. Um, we're about to bring you the most limited quantity in 30 seconds. We're going even lower. Can you believe that? Natural kyanite, not filled kyanite or reconstituted kyanite, that wonderful, the foothills um, of Nepal where you get that wonderful blue that you could almost dial into. I agree with what Alison's saying. I love the fact that most of the time, kyanite can have a natural chatoyancy. It's mm. not what we would refer to as a phenomena gemstone, but you know, I always think it looks like driving rain. You know, like yeah. this morning, yeah. Alison, you know, when you're driving and, and the rain is coming down sideways yeah. and you almost have that silver that's what i see in in top quality kyanite <laughs> multi buyers getting involved jewelry makers definitely one we would love to see your creations oh, on the yes. wall of fame 29.99 wow i could probably count on one hand the amount of kyanite opportunities i've seen in 2024 agreed oh yeah in fact no probably i could we've had three well, I was going for two with the side scene, so I've missed one. We had eight, six, and four limited. No, I don't think we did have the four. We had eight and six. Yeah, you're right. You're right, Alison. It is two. This is three. Yeah, yeah. This three is three. three. $29.99. Denise has got two. I'm with you, Denise. I'd multi buy as well. Anna, well done to you. Suzanne, Irene, hello to you. Atia, Diana, West Sussex, Kent, uh, Merseyside, hello to you. Elaine, Elaine in Yorkshire, Elaine in East Riding in Yorkshire. Maker says, uh, give me two. Diana, Mary in Surrey, Kay in London and June and Deborah and Pam and Alison and Jacqueline. I'm not surprised. Can I just say one of the most dreamy combinations if you really want to capture sort of the, 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 the snow-capped mountains mm -hmm. that this location, this gemstone often forms. Totally. If I was to put it... Come on. Oh. Oh, oh my goodness. Those. Come on, that's amazing, isn't it? I've got 10 oh, left. No. I mean, you don't even need to. You could literally just alternate, couldn't you? Should you, we do it? Could. 
By the way, the Rubelai is flying on pre-order. There's a hundred. It's actually the biggest <laughs> quantity. And I don't know if we've ever done a Rubelai strand. To be honest, I don't think we've ever... I think we've done a little one. Have we? I'm like one of those sure a little sort of five like centimetre... Yeah, the taster strand. Yeah. Okay. I've got... A f or, or a few stones, I'm trying to remember, because I'm sure I've got some I know we've done rubelite, but whether it's done in a strand... Uh, oh, I see. Yes, it might have been individuals. Now, are you ready, Alison? Because I know this is pulling on your heartstrings. It is. They both are. That, that, well, this is my birthstone. Oh, for all you March babies too. out there, could that be any more perfect? No. That quality of... I'm just going to... I'm almost, I'm, I'm almost reluctant to take that away. That's the thing. They belong together, those two. They don't do, they? don't they? They really do belong together. Oh, natural. Yeah. It's not treated. Amazing. You go to Pragnal. You go to Pragnal and see the prices that they're, they're natural quality. Is it Brazilian? It certainly looks Brazilian to me because of the quality of the colour. See what prices they bring you, um, natural aquamarine for. We've said this many a times on our screens previously, that aquamarine is the number six of the big yeah. five. And by the way, it used, to be, it used to be the gemstone of engagement. Long before De Beers swooped on in there with their marketing campaign, mm. it, the, the, the gemstone of engagement was an aquamarine. Look at that azure blue. Imagine you are having the most gorgeous summer's day, sky blue. I know, nothing like what we saw this morning. I don't know what it's doing now, but... Um, Stretching. Yeah. This is all natural. Usually, usually when you're talking about aquamarine, it, it's more leaning towards the white colours, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's a very soft uh, colour saturations. One of our producers from our sister channel, I, d I don't know, I saw on Facebook the other day, Melissa or Mel, um, she went out as her anniversary with her husband. Um, she's a very beautiful lady as well, really beautiful. And I just noticed a piece of her, she was, you know, she just sat in a fancy restaurant, she had a hand to her face, and the most amazing aquamarine. Oh. Most amazing aquamarine. What made it amazing? This beautiful blue. It's a very soft pastel colour almost. Now, how many do we have, Roscoe? 75 available opportunities. I'm going to show you the should be. Oh, let's stop doing this. You know we never listen to should be. I know. Why change the habit of a lifetime? £39.99. pence. A third of the stock has gone already. Wow. Imagine it dotted in between pearls. It would look amazing with pearls. <gasps> Imagine it with those peachy ones that we had <gasps> last hour. Oh, yes. I'd also put it with the with the quartzite jade. Oh, that would be lovely. Because you've got those sort of pastel tones the in there that colours, go yeah. lovely. In fact, Are you ready, jewelry makers? Because we're not even go. stopping at thirty nine ninety nine, Alison. We're going even lower. Again, look at that. By definition, that's perfect, isn't wow. it? Wow. I love aquamarine with all the history and the sentiments. It's been adored and adorned in jewellery for literally thousands of years. Of course, um, history tells us that eight, uh, sailors used to throw an aquamarine into the ocean. Not that you'll do that these days. Um, to calm the seas and allow them safe passage. But again, the gemstone of engagement. And it is beautifully romantic. A wonderful variety of the Beryl family, which has the perfect element, perfect volume of iron. That's what achieves this beautiful azure blue that is so well only really synonymous to aquamarine there's not really another gemstone i think you can even remotely compare 29 pounds and 99 pence only so wait a second what's that if we had 50 what you mean you're going lower there's 75 lower. natural not heat treated most aquamarine I'm not saying all but a a lot of the aquamarine that you will see out there will be heat treated. And I haven't got a problem with that at all. That's fine. It's take, they, they heat treat it to actually take away the greens that you sometimes see in aquamarine. There's no green. That's all blue. Pure blue. And we're going to go even lower. But also, Ross, can I just say, I think people are going to want to buy multi-buy across yes. this collection, aren't they? 
This is the biggest quantity that we have had so far. There's 75 available and the phone lines on the web are absolutely stacking up now, jewelry makers. I mean, look at that. They need to be together, don't they? Oh, they do. Um, how much was the kyanite? Sorry? 29.99, so you've matched the price, but because this is a bit bigger in quantity, we're going a little bit lower. So already, can I just say, 60 pounds for those two, that's epic. You know, in our immediate days, we'd have never seen a kyanite anywhere near double figures. Gosh, no. We wouldn't have got kyanite this longer strand, firstly. It definitely wouldn't have been double figures. Um, um, aquamarine, no way. Three figures, high three figures. And that's not me discrediting a media. They didn't have the buying power that Jewelry Maker does now. Good luck, everyone. What? 50 pounds, Alison, I can get both of these. You're 50 kidding me. pounds. And I missed while I was in the break. Look at those. Unbelievable. Oh, no. The phone lines and the web have gone crazy. Again, there's a little bit of inspiration for you. Beautiful snow-capped mountains. Well, these these strands, because I want all of these. Uh-huh. You better so, get your so, iPad then. Yeah, I was going to say they're on a warning. They're all pretty limited, Alison, mm. and they're all very popular. Um, so I, I can't emphasise, if you wanted the Amazonite, check it out. If you want the um, Type A Jadeite, make sure you check it out. If you want the Rubelite, check it out. If you want these, definitely check it out. Because the phone lines has gone crazy. We've got an amazing wow. hour coming your way. We've got Quartzite Jade coming up. In fact, whilst you're making those confirmations, I just want to give you a little sneaky peek. Because these are, I mean, we are officially, it's the, it's the day of the equinox, yeah? We, we think it is. Text in if we're wrong. Um, or text in if we're right, whichever way. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you're wrong. Um, so, but look at these lovely colours though. It is, is officially autumn. I know. Um, and, and for me, your quartzite jade, the newest variety of jade, personifies your autumn colours. They are all natural. They're coming up, including you've got this car, you've got this piece. These have been pushed back and pushed back and pushed back. Today we say, no, we've absolutely got to play these. And then that gorgeous butterfly necklace at the very end. Um, coming up within this hour as well, jewelry makers, but make sure you're checking out on your deal of the day. Beautiful glacial blues of natural, mm -hmm. not heat treated kyanite. Phil and Angela, Brenda, Wendy, Joanne, Susan. I, I can remember Christine. when- Christine. Again, for the aquamarine, you'd be looking at a, a 10 centimeter strand for that. Yeah. I remember, do you remember like what, Mark launching a Santa Maria aquamarine strand? I do, yes, I might and have bought it. Santa Maria <laughs> is not just the location now, Santa Maria is a, is, is, is a terminology of quality, mm. so they use that as a description of quality. Um, same as like Pareva Tourmaline, they yeah. use Pareva Tourmaline as a description of quality as well. And that was £350. Yeah. I'm not seeing outside of these four walls, that was here at Jewelry Maker, it was an incredible strand. Red tourmaline, <laughs> rubelite, let's all just say it as it is. It's flying on pre-order. It's the biggest quantity that we have incredibly. It's coming up in one more auction. Oh, look at that. That's stunning. Unbelievable. And that's all totally natural. Ross, can I just, can I just, start? I thought it was Ruby. Can I ask something, Ross? Because obviously um, I will prep for a show every day um, the evening before. And I'll be honest, Ross, because it said red tourmaline. I was like, okay, okay, I'm a bit confused. And came mm -hmm. in, I was like, that's Ruby. We've got obviously done a typo or something like that. Can you research, just so we can put it onto a slide, what the definition of rubelite is? Because I'm fairly sure I've, um, the GIA will actually say, rubelite is where a tourmaline will hold a red color and a pink color under wow. all lighting conditions. That's what quantifies it. Yeah. There's no such thing as red tourmaline. It's rubelite. Now, that's coming up in one auction. Do shop ahead. But right now, unbelievable that we're including this gemstone into this portfolio. What a collection this has been. It is all natural, type A. Remember that melting ice cube description? That references the water content of the jade itself. So, yes, you want colour with your jadeite, of course. And this is the classic... 
uh, apple blossom green but you also want it to have a perfect crystal structure so it's not opaque it's not matte um, you want it to almost have this wet look to the surface which i think absolutely um the checkerboard faceting to your cube really really highlights now this is again incredibly limited incredibly limited in its quantity as each and every single one of these have been you are looking at 55 carats jewelry makers of your type a burmese jadeite and in my head I'm sure many of you agree because something we always talk about with jade eye is how lovely it looks with red yes. because of course red is quite a classic combination with this gemstone so imagine teaming it with the rubellite stunning we teamed the other blues didn't we the amazonite and the aquamarine and the kyanite together for me that's what I would do with this for me I think the rubellite the classic with the um with the Burmese jade both of these are coming up right now for your Burmese jadeite, type A, not type B or type C. Um, just so you know, for people that maybe are new to the jade, uh, jade world, um, type B or type C is basically either pollen impregnated or dyed. Uh, this is natural, literally natural. And we could hear, I mean, look, pop along to Mason and Kay. See what kind of prices that you will find type A Burmese jadeite. And that's the only gem they sell, by the way. One of those on a single cord is easily three figures. Yeah. At, at Mason and Kay. You won't struggle to research it because if you go to Mason and Kay, and, and be mindful if you're looking on places like um, Etsy. I'm not tarnishing everyone with the same brush as well, but... but Some of it. There are fakes out there, and, and particularly with your jade, because it's so valuable. Mm. You want to see the certificate of authenticity. You want it to be type A grade. So that's why I say go to Mason and Kay. They only deal in type A jade. So it's easy to actually uh, reference um, and compare. So one of those on a cord, which is quite a traditional look for jade, would be three figures. One cube I'm talking about. We're bringing you a full 38 centimetre strand. It goes amazing with the rubellite, doesn't it? At 99 pounds and 99 pence. That's a deal. That's, yeah. I mean, that's a big jump, Ross. Sorry, Ross just says something in my ear. And I was like, oh, it's lovely that. quality. Again, a melting ice cube. That's the best description that I can give you for, 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 for quality jadeite. It should look like it's almost melting. Mm. That tells you've got the fine crystal structure and the water content within. It has been years, jewelry makers, since we've brought you a faceted cube. Years. You might have seen them sporadically here or there, but you know, as a big part of Yeah, as yeah. a showcase, it's been over three years. We not just gonna drop that price by a little bit we're gonna half it Alison that is, that is crazy that is crazy the amount of work that goes into them I mean if you look at them look at the consistency yeah. with them look at all those diamond faceted because it's not just going facets. Mm, 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 no. six times to make a cube no you know that's one thing it's a cube which is millimeters precise yeah then you want it to be, have a soft curve like a pillow. Yeah. And then you want to do the checkerboard faceting on the surface. Yeah. We've halved that price, jewelry makers. Wow. And we're still not done. <gasps> Remind me, Ross, how many we have? 60, okay. We're never, the days of us bringing you Burmese jadeite, type A Burmese jadeite, in like quantities like 100, 200, they're so far away. We can't do it. Remember the mine closed in 2020. Incredibly, that's four years ago. I still think the year 2000 was like a few years ago. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 2020 was four years ago. That's one of the most significant location of jadeite closed. 800 years of history done. And we're still able to bring it to you, jewelry makers, but unfathomably, we're under 50 pounds and we're going even lower. It's been a long time since we've seen it. I love it, literally knotting this maybe alongside the rubellite. Or would you stick to the pastels? You know, I would maybe go, you know that beautiful pearl strand that we had a few mm -hmm. moments ago with the golden colors? How with nice would two. that be? See, those two are beautiful. That's pretty, isn't it? Yeah. That's really I pretty together. I do like together. those together. Oh, now they blend so beautifully. I can't decide between these. You know, they're all one. It's like it's one of those twenty nine. What Ross? 
This it's is Burmese jadeite. What's the ca that, that's a big carrot weight. 55 carrots? Yeah. So wait, right now, your Amazonite was how much? 20 pounds. The Kyanite was how much? 29.99. The Aquamarine was how much? 19.99. And 40. your Burmese Jadeite is 29.99. So I, I, you've got all four for under 100 pounds. For under 70. Is it? No. Oh, is it? Under one hundred oh, pounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Oh, you're just counting those two. Yeah. Oh my goodness me! At twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence, jewelry makers, um, make sure you are checking out your basket. Yeah, that combination is absolutely stunning. Now, something that ha I've got to move on because the red tourmaline in Dicolite, whichever way you want to refer to it, is absolutely flying. I'm not surprised. You know, we've been established for fourteen years. Amazing, fourteen wonderful years, and we've brought you in. Dic uh, we've brought you rubellite before. We have brought you rubellite before. Um. In fact, was this my presentation, Ross, when I launched Rubelite once? Okay, so basically, I know we've had it in individual cuts in those little white boxes, and I think we might have had like a Gems of Distinction strand where you got like a couple of examples mm. on there. I think that's it. I think they were tiny, tiny little drops. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Um, we actually don't have a PowerPoint for Rubelite, so that speaks, that says, says it How as it is. How long ago? Um, why is that? Rube you can get tourmaline, which is that wonderful variety of gemstone that historically they believe can fall fell through the sky through a rainbow and that's how it got all these wonderful colors i think oh that's a lovely story isn't it amazing but it's actually gemologically f absolutely fascinating if you ask most gemologists what their favorite gemstone is most of them do say tourmaline because i can look at say pink and i can look at let's say orange or green tourmaline whichever one you want and chemically they will all be different Chemically, Amazing. they will all have a different chemical composition, composition, and over fifty chemicals. You want to write the, the you know, the um, chemical composition of a diamond? It's C. Very simple. If you want to write the chemical composition of tourmaline, I don't know. <laughs> I, honestly, I generally do not know. I wouldn't know um, because it's literally a row after yeah. row after row of chemicals. P consider that for a minute. That means you've got to have fifty plus chemicals. Imagine you've got a globe in front of you. You spin it and you get a pin, stick a pin in it somewhere, somewhere on our vast, beautiful planet. Now, where that pinpoint on the globe hits, you need to have 50 plus chemicals present, not just that, at the perfect heat, temperatures and pressures to form a tourmaline. I, that blows my mind. But obviously some tourmalines are even rarer than others. Now let's go to the International Gem Society, which is you know, as reputable as the GIA. And they say rubellite tourmaline value, price, and jewelry information. They say rubellites are tourmalines with um, reasonably saturated dark pink to red colors and medium to dark tones. They make excellent jewelry stones and ruby red color specimens without orange or brown overtones are highly prized. Once upon a time, jewelry makers, I remember, I, I forget, I'm not going to name names or, who, or, or whatever. I did see somewhere on Facebook and it was like, oh yeah, but a rubellite with inclusions is not a, a, a rubellite. Not true. Uh, tourmalines are usually accepted for their inclusions. It's like an emerald. Um, they are a type three gemstone, so we do expect them to have those mm -hmm. characteristics. In fact, I remember seeing a Bulgari rubellite ring online. Um, it was a pre-owned piece of jewellery and it was huge hugely included still a rubellite though still a rubellite inclusions have no significance on the actual gemstone what quantifies rubellite is the amount of reds and pinks and the lighting conditions that it sustains that colors now here in the studio we're looking at its worst possible light so if we here in the studio saying rubellite wait till you see it at home oh gosh yeah wait till you see it in the flesh it's oh. incredible I'm going to read it again whilst you look at it on the back of my hand. Okay. Rubellite tourmaline value, price, and jewelry information. Rubellites are tourmalines with reasonably saturated dark pink to red colours and a medium to dark tone. So you want it to have that depth. 
They make excellent jewelry stones and ruby red color specimens without orange or brown overtones are highly prized. Look at the color of the chart. Look at the color of mm -hmm. the chart behind, you know, what it's printed on. I think jewelry makers, this is our first ever rubelite. 38 centimetre strand. Mm -hmm. I think this is the biggest parcel we've ever done of rubelite. The largest carrot weight all day long. We've, we know we have done it in individual stones and maybe sh very short strands. You know the ones yeah. with the white tassels on the end? In the little gold box. Yeah. This is our biggest quantity, jewellery makers. I don't care that our graphics say red tourmaline. There isn't such a thing as red tourmaline, it's rubelite. We've got we've got a hundred of these available and they're flying on pre-order. Are you ready? Imagine this in a rubelite tassel. Oh gosh. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Imagine three of them in a rubelite ring. Yeah, like a trilogy. Yeah. Oh, amazing. Okay. I'd love to put these Not in. Not your price. The rarity of the gemstone means that this should be high. Should be. Here you go. If I had fifty of these, that would be your closing price. Um but lucky for you, we've got double that quantity. What is rubelite? These aren't my words, by the way. These are uh, words taken from reputable websites. We wouldn't show them otherwise. What is rubelite? Rubelite is a pink to red variety of tourmaline. The name is derived from the Latin root meaning reddish. Um, and it is one of the most treasured tourmaline, uh, tourmaline in its family for its exceptional color. Mother nature is stingy. Oh, I like that word. Mm -hmm. Is stingy with beautiful reds. Purists believe the designation uh, rubelite should only be applied to tourmalines that exhibit true red color under incandescent or natural light sources. Like I just said earlier on, jewelry makers, we are under the worst possible lighting condition for any gemstone. We're under floodlights. Yeah. And you can yeah. see that definite red, can't you? Oh, gosh, yeah. Our biggest collectors and jewelers have shopped ahead on this on pre-order. That's very telling. Yeah. How often do we see rubelite? You tell me. I think twice, ever, I think. I don't know about with Carol, obviously, but I think with me, maybe twice. I, I think it's one of the rarest seen gemstones on our channel. Yeah. And most likely our sister channel as well. We're not stopping there, jewelry makers. I've got a hundred available. I think I've seen more Paraba than I've seen of this definitely. on our channel. Yeah, definitely. Definitely, yeah. Because yeah, we've sent, had a few strands. How about then, jewelry makers? <gasps> what? No, 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 no. We're not done. No. We're not done. No. The final piece and oh the return of the fasted cube and what a finale it is. What, making what? The last, yeah. uh, I don't like, Those prices. <laughs> well, when was the last time you saw Rubelite? Can't remember. I, d I generally don't know. I generally do not know. Ivy House, maybe, maybe when Marie, Marie was buying. Yeah, maybe. And they were literally like slices, weren't they? Little yeah. slices, like the watermelon tourmaline that we had. Yeah. Do you remember? That I think was the last time I saw it. It wasn't in a strand. They weren't drilled. They no. were lovely. Don't get me wrong. But it wasn't a 38 centimetre strand of one of the world's rarest treasures. Oh my gosh. With that red colour, we've got 100 available. I can't even believe that we're contemplating going even lower on this, Roscoe. You know, I would put this alongside my top end gemstones. Yeah. High end gemstones. Stunning. I can't believe you've done this, Ross. If we had 50. We'd have had, we'd have been paying forty nine ninety nine fifty pounds, but we had a hundred, so therefore twenty four pounds and ninety nine pence. Hello, Pansy, getting to Joanne and Carol and Lorraine. Renfusher and West Sussex says, give me three. Mary wants two. Kent wants two. Yeah. Ellen, Alison, Chandy, Tracy, Suzanne, Alison, Christina, June, Sarah, London, new customers. June is getting involved. Gillian, Maker in West Midlands. Jane, J uh, J another Jane. Jane in Somerset. Jane in County Durham. Norma, Brenda, Anne, June. Julian Boston, hello to you. Is that Boston, UK or Boston, US? Uh, US? Uh, Northamptonshire, hello to you, Channel Islands. I asked that question because we know that we have got we have got um, American. American viewers. Yeah. 
who frequently purchase with us. I think Gigi was shopping earlier on from California. We know we've got um, jeweler, literally jewelers in San Francisco um, who actually shop with us as well. Um, we've got customers in Australia, we've got customers in Germany, we've got customers all around the world. Maker in uh, West Midland, telling you Sally and Monica. Deborah, you can do it. We had a hundred opportunities. We are, I don't care what it says in black and white on our screens right now. And remember the same applies with the ruby and, and pink sapphire. That's the eye of the beholder, you know. Yeah. So what you might, so, so for example, I know I have brought to air strands and our graphics have said pink sapphire. And I've gone, it's not pink sapphire, that's ruby. It's, okay. it's got too much chrome, it, well not too much. It's got enough chromium for it to quantify ruby status. Yeah. That similar story when it comes, well, it's the same story when it comes to your um, to your tourmaline. Rubelite needs to have that red presence to quantify the Rubelite title, but it is rare and very collectible. I've got 21 of these left, jewelry makers, so no. you will need to check out those baskets. And somebody else might look at that same strand and go, no, that's pink sapphire, definitely pink sapphire. I'll be okay. It, you could have that same discussion with your tourmaline. Yep. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking amazing. out your baskets. What an amazing return. Um, the collection of your faceted cubes. Please get your authentic... I can't say authentic that. Authentic certificate. Card. And also, please do your market research because don't sell that. That is not That is oh, not no. the price you should, be, you should be looking at. That is, that is jewellery maker crazy price. So if you're selling your jewellery... Don't undersell it because people no, won't I believe agree. it is what you're saying it is. And go back to what but I was just definitely. saying. You know, like a customer was saying, oh, there's too many inclusions for it to be a yeah. rubelite. Look at the example on that website. Oh, rubelite specimen. Look at how heavily included this photograph is. Yeah. It's a specimen of rubelite and you can see how heavily included it is. Look at the quality of the colour as well. That deep red, that really deep red, the dark tones. Remember we were talking yeah. about that? Um, have you ever wondered? So when you're talking about colour of gemstones, it's three factors, by the way. So we look at saturation, yeah, so what colour yeah. is it? Then we look at tone, now that becomes, tone is basically how light or dark it is. So you know if you were to take a photo and you wanted to darken it or lighten it, you, you play More with tone. the tone. So you want the darker tone and then you start talking of the hue. Hue is like secondary colours coming through. Um, secondary colours, so pinkish hue. This will have a pinkish hue to the red darker tone, red saturation. That's that's what quantifies Rubelite. Unbelievable, well done everybody. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. And um, there's six left. Uh, keep an eye on the quantities of the previous. Now your quartzite jadeite, this has been one of the most long awaited showcases. Um, well, of, of all possibly, I don't know. It's been put back, put back, put back. This is coming up jewelry makers in a few moments time, just after the break. Check out and well done. We'll see you after this. Are you ready to elevate your jewellery making to new heights? Join us for Season 3 of Britain's Next Gem and bring your creative vision to life. Our expert panel is on the lookout for one outstanding jewellery maker to invest in. Think you have the talent and drive? Apply today and make your dream a reality. To apply, you must be aged 18 and over and be available to travel to the Jewellery Maker Studios on the 18th and 19th of September. Please send your name, your jewellery making specialities, images of your designs and a bit about yourself to guestdesigner at jewellerymaker.com. Good luck and we look forward to seeing you in the next round. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewellery Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker.
Did you know that you can shop for pre-show deals on Jewelry Maker? Head over to jewelrymaker.com every day between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m., click on Watch Live, scroll down for brilliant products, last of stock items, and amazing deals. But these deals are only available for one hour, and once they're gone, they're gone. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Do you have a stunning piece of jewelry you've crafted? Share your masterpiece with us and you might just see your design featured on the Wall of Fame. Every week, the most dazzling entry will win £100 credit to their account, with £50 credit going to the runner-up. To enter, simply send your entries to studio at jewelrymaker.com by Tuesday at 12pm in time for the Wednesday draw. Snap a pic, send it in, and let your brilliance light up our Wall of Fame. And who knows? Your creation could be the next to sparkle and win. This, okay. I love this gem. A lot goes into the, um, our jewelry maker shows, and a lot of planning goes into each and every single one of you. You know, our team, you know, actually, I'm going to say the jewelry maker team was probably the biggest team out of the partnership, as in the amount of people that actually work towards the show. And that is because, um, oh yeah, hobby makers a big team as well, that's true. Um, anyway, but, but, but. The amount of people that work behind the scenes to actually put together a show because you think about it each kit is constructed that's each product code um all the recordings that are made for you as well all the research that goes in all the marketing mm -hmm. everything it's so so it's not a case of right okay uh, stick l on air and we'll wing it they don't just wing it it takes <laughs> <laughs> sometimes I wing it sometimes I do we have to wing it you have to improvise but a lot does go into the actual planning like Christmas has been planned Christmas show in what 93 days has actually been planned last Christmas um, anyway this showcase and it goes right as far back as little conversations with gem traders, the likes of Bernard, for example, who will have been the person that's actually um, sourced this opportunity for us all today. So it goes back that far. It's not something that literally, oh, here's an idea and it happens overnight or even next week. It takes a lot of planning. Anyway, even from them landing in, uh, in the country, obviously going through our quality assurance process, being booked in, checked in, all the other things that they need to actually do, this showcase has been pushed back and pushed back and pushed back um, on a few different occasions. The reasoning for that is because we said, well, there's been a couple of things. We don't want to rush it. Um, also, we were thinking Equinox Autumn, that would be fantastic mm -hmm. to be able to launch them because with, with your quartzite jade, it is those perfect colors and it's totally and utterly natural. Also, I do fully appreciate that Another reason why we've pushed it back is initially, when we first start introducing Quartzite Jade, and by the way, this is not just us here at Jewelry Maker, this goes to the whole globe. So cast your mind back, say we were around when Burmese Jadeite was actually discovered, say 800 years ago, say we were around then, 
And um, all of a sudden, Burmese jadeite burst onto the scene. They're like, oh, it's a jade. And everybody would be like, no, it's not. Nephrite's jade. Yeah. Nephrite's jade. That's the original jade. We've known that for 9,000 years. Nephrite's jade. Who's jadeite? Jade is chemically totally and utterly different. There was resistance then. Um, however, we overcame it. Jade and nephrite now go under that same umbrella. There is a new offspring to the jade umbrella. And in the same way, it we are a little bit in the in the gemstone industry, we are quite archaic and we are reluctant to change. It's true. Um, a little bit stubborn, some might say. We are in the gemstone world. They don't like change very much. However, this is a big change, and it doesn't come from us. It comes from the East. So let's look at a few different publication, publications, not just in the East, that are talking about this newest variety of jade. Those aren't my words. They're not Dave's words. They are the words of the East. And of course, as you would expect with such a huge introduction to one of the world's most valuable gemstones, all the big editorials are writing about it. Like the New York Times, who said beyond green jade. Remember, Burmese jade is mined out now. Kotan is now illegal to mine. So we have to look at different locations. I know that you can get, and they're different, right? Kotan's nephrite. Burma is jadeite. This is your, gemically, we, we, we clarify it. Um, this is your quartzite jade variety. We, nowhere else would say quartzite. In, we do just so that we can be, so we all understand it better. Does that make sense? This is a jade. They call it court, they, we, they call it jade. We, whilst we sort of overcome that, 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 that change, and it's that curve, isn't it? The, look at the, the, uh, um, the curve of change. We're initially like, no, 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 no. And then you get like acceptance. You're like, okay, okay, all right, yeah. And then you, yeah, okay, I'm all right with this. this you embrace it, absolutely. It's the, um, the curve of change. Anyway, so this is a quartzite jade, the newest variety. If you imagine jade has got three children, there you go. Um, but big editorials are writing about this um, and they're talking about the fact, here we go, they headline it, Beyond Green Jade. In that piece of jewellery, you might be looking at there some of the most amazing Fei Chi, but you're also looking at Quartzite Jade um, in that amazing piece of jewellery. Um, we're going to read on. They go on to say, Golden Silk Jade is most golden yellow and has a radish silk pattern inside, so it's called Golden Silk Jade. Um, of which the internal structure of high quality golden silk jade is delicate and it can reach the pure texture of chalcedony. So chalcedony is known for its beautiful translucency and its amazing ability to retain light in the same way that Jane do uh, jade does. Um, they go on to say high quality golden silk jade combines the warmth of Hessian jade, which is your Kotan, by the way, um, the color of Qianwan, the hardness of jade and the flexibility of a Sushan stone. Sushan stone is a soapstone, basically, so very easy to carve. So it's saying it's the best of everything. It's got the best, the ideal of everything. It's got the hardness of jade and the flexibility of soapstone. Um, and the price is growing fast. So it is favoured by the majority of merchants and consumers. Um, and you can literally see some of your Kotan, uh, sorry, some of your quartzite jade pictured there. Again, look at this article. In 2013, Jade passed um, in the Xinjiang. I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce these, otherwise I'll be here all day. Uh, region local standards. And in 2016, parts the Quartz Jade Classification and Naming National Standard. So it has actually gone to an authority and been named as such. Not us. That's an authority saying that this is a jade classification and naming. Um, national standards, uh, it is a new type of jade variety, still in the embryonic development stage. Around 2010, the jade has just entered people's field of vision. The price at uh, 
this time is low and now a high quality uh, brightly colored transparent texture of the jade often reaches thousands of one a piece therefore the gold silk jade with excellent texture and bright colors has a certain ornamental and collecting value can i just paint a scenario right now so again we know that your quartzite jade has been classified and named a variety of jade yeah um but can you imagine we were there imagine you had an opportunity to purchase cotan before it got astonishingly expensive imagine if you had an opportunity to buy imperial burmese jade before it got in incredibly expensive and actually there's a book just to my left that's actually rich uh, written by richard wise the secrets of the gems trade and he said and he actually says and that and that's that book's quite old actually says if you see a gemstone that you love and you like it buy it if you can afford it buy it because chances are the first time that you see it is the most affordable that you will see it that's where we are right now that's what that, that article references this is the embryonic stage this has been classified a new jade reading on Let's go to Bernard, a trusted source and certainly a friend of ours here at Jewelry Maker. Bernard says the purity of top stones um, is certainly finer than, he's talking about the parcel, this parcel, right? Um, than any other jade, but the rarity of such rush, uh, rough, I can't read today, sorry, such rough um, is the biggest challenge. When they write of material reaching the fine texture of chalcedony, it is this material that has risen too uh, much in value because it's the finest water of all jade. These stones are completely different to normal golden silk that we can procure for you. Um, with that material, you are competing with big players who will pay very high prices, um, and so few stones ever come uh, like this. Why do I almost feel like, uh, at the moment, like it's almost like, so sorry, no, you can't have it. That's what it sounds almost like he's saying. These stones um, are not about color, but are solely valued on their compression. So pure, no coarse moments at all, and as a result, they literally seem to glow or emit a soft internal glow. Of the three quartzite jades, this is the highest quality. He's talking about your Nan Hong, for example. Um, this is the highest quality. And we have only these few opportunities from the, uh, for the studio. Um, a carving and a bangle. So this is all from the same parcel, by the way. But these pieces, like I said, this showcase has been pushed back, pushed back, and pushed back. These first three pieces... The reason we actually have them today, okay, I'm, I'm not surprised. He's, uh, Wayne has just said, bear in mind we've got a big celebration happening on the horizon. It's literally a few days away, isn't it? Jem Pori's birthday, 20th birthday. Today, Wayne, Wayne actually said for today's show, look, give our audience one last viewing because after that they go to our sister channel. Whatever, if we have anything left, they go to our sister's channel for their 20th birthday celebrations and they will be big star by opportunities as well. Of course, because they're brand new, brand new opportunities. They're finished pieces of jewellery as well. They don't need to do anything to it. I'm going to start with the most limited of all, which is the butterfly and bamboo. I'm just going to bring this over towards me for, oh my goodness. And I'm also going to adjust it on that bust. One sec. So you can see the length. Oh. Hello, Caroline. Mm. I've always said if jade, jadeites, nephrites sing to you and you can afford it, then buy it. It chooses you, not the other way around. Quite right, Caroline. Quite right. If you can afford it, and I think that goes for all gemstones, to mm. be honest. If you can afford it, buy it. Because I the reality, very few gemstones go down in value. That's something I always say to mum. If you can afford it and you like it, you buy it. Absolutely. That's Life all that is matters. short. Oh, totally. Absolutely. Treat yourself, especially with legacy pieces like this yeah. that you can pass on. These are all incredibly all natural colours. It's incredible, isn't it? You get two amazing shapes. Well, obviously you've got your bamboo cup, which is 360 around the neckline mm -hmm. and in those drop downs but then you have this absolutely stunning carved butterfly now obviously every single one will be different you can see on the recording that one's more of a reddish yeah. color 
Um, I've got one which is more of a, like a mutton fat color just here. Look at that. Wow. Remember, strong as jadeite with the flexibility of a Sujan stone. How many do we have, Ross? Seven? What? Oh. Are you joking? I know you said limited, but... <laughs> Oh, I'm sad about that. I thought there was going to be more than that, though. Seven collectors, and then it goes to gems. Or it goes to gems. The auction is live. It's an over-the-head necklace, complete feet piece of jewellery, knotted in between each of those bamboos. Yeah. You've got that feichi, that beautiful uh, um, chalcedony fine texture that Bernard was just referencing there as well. That is the material that the industry, the jade industry is going crazy for. Seven available in the world, jewelry makers. Once they're gone, they're gone. Um, if the, if we do have any left, which I highly doubt, then they will go on to our, our sister channel's 20th birthday celebrations. And it'll be a big start by opportunity because it is finished jewelry. We know that you have the talents and the skills to actually sort of make this one of a kind if you wanted to, um, but no need it's a lovely piece as it is it's beautiful i agree with you caroline if the piece of jade that uh, speaks to you and you love it and you can afford it buy it totally 499 pounds only for all the colors that's one of the reasons why i love your quartzite jade is because you get such a, a gorgeous color palette mm. with that translucency now we have said this a few times today because it has been very much a collector's show um, if you have an interest in your exotic gems, your uber rare, your collectible ones, remember yeah. you are sourcing in, in, in the embryonic stage, um, which is the best time to buy any gemstone, of course, because they haven't started that. Well, this has outside of these four walls started that incredible climb, but you're still sourcing it at those embryonic prices. Does that make sense? You totally. think we spoke about 2010. And I know that's 14 years ago, but that's a, na that's a drop in the ocean when you think about the 8,000 years that Kotan's had. Yeah. You see what I mean? Comfortably, we could close here all day long. So I am more than happy to close here. Wow. The carving alone. The carving's st stunning. Look at the little... Um, the antenna yeah <laughs> the, the little <laughs> on top it's beautiful look at the lines on the body beautiful look at the, the color matching as the... well yeah you've got that window can you see green oh it's yellow beautifully. red red green yellow perfectly mirror imaged yeah we're at 299 pounds i've got seven available and today that is not your price one for the collectors and the connoisseurs and i can see two very big collectors already waiting in the pipeline um i'm not going to put a clock on your screens there's only seven available uh, you know if this if you've loved and you're excited about the newest variety of jade and again i need to emphasize we're still in that in that uh, um the change curve aren't we um if you're coming out the other side like we all are we yeah. all are we've understood it we've spoken to gemologists all around the world lots of you know the most uh, um, knowledgeable jade experts okay okay this is the newest variety that's exciting that's an opportunity for us all it's whether we seize that opportunity six left four-way split pay oh goodness me you think how much, what you would have to buy to make this piece of jewellery oh, without yeah. even factoring your time. You're going to have to buy probably, most likely, two or three strands, yeah. I would say, to make the length of the necklace and the carving separately. You're not going to be able to do that for £149, no. are you? No. Unbelievable. Hello, Cheryl. Hello to you, Karina in Pembrokeshire. Hazel in Leicestershire, you're there as well. Um, I'm loving the fact that this trio, they all, are all very different. So if this is the yes. one that you want, um, if you love the carving, you love that drop, then definitely get involved right now. I, uh, on the necklace part, sorry, Alison. Okay. On the necklace part, you have about 50 bamboos. Then you've got the carving of the butterfly. Then you've got another six bamboo beads and the round. Don't forget the round. I, I, I'm lucky enough to have the Lotus version nice. of this. Nice. And, and the quality is phenomenal. And the colour wise, because to me, these colours are quite unique to this gemstone. You don't see no, you don't, this right. sort of colour tone in any other 
any other any variety other? of jade. No, no I agree. It's stunning. Uh, and, and it is that radish, that fine radish mm. uh, yeah. um, formation, if you like, the ref uh, that Bernard was referencing. It's 149 beautiful. pounds. I've only got two left, jewelry makers. So Karina in Pembrokeshire, you can do this. Um, Hazel in Leicestershire, you can do this. You can get hold of it easily. I've got those final two. I've got new customers joining us on the phone line. So look at it against. The, I wanted to show you against the skin mm. tone. Beautiful. Really lights up. Do you want me to put it on? Do you want me to? Okay. You're so selfless. I know. It's a tough <laughs> job. It is a tough job. I mean, hang on. Let me get my hair out of the way. I love the fact that there's no clasps or anything yeah. like that. Oh, look at that. that Have I put just... it on back, back to front? No. There you go. Hang on. Sorry, Jimmy. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. Beautiful. I mean, if you wanted to re-strand it or re-knot it, you could make a, a, a necklace and a bracelet set. Yeah. You could. Let's do this one next. Oh, these are huge. Yeah, they're amazing. I'm only going to take this off only because I don't want it to bang your mic and hurt your ears. But also it gives me an opportunity to wear the next one. <laughs> so um, don't don't hesitate on the butterfly. Colors. It's absolutely beautiful. Of course, uh, that's meaningful as well. Mm. Bidders in straight away. These are some of the largest that we've ever seen actually in your quartzite jade. Um, and each cut is different as well. So can, it's adjustable, this one, by the way. I'll, show, I'll talk to you about that. Now, how many do we have? 17 so it's not oh. we haven't got that many of them lovely range of color i mean perfect autumn tones yeah. this is all natural quartzite jade so you've got that huge 18 millimeter stone and then look you've even got the meaning of the monkey uh the monkey nuts which are very meaningful in, in ancient china as well then you've got the gourd just up here which is faceted all the way round. um if i <laughs> If I show you the reverse as well, you've got the Solomon's bar. So I can wear it like so, or I could drop it down. So you've got that versatility of this piece. It can either be a long line necklace or it could be much, much shorter. Um, I've got quantity, plus you've got two gourds at the top there. Can you see the gourds? Just like, there. That's the one thing I've, I've found with the quartzite jadeite is the quartz like jade sorry is is we almost almost gloss over the fact that we get so many carved individual mm. pieces within it like the last one every single one of those was a carved gemstone yeah. and it's and it's one of those gems that they say it's like it's fantastic for carving yeah. it's like soapstone it carves really really well um I and then you can showcase knot. that it's beautiful isn't it now next price crash jewelry makers I've only got 16, or rather I had. We're under 200 pounds, but we're going to do something extra special. How about a brand new low? I love that gourd. Anybody that has any interest, add it to your basket because we're going to do something huge. So I'm going to say this, say this. If you've loved quartzite jade and maybe not yet made your purchase, today's the perfect chance. And the reason for that is you're going to get some massive, we say close out deals quite a lot. I'm not technically closing them out, but we are reducing the prices to close out deals. The last chance to get hold, and I don't know how, uh, you know, how or if Bernard has any of these available for us. Remember the popularity, some of the big names he said are working with mm. the finest grade, which is what yours is. 60 seconds and we're going to do something crazy. So we don't want, thing. we Sorry. love our sister channel. We don't want to send it over to our sister channel. <laughs> we want our jewelry maker audience to get hold of them. We do. Is that right or wrong? I don't know. And we share a lot. We do. We do share a lot. But our courtside jade, we want that to go to our viewers. Who, I mean, listen, I know our Gemporia audience have got a wealth of knowledge as well, but I know, I know our jewelry maker audience better. And I know how knowledgeable you all are. The newest variety of jade that has been classified as a variety of jade is on your screens right now. And right now we are purchasing it at embryonic prices. Does that make sense? Yeah. When it's new to the industry, but it's not going to stay there for very long. Because remember, some of the biggest names are saying quartzite jade, lovely. You get translucency, amazing colours. I mean, let's be honest, the red jadeites that we've seen in the past, 
would love to look like this, wouldn't they? They've been gorgeous, don't get me mm -hmm. wrong. But that is textbook red. 99.99. 16 of these are available, or rather there was 16. I've got collectors getting involved, I'm not surprised. You've got to remember you're getting two carvings. You're getting the rounds. You're getting the 18 millimeter. You're getting the gorge at the reverse. You've got that fine quality color with the chalcedony translucency. Remember that fine texture chalcedony. It is this material that has risen uh, to, uh, in, remember it's also like translation to, um, that has risen in value because it is the finest water of all jade. Those are, uh, those are Bernard's words. Susan, Cheryl, Christine, Irene, new customer, Susan, well done. Barbara in Sussex, press your option one key, well done. Um, I only have 16 available opportunities. No, I haven't, seven. I got seven. Plus you've got your 0% interest split payment. I'm not gonna say that these are close out because technically we don't wanna close it out. However, we've got to close out deals, haven't we? Janet, well done. Stay where you are on those phone lines and our wonderful call center will get you. I had 16. I have five left available. Five left. After today, they, they won't be on our screens again. They'll be um, part of the Gemporia's uh, 20th birthday celebrations. Um, Irene in D uh, County Down, you've just got yours. Congratulations on the phone line. Um, Barbara, well done. Susan, well done. Christy, there's loads of you there. Um, I'm going to try and squeeze in as many deals as I can. Stay where you are, Janet. This is lovely, yeah. The, uh, the guys in the gallery are saying this is their, his favourite. Would you wear these? I would. I haven't got that one. It's lovely, isn't it? Mm -hmm. The colours. I mean, it's... Do you remember... I'm, go I'm going back. Remember shibori silk? Yes. That was literally it's traditional ancient Chinese shibori silk where they used to fold it and dye it in certain ways. There was one called kicking leaves. Can you remember? Yeah. And I used to think, oh gosh, that's so poetic. Kicking leaves. It, it reminds me of kicking leaves. You've got those wonderful autumnal mm. tones. If I just put my hand behind them. <gasps> Stunning. Oh, look at that. These are all natural. Do you know what we haven't we haven't mentioned either? These are perfect with your big chunky knits and things coming up for oh, yeah. winter. These Absolutely. are fabulous. Love that. That's my favourite one. We are at four nine nine. These are your rice beads with the rounds. I love it. Just really simple design, isn't it? Yeah. Look at that red there. That's like Morello cherry red. Start dialing through. Do you know why you've got those multiple knots at the bottom that you've just passed? To put a pendant on? To put a pendant. Yeah. Isn't that clever that very they think clever. about it? Very, very clever. Yeah, you'll notice it's literally in the centre. Mm. So if you don't want to deconstruct it, because it is knotted for, you don't have to. And you've got enough, by the way, of the cord at the back to make a Solomon's bar or yeah, attach yeah. it to a clasp. We're going to do this in two prize crashes. Ignore 499. Full way interest free, uh, free split pay. The first of your two price crashes. Janet, Kent, Jenny, you're all there straight away. I know I love this as well. It's very wearable, I think. And two price crashes. Woohoo! I love it. Love it on the um, gold cord as well. Yeah, that really, really lovely. Hello, Grace in Essex saying I have this strand. Each one is so un yeah. unique. It is, isn't it? Oh. I think that's something that's quite important as well because I've bought two of, of strands, one for me and one for mum, and they are so different. Very different. Each jade is unique. Yeah. How beautiful love is it. that? That goes back to what Caroline was saying. If you see a jade that, uh, a jade that you love yeah. and you can afford it, buy it. Look how wearable that is. Yeah. I would wear this, if I if this was in my jewellery collection, I would wear this all the time, especially do, during the uh, sort of autumn and winter months. Mm. Um, FYI, there is a 90 second wait on the phone lines, jewellery makers, so um, we've got a message through from Lisa, this is my fave, I just love the colours. Yeah. Lisa, I think a lot of With people you. are saying that as well. Hi Caroline, this necklace is stunning, um, it's a must have, very understated, yes! I, I agree, I agree. I love the yeah. simplicity of it. Nobody's paying 99 99 oh, 
That's ridiculous. In the best wow. way. Amazing. You know when ridiculous becomes amazing? Yeah. That's what this is. It is. And this is something you don't see on many of the others. Some of these gemstones have, have a bicolour. Bi yeah, you've got the blend, haven't yeah. you? Yeah. Beautiful, beautifully done. So you have your beautiful rice bead shapes, then literally the rounds dotted in between. They're absolutely flying. So I don't think, I think it's safe to say this one definitely is not going to be making its way to our sister channel. Sorry about that, guys, who are actually watching right now. Um, get it now. Do get it now. We do, thankfully, have a bigger quantity of these because it has been um, certainly one of the most popular varieties of your quartzite jades that we've brought you. Janet, Jenny, West Midlands, Lorraine, Renfusia, Nicolette, Jennifer, Frida, um, Cambridgeshire, hello to you, Christine, Barbara, Weldon, to you, another Jennifer, Jennifer in Cambridgeshire, and I've got Jennifer in Staffordshire, Barbara, Weldon, to you, Cheryl, Conway, Anna in Derbyshire. You can still do it. There's a little queue on the phone lines but our call center are amazing about 90 seconds um we are very 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 busy long awaited eagerly anticipated showcase that we have literally pushed back pushed back pushed back not because we're like oh no not not yet when we had it scheduled we want not we can't always allocate the time that it, it deserves sometimes they run over and it's like okay let's do it another day let's do it another day but also i think what you know understanding the um the uh, the change curve as well you know initially it's like okay well do we wait till people actually fully understand that quartzite jade and it has that classification which it does now this has the classification what a gorgeous piece of jewelry though um well done susan pauline i've got 11 left <gasps> 20 quid on your split pay that's amazing isn't it if you dial now or you add it to your basket or your app Never mind the 39 people that currently have it in their basket. If you check out first, you've leapfrogged a lot of them. Well, go on, Nancy. You can do like it. Like Nancy. Nancy, if you check out now, darling, you have leapfrogged 39 people. That was one of the very first lessons my husband learned when he, when he was at home and he, he was buying for me while I was to on check screen. Out. Yeah, because he'd put it in the basket. It was, and I never Lucky. got this strand back. He put it in the basket... I went home and I'm like, yes, I really wanted that. Didn't check out. Didn't get it. Sold Rookie out. mistake, that is. Never seen it again. Never. Rookie mistake. Lanarkshire, you can do the same. Anna on the phone lines. If you've pressed your option one, there are about 43 oh, no, yeah. people. <gasps> Barbara, you sure. can do the same. Maker, you can do the same. Nancy, Sharon, Diane, Caroline, Anne, Susan, Karina, Kent, loads of you. I can't keep, there's loads of names. Um, I've got final five wow. opportunities. It's absolutely beautiful. Of this material, these colours, there is literally just two more strands. Yeah. From this parcel, this is from that same parcel that we heard from Bernard about. Um, and these aren't just any old strands either. No, so um, I've got the final five opportunities. Four now. Well done, Barbara. Well done, Barbara. Anna, you can do the same on the phone lines. I've got four left. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just, how's that? There you go. Mm. Stunning, aren't they? I'm gonna borrow this bust, actually. Let me drape that like that for a second. Ooh. There are 30 available. I love this. Might have this one. Might have, say nothing. Have you got this round? Yeah. Oh, I'm jealous, <laughs> it's lovely. <laughs> Well, this is the last chance. I love Who loves it. yellow jade? I love yellow jade. And it always reminds me, this is not... <laughs> I want it to, to catch on. I do want it to catch on. Something I said the one day, literally spontaneously on air, I was like, oh, look at that Burmese yellow jade. It looks like the perfect... You know when you like, like do a, a boiled egg? Oh, and yeah. it's that beautiful, fresh egg, dippy... Dippy. Dippy egg yolk yellow. I'd love that to catch on. Because for me, in the world of jade, the perfect yellow, the perfect yellow is this. Dippy egg. I've got exactly 30. And if you're thinking, like I said, ah, oh, they've slipped up there on their knotting. Nope. No, they haven't. They've left it there intentionally so that you can attach something to it. Look at that. Mirror image. 
these are all your yellow tones you've also got so by definition this would be called if it was burma that would be your your um your imperial white yeah. if it was kotan that would be a mutton fat um this is quartzite Clarity. jade the, yeah translucently wow. translucency like no other um jewelry makers we have 30 available opportunities and that is it once um well is it does the same apply with this then roscoe is it going to be going to our sister channel because i know they have done strands or they might send it to our our um manufacturers and get them to re-knot it maybe i know that has happened before they've certainly done that with some of our pearls it's the la the last auction was extremely popular is this penultimate strand of this color We'll do this in two pri uh, price crashes. It's a full 55 centimeter strand. This next price crash, not what you're paying. Ombre golds. This is your golden silk variety. Again, that's the quality that is really, really, really regarded as like type A, the best in the world. Well, they're all type A, but the best top grade. Not paying 79.99. Last opportunity for us to get hold of this variety. Certainly, and I don't know, you know, um, Quartzite jade is as popular as any other variety of jade on our sister channel, as popular as yeah. it is here as well. Um, so do get it whilst Colors, you can. Colors. And I can see why. I agree, you know, whatever the variety, whether it's Kotan, whether it's mm. Burmese, whether it's Guatemalan, whether it's British Columbian, whether it's uh, um, Quartzite, whether it's uh, Nanhong, whatever variety of jade it actually is, if you love it and you can afford it, buy it. Totally. Because it's jade. Natural, you know with us it is natural, genuine jade. And get your certificate of authenticity. Loving those autumnal tones. We had 30 available opportunities. Straight away we've got collectors getting involved, jewelry makers like Anna in Derbyshire and Lena. Um, in Delana, where's that? Oh, I don't know. Lena, where's Delana? I'm intrigued Delana. to know. Have a, we'll, have a, we'll have a little Google. We're not even stopping at seventy nine ninety nine. What? Two hundred carats of golden silk. Is that Sweden? I mean, amazing, Lena. It's beautiful. So one of these, if you one of these, if you check out, is on its way to Sweden. We are a global channel. We know that we've got we've got customers, businesses that shop for us worldwide. We know this. And by the way, um, our businesses, we're a wholesaler. We've quite frequently said we are a wholesaler of some of the rarest gemstones um, on our planet, um, most definitely. And we know that we have high end jewelry establishments. Yeah. I mentioned one earlier on, didn't I? <laughs> um, that literally we used to source them the gemstones that they see in those collections um and by the way by the way you pay the same price that they do but here we are in its embryonic stage bringing you the newest variety of jade and i do understand when people of us go and go it's not it's not jade well no it is it's been classified as jade yeah that's not us that's the that's literally the eastern industry. industries classifying it as jade we can be resistant as much as we like, but it is a variety of jade. Um, I do get it at the same time. Yeah. I'm sympathetic of it. I understand it. We've overcome this before with jadeite. Yeah. You know? Um, blessing, Alison, Anna, Anna in Derbyshire, Anna in Lanarkshire, Maker, Susan, Marion, um, London, Lena. You've got to check out your baskets to guarantee your success. I only actually have 30 of these available. And again, if you want to have... You know, it doesn't really matter to me anyway in my head it doesn't really matter what we say here at jewelry maker we we pass on that's why we discuss and and meet and learn and have relationships with individual like bernard because bernard is a font of knowledge and and he is basically really one of the people that we've learned um learned uh jade uh, uh, about so much now i've got what sorry we have run over yet we're going to put the projects on pre-order. Fantastic. Do shop ahead. There's a hundred of each of those. Um, okay, which is amazing. All about those lovely thick cords. Now, this is the last strand of the material. Oh, it's lovely. It's beautiful. Six to seven mil. Uh oh. 
Did you just say the word outrageous? It's already been outrageous. It's been outrageous from the, from, from the get-go, hasn't it? Oh, look at that. That's beautiful, isn't it? They're my colours. They are lovely colours. Yeah. Because uh, I know they're autumn, but they're also summer, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, yeah. We're going to be outrageous. It's already outrageous at 49.99. The only six to seven mil strand, yeah? And the last of the strands. How many, Ross? 50 on the nose, so we've got a big quantity. We're at 49.99. A minute clock and we are going even lower. Good luck. Use this time wisely to guarantee your success. Incredible. I love the sort of, you're getting some, some olivey colours and the, those really intense reds. Yeah. Gorgeous. And then all the meat. I love the sort of, I'm going to call it watermelon peach, sort of up near your ring finger. This one here. Oh, yeah, up here. Yeah, and that yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Peachy the, tones. The, that's all natural, Alison. Yeah, we thought. are going to do something outrageous, jewelry makers. We've got 50, the biggest quantity that we have had. Final piece, final strand of this quality. In a, in a size, a go-to size that we will frequently include in our jewelry designs. Think yeah. about those beautiful pearls that we are still in my memory. How amazing this would look with those because they were so golden, yeah. weren't they? How perfect that combination would be to team it alongside gold and silk jade. Imagine Stunning. the value of that piece of jewelry. Oh wow, yes. I have 50. There's I don't know that I want to look. I wonder how outrageous Ross, oh goodness Ross. That's incredibly outrageous. There should be a one in front of that, shouldn't there? There should be a one in front of that prize tag jewelry makers. I think that uh, genuinely, I think that's the most affordable, uh, most affordable strand we've ever done a quartzite jade. And most likely wow. ever will do. Remember, I'm going to go, these are, say, repeat again. These aren't my words. These are the words of, of Bernard, who is responsible for much of our amazing jade offerings. And he said, the purity of top stones is certainly finer than any other jade, but the rarity of such rush, uh, rough sorry, is the biggest challenge. When they write of material reaching the fine texture of chalcedony, it is this material that has risen um, much in value because it is the finest water of all jades. These stones are completely different to normal gold silk that we can procure for you. Um, with that material, you are competing with the big players who will pay a high price. Yeah. Well, there, I mean, seriously, we will buy it to you, and of course we know that we work on minuscule margins, but we've got to pay more than that. Twenty nine ninety nine yeah. for quartzite jade. These stones are not just about colour, um, they are valued on their compression, so pure, no coarse moments. Look at that translucency that you're getting for 30 quid. How on earth? We will look back on opportunities like this. I don't know when. I haven't got a crystal ball, but whether it's six months, whether it's a year, whether it's 10 years, I don't know. We are in its infancy sourcing the newest variety, qualified newest variety of jade, but we're able to source it right now because we're buying it in its infancy, because we are in that, um, the change curve, yeah. you know, where, uh, wait, make no doubt about it, when it comes out the other end, then the price is gonna be at its high. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be there. If you wait till that moment, that's how people purchase, make money on gemstones, yeah. in actual fact, not meaning to sound vulgar. What's that? Spaces for a pendant, yeah. Should we do a carving? Oh, go on. A koi carp carving. <gasps> Have you seen the detail? Oh, that's amazing. But it's a double koi as well. The koi carp is um, one of the reasons why they're so, I mean, they're hugely, they're so expensive, aren't they? Oh, gosh, yeah. Um, very much protected as well. But they, they, koi carp, they believe, is actually the dragon is the story of the koi carp swimming up the river isn't it and yeah, when yeah. they reach the top they will be turned into a dragon if they reach the top you know how much jade carving should be here at jewelry maker i think that i was lucky enough to launch the first jade carving here at jewelry maker it was that dragon do you remember dragon. the circle heaven in the circle of heaven Got it. that was 299 pounds um back then 299 which is incredible absolutely incredible I don't know how we're about to do this because we're already at a double figure price tag. Look at the detail of this piece. 
stunning, isn't it? That's, oh my, oh my, oh my goodness, Ross. That's best. It's also carving. the yin, yin and yang. Can you yeah. see that? Very clever. With the Could lotus say Pisces, in the middle. With the lotus flower in the middle, yeah. We have just half that price. What are you doing, Ross? We're still not done. Look, you can see that beautiful oh. translucency. That is incredible, isn't it? Oh, oh so it's, my, still it's etched, etched on. on the back as well. Oh, how amazing. How incredible is that? £49.99. Oh, no way gosh. near enough people on the oh. phone lines, Ross. If we crash it, we, we, you're giving it away now, aren't you? How many, how many, how many have you got? 27, uh, okay, so I, I just looked up, and I'll be honest, I'm usually well and truly on board. When I, usually I'm like, yeah, go on, let's do the best possible deal. However, I just looked up, saw the call screen and went, no, we can't drop the price if there's literally only a handful of people, because that's already epic at 49.99. We know that this gemstone, at this price, I would say, pass it on to our sister channel. No, no. This carving is natural. It is still beautiful. done by hand. Remember that article from the IG, um, IGA that says, Mother Nature is stingy with natural red. That is natural red. It's the reverse. A of minute the one clock. I, I point blank refuse. And listen, I can say it. I haven't got any, any power on this at all, but... I don't think you should be dropping that price if they aren't guaranteed to sell out today. Yeah. Okay. We've got 11 of you there. We need nine more. Nine. Eight more. Seven more. Okay. All right. I'm on board then, Ross. Five more people. If they... There's a two-minute queue on the phone lines, jewelry makers. I Not will look me. up and I will go, okay, yeah, that's amazing. That's amazing. Great. 49.99. Any gemstone, let alone a genuine natural quartzite jade, in a master carving that is done by hand, should not be a single penny lower than what's on your screens, especially something of that skill, of that quality, that tells that story. Look at it. Yeah, exactly. This is ridiculous, depth. but fantastic at the same time. But I will dig my heels in if I look at the call screens and there's not enough people there, which there wasn't. There is now. Madness. <gasps> 30, oh that's, is gosh. that not one of the lowest prices we've ever done on Quartzite, Jay? For a carving, surely. A carving of that depth and yeah, quality. Yeah, it's amazing. It's incredible. I know Quartzite Jade can carve, um, I don't want to say easier, because that makes it sound like, yeah, it's easy to do. It's not easy to do. It's still master carvings. But um, but that skill, that to get that detail. Yeah. You know, even down to the ten, is, do you call them tendrils? I, I guess. so. The, like the little yeah, yeah the little the little whiskers yeah of the actual koi carp itself 34.99 donna and rexham bernadette allison tamina Anne, frida margaret jennifer cheryl uh hello to this i've got nine left eight left please hold those phone lines um maker sheila susan jennifer ron maker donna tamina um i've got two more to bring you um we're gonna pick up the pace because guess what this is, oh, I almost feel bad saying it. Look at this. Look at this. And we're going to match the price. Look at oh that. Oh my God. You've got the temple in the background. That is just. How? how? I love that scene. But again, I'll dig my heels in, Ross. <laughs> I will. Ooh. I get stubborn then. I'll get. I'll dig my Heisty. heels in. If they, if they don't look like they're going to sell out. How many have you got? 27 again. I did say it out loud, Jura Makers. If there's enough of you, we'll match that price. That was out loud. There you all are. Heard there that. you all are, Jewelry Makers. Look at that beautiful depth that you're Stunning, seeing here. It? Look at the details, those really structural trees. You know the ones that are like yeah, yeah. giant bonsais? Yes, yeah. There is but a name of them. What's caught me, and I've, I've got a few of our carvings, can you go in close to that bridge? You can see the water literally flowing through the through. bridge underneath yeah. the bridge can you see what i'm saying yeah i've never seen that on any other carvings before that's amazing incredible and it's all wow. those lovely layers and depths look at it from a side profile oh, it's just amazing it's just fascinating mm. well done everybody we've 
Could the you quality haven't matched of the that... price. You went lower. Uh, <laughs> Ross says he wasn't concentrating on that one. Look at the quality of that. Oh my Material. goodness! But look, look, even from a side profile, to actually be able to carve that level of detail. Yeah. That's amazing. The mountain terrain in the background, the structures of the tree, um, the movement. Look, there's Love a little the boat, boat there, there as well. Yeah, yeah, the boat on its way past there. Absolutely incredible detail. And again, drilled so you could very easily just knot this into your design. That's madness, that price, Roscoe. Yeah. Unbelievable, <laughs> unbelievable, unbelievable. I tell you what, I've got one more to bring you. Are Ooh. you doing it for 29.99? And then clutch closed, go straight to break, then I'll make my way over to our lovely Alison. Okay, which one? No, that, that's massive. These are gorgeous. <laughs> a clutch to close, as soon as you see it, as soon as you see it. He's fantastic. What? That's, that's the back, by the way. Because you, you can tell he's got a tail on the other side. He's just oh stunning, my isn't goodness he? me! Look at the quality. I know he's absolutely amazing. Oh my goodness! You've just got the three quartzite jade carvings for less than a hundred pounds today. That's ridiculous. We're, we are going to go straight to break jewelry makers because we've got the most amazing masterclass. Projects are on pre-order. They are quite simple projects, so don't worry. I'm not going to spend too long talking about those. We can dive into Alison's amazing demonstration. Make sure you're checking out. What an unbelievable deal. This has got definitely purpley, isn't it? It's like a move. Um, well done. And who doesn't love elephants? Elephants, doesn't yeah. I love them. Uh, exactly. They're Beautiful. Gorgeous. Make sure you're checking out, everybody. Do not go anywhere because I'm going to make my way over to Alison, who's got the most gorgeous, chunky cord in your midday masterclass. We'll see you after this. <laughs> ready to elevate your jewellery making to new heights? Join us for season three of Britain's Next Gem and bring your creative vision to life. Our expert panel is on the lookout for one outstanding jewellery maker to invest in. Think you have the talent and drive? Apply today and make your dream a reality. To apply, you must be aged 18 and over and be available to travel to the Jewellery Maker Studios on the 18th and 19th of September. Please send your name, your jewellery making specialities, images of your designs and a bit about yourself to guestdesigner at jewellerymaker.com. Good luck and we look forward to seeing you in the next round. Did you know that instructions come included with every designer project? Dive right into your jewellery maker project with confidence and clarity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a first-time creator, our step-by-step -step guides ensure success every time. Just download them from your Jewelry Maker account on our website. Get started today and experience the joy of hassle-free crafting. Instructions included, creativity unleashed.
Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Jewelry makers. Amazing. FYI, before we start, the green and the reds. The pictures and the pre orders oh. are on the wrong way round. Okay, so if you go to the web, the first two. Oh, look at the, the actual words. Can you see the Read the description. Wrong? Right, so you need to swap the photograph. Right, we're in the pro we're in the process of doing it right now. So if you see, the blue is right. If you want the green, then do it by the title, not the photograph. Okay, title, not the photograph. We will change it, and I'll tell you when we change it as well. Okay, Alison, they have all been on pre-order. They're all flying out. But what lovely makes. Oh, I have you know, so oh, much I fun. I have seen that. That's amazing. It's easy peasy. That's a bit of me, that is, Alison. Yeah. <gasps> it fits too. <laughs> and that's so comfortable. Yeah, they're, they're very comfortable. Very, very comfortable. Very easy makes. Really? They're fab. Yeah, oh, that's easy. Well, yeah, I, I, I kind of did three, three projects. <laughs> Well, do you know, I, I love India. it. And I love the fact that, you know, we are very much into the season of like sort of warmth. Yeah, and yeah. Chunky. Yeah. And nice, nice hug. Yeah, absolutely. And that, I think that goes for your jewellery as well. I mean, look at that. That's that, absolutely gorgeous. I had to do ombre, didn't I? Yeah, well, well, I don't blame you. But they are absolutely flying on pre-order. More than 20 of each of these projects has already gone. I've only got 100, so it's 20%. Already yeah. Already gone. Um, so... If I'm new, say, to jewellery making, Alison, yeah. is this a, an idea like starter? Totally, totally. They're fabulous. If you're new, if you've got dexterity issues, um, oh, yeah, you if you're that. experienced, doesn't matter. Yeah. You know, things like those little stacker bracelets on the front, in the middle one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're like 10 minutes and they're magic. Look, it changes colour in the middle. What does? Do you take that off? <gasps> Changes colour. You stinker. It's magic. Love these. They're fabulous. Oh, I love it, Alison. They're yeah. so cool. Shall we start with this colourway? Yeah. Um, okay. Do you want me to pull this out of the way for you? There you go. Yeah, no, yeah, thank you. Let's, in fact, let me put that sideways there on you go. for a second. Because you get those colours. Yeah. I'll, I'll do that. And the jewellery makers, which tells me it's going to be an amazing price tag. Is it? Is because it? we used to outsource all of our cords and it used to bump the price up, yeah. up, obviously. Now we actually manufacture our own. Can I tell you something very important about yes. them? Sometimes you get these and there's quite a big reel inside. Yeah. Yeah. The tiny, that hole is it. If you look, if you hold the back, hang on, I'll get what I've yeah. got. Yeah, I've got it here. You. If I take the... i got it here. No. Oh, in the reel itself. Yeah. Just to show you how much you get on, there's only that bit that's, that's the cord. Oh, so you do get masses? You're getting that depth of cord. Yeah, yeah. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So all of that depth is cord. Is it? Yeah, you get loads. Absolutely loads. It's 
fabulous. Wow. I've done so much and I've still got tons and tons of cord I thought you were talking left. about, like, as Mark would say, the gubbins of the cord, but it's not, oh, is it? No, no. We're talking about how much is actually on, on it. this reel. Yeah. Okay. So now, Jura Makers, you get four spools. Do you know the length of each of those spools? Then you get... Lots. Lots. <laughs> you get how many? So 40 metres you're getting your all together. Then you get those four tubes, which you can see in this lovely bracelet. And then you get the cord ends yeah. as well. First price crash, jewelry makers. I love that idea. I think that's a really good idea. It's a great stack of bracelets. Absolutely great. What are you going to sell them for? 10 of each? Yeah. I mean, uh, 29.99, I thought that was going to be a closing price for us. Should perhaps be. You've used so little. Okay. Considering that those 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 reels of cord yeah. alone, 10 metres each. So I've used, what, about 15 centimetres in one of those bracelets. <laughs> seven and a half off each one yeah i mean what about something like this i obviously that that will create use more it, of the cord. It, it's used more um i think i used about i think i cut about a meter and a half to two meters okay, off so you each still one take it quite a few times then. absolutely right okay now each of these projects are all going to the same price you can shop ahead and i think um i've these just heard director bad. adam say um, that the photo and the graphic should all be right now. No, not yet. Okay, leave it with us. So use the title, not the photograph, when you decide on your colours. So if you want, um, make sure you're checking the actual written word um, when you're checking out everybody. We had a hundred, but they're already flying. We're not stopping at twenty nine ninety nine. I think there are going to be people that get all the different colourways. Oh, if you can afford it do it you can make so much if you sell brilliant if you do groups brilliant if you have kids they'll love oh, it yeah. if you have like my mum with arthritis and my niece with arthritis they'll love it it's three mil cord yeah three millimeter it's three millimeter thick cord it's so so easy to use but it's also a massive trend i'm looking at the one at the bottom there which is like your reds and your yeah orange. yeah i mean I, i've seen celebrities wearing those i yeah. know they wear them for different beliefs and meanings but you know that simple corded bracelet is huge yeah it's well. absolutely huge 19.99 that's five pound per cord reel and then everything else for free wow and you you know you've got so many different cords here you could do football colors yeah you could do you could do harry potter current colors yeah you could do olympic colors you could do all sorts of you know flag colors you you, you could know, use that, these I mean, look, if i showed that adam you'd wear that wouldn't you that's cool isn't it yeah cool you could do your football team colors yeah i think that's a great point yeah or your cricket team yeah, well it's kind of white <laughs> <laughs> no no you could do you could do short format cricket you could do my my dad used to call it pajama cricket but yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah sorry i'm not a, no no you could you wouldn't you think could. That i used to I couldn't resist that. i know you wouldn't believe it but i used to uh, but as you can see i paid very little attention uh 19 pounds and 99 pence only we had 100 of these but they're flying out you get a lot don't you you get an awful it goes a long way because it's so thick mm. you don't actually need a lot this of it so let me show you i've got so uh What's that? This Right, I have a whole bag of offcuts because I, I when I'm when I'm doing stuff, oh, and and all this, so I've got all, a whole load of of offcuts, right? They're offcuts, right? That's what I've got left of that one. I mean, it doesn't even look like you've touched it. Yeah, hardly any, and I've done those two big pieces. Oh. I've done the bra and and I've done the bracelet, and like I said, I've got huge pieces left over. Wow. It doesn't even look like you've touched it. Yeah. Um, shop ahead on the other projects as well, jewelry makers. Yeah, and and, and I was, oh, look at all this. I know. You make you can literally make masses. With so this I've done kit, ten pieces. You? Yeah. Um, I could have made probably a hundred pieces. Very cool. Easily. Very very cool. Look at that. Tell you what, jewelry makers, let's sell them out. 
Over half the stock has gone already of each one, by the way, on pre-order. Oh so whether you're going for the hots, yeah. whether you're going for the cool, cools, the blues and pinks, or whether you're going to for the natural. That's what I'm going to say. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> no, I got that. Yeah, I get that. The earthy. Earthy. I Earthy love I love tones. that colourways. I love this is very me. The ombre yeah. of the red yeah. orange. I can't Sorry, I can't pick so I'm glad that Ross is uh, dropping this price because I'll be honest, I'd like to get all three. Yeah. Three projects. You get the you get lots of the essentials as well. You get the cord ends, you get some of the nice tubes. Yeah. All kits and oh my gosh. all kits to the same price, jewelry makers. So um, shop ahead and you can just make masses. I love this idea. I just want to quickly show it. Look how lovely that is. So that, if you think about it, that's got, um, and we've got those gemstones here. Yeah. That's got no metal at all. That's cool. It's adjustable and it's got no metal. That's really cool. I can imagine like a, I can imagine Beckham wearing that. Yeah. Well, you can do it the same in the necklace, necklace. as well. Yeah. Take it away, Alison. Um, right. All kits are going to the same price tag as and when um, we have a natural break. I will sort of uh, swap the kits okay. over and the graphics over. Um, so what's the tutorial that you get for free with this amazing price? I did three. You did three? Two of them were quite small. Okay. So two of them are quite small. So I've done that. Shown you how to do the, the um, two-tone bracelet. Mm -hmm. Shown you how to do the knotted necklace. bracelet necklace. With the slider knot. With the slider knot, because it's a slightly, it's a different slider knot. Yeah. So I've shown you how to do that. And then I've shown you how to do, I think these are so co cool. They're a double cobra. So it's like a paracord, isn't it? It's it, it very, you can use this for any of your paracord recipes, uh, tutorials. Yeah. You can use this for macrame. It's going to come out bigger. So anything like that. So just bear in mind, it's, chunky so this is this is this is called a double cobra but it's actually square knots which if you remember earlier i said there's two two types of knots that are used mostly there's an awful lot more knots in macrame you've got your your, your basics you've got your twi your your spiral knot which we did this morning and this is square knots love it it's very easy love so we're it. going to show you how to do this okay so like i say you've got the three tutorials but i will show you how to join them because this involves six, uh, three chords. Okay, so I've, you want, for this bracelet, you want about a, um, a foot per inch. Sorry, it's, imper uh, it's, it's imperial. Um, so if you want a, a seven inch bracelet, you want about seven foot okay. of, of cord. Um, you, you'll have to do the conversion because I can't convert. Um, so you want your three lengths, but we need to, so this has been um, fixed together and you go, you put it through, you're doing a lark's head, pop it through and pull. And then you've got your little bar at mm -hmm. the cross. I'm just going to pin that out the way. Now, before we get into that, what's cool about this is it's nylon. So you melt the ends. So I'm just going to give you a quick quick demo a nice little um uh, what's it thank you lighter which is running out of fuel so i'm gonna have to really melt that and you can stick them together give them a bit of a rub and there you go that's stuck wait they stick together oh I've you just melted it together it. no just melted it together so and then melt your end no way does it glue it won't, no, it won't glue, but what I'm going to do, just melt it so you can put it through your tubes and put the uh, end on. And then that slides through. Amazing. And you just pull that, cover your join with it, and then you tell everyone it's magic. It is magic. It's magic, just like that. And then, I, so those are all seven inch, so basically you want three and a half inches of each. Very cool. And then do the same, pop your end on and glue it in place. Now I also had some... Um, Kumihimo endings yeah. or cord endings, which I've used on a few of the other pieces, which because the ones you get in the kit will take one. Yeah. Um, which is great. You can knot it down to one, but I wanted multiples. So that's another way of fixing the ends. If you could just turn that orange one round sure. or just, just flash that top, that's another way of actually fixing it. And then I've just put the clasp on. Yeah. Really nicely. That's got four in. I could have got six in there, but I, you know, was only using four. 
Love and that. then this way I'm just using a large, gosh, these were on ages ago, um, large jump ring, which I've attached to it. Um, I think you've got 40 odd um, steps, by the way. So, like I said, this is, this is two square knots, two columns of square knots, but you're alternating these in, in each side. So we've got our lazy cord and our two working cords. I've taken the one from opposite. So like we did before, you're going to make your um, number four, pop that through and pull. Now, it's thick cord. If you're going to, if you're going to fix it into your macrame board, that will make that wide. Yes. Okay, so just bear that in mind. You don't really need it because it, it's quite thick. So you just pull those up together. Now, you always want to be done that one wrong you see not concentrating that's because what I was doing earlier you want this one always to be underneath so you go under and over and then over and under right. and then pull up because that way it, you get the um the dark on it so you then go from the right side under and over over and under and pull up okay so you're getting the yellow coming on the side and it's going to be in the middle and then that that sort of um bluer purpley is down the middle so i'm then going to swap over side so i've now got this side coming over and we're going to do the same again we're going to go under and over and then over and under so just just get that sort of mantra it's under and over and under and over. So I'm now going to go under and over. So your bright color, your contrast color is always the one that goes under and then your fixed color. I mean, in the one I've done on there, I've used, if I just pull this one down, and all I've of used this the is two in different colors. All of this as well. If you're not getting it right now, don't panic. It's yeah. in the instructions. Um, it, where do I go to? Uh, so this is the biggest one. I have 43 steps. Mm -hmm. So you've got you've got a lot of steps. I take you through. I'll just move that up a bit. Oh, sorry. Quite yeah. Either. So I've I've gone quite close in and showed you exactly yeah. where you're going and everything. Um, so you should be able to follow that. It gets a bit A B C D. Yeah. But only only to stop me having to write the green cord that's not quite as dark as the other green cord yeah, and is lighter than the other green then. cord. Yeah. Okay. So. You then get to here now the so that's it that's your that's your stitch that's your square stitch you're doing two columns of square stitch now the bit in the middle so it doesn't matter whether i take this one or the other so you want a v of your pink and then you get a v of your blue there and you have one that's crossover so see how they come like that so you've always got a v and a v and then you sort of get the two parallel does that make sense so you've got yeah. a v and a v and then you'd get your two parallel so that goes all the way around by the way these are reversible and you get a different pattern Ooh, i like that side so yeah. you get so that's where the darker color is is you can wear it either side you can wear it either side you've got to be tidy on how you finish it i'll leave that one that way that way up so it, it's reversible so i'm on the yellow i'm got i was underneath there so i'm going to cross that over the top so it's up to you. You can do every other or you can leave them the same. You just need to cross them. So we've just, we've on, just, under, sorry, we've just swapped okay. over the graphics for the hot colours, by the way. There's only one project that, that can be described as hot. Yeah. So ignore the pictures on the web. But if you want the what? The one on your screen right now, this is the details for it. We know the picture's wrong. Okay, so we will swap that over. Go by the written word. You know the price. Fourteen ninety nine. I think this is gonna be the most a, popular as well. Yeah. I think people at those prices, I think people are gonna be buying most of them. Yeah, I agree. So you can see how this is crossing over on there. Yeah, so mm -hmm. so this one I'm I'm going yellow over the top. And then I go under and over that one. Over that and under that. And I tell you what. I know I've put an hour on, but you can do these in less than an hour. Once you get into the rhythm of it and you do get a rhythm, then it goes very quickly. So I'm going to make this one so you can see my V of yellow 
swap those two over and do the same. So it just depends whether you're going to go, um, whether you're going to alternate like that or do a different pattern, it's entirely up to you. You've got to cross them because that's what holds the two sides together. But you can play with the different colours. Um, I mean, this this is using um, ones out of two different kits. Mm. So uh, just go under, I'll do another one of those. And then you're going to finish them under and over, over and under. It you can see how quick it, it, it will grow up. So under and over, under and over. Right, so then I'd want the orange, so I'm gonna flip those over, I'm going to have the orange. And can you see what I mean about the two being parallel there? So you've got the orange yeah. going that way. It doesn't matter whether you go right hand first, left hand first. It doesn't matter whether you're right-handed, left-handed. It doesn't matter whether you do, um, you're always going to start from the middle. So whether you start the right or the left, you've got to do both. It really doesn't matter. It's so forgiving and so easy to do. This is, and it's so easy to handle because it's so big. Yeah. It's really, really nice. So when you've got um, under and over, under and over, there we go. Where, when you've got to the end, when you've got to however long you want it, bear in mind you're going to have you're going to put a clasp on. Um, if you've done it on jimp ring, these are great on um, D rings. They're great on carabiners. Oh, yeah, they're great cool. on all sorts. So once you've done that, we need to attach it to the other one. Right. So do you want to do that while I undo this? Let's bit? do that because these are your earthy. How are we doing? Getting Earthy there. tones, very popular on pre-order. I think great for gents makes this. Uh, yeah, well, I looked at that and went, that's almost camo. Yeah, it's cool. No. Yeah, cool. Whether you do it that side or that side, it's, yeah. it's, it's a camo. 14.99. I know. Great if you want to make jewellery to sell as well, because it's very affordable. Oh, very affordable. Well, I actually, I actually um, saw, um, what, the one, yeah. oh, sorry. That's right. Um, I actually saw there's a there's a, a training thing mm. online. A friend of mine does it. They use paracord to make um, dog collars yeah. and dog leads. Very strong. Massive, yeah, massive, great. massive business. Yeah, absolutely. So Fourteen ninety nine. You can have matching matching you could. dog and oh, I like human. it. Bracelets. Um, again, jewelry makers, please look at the written word rather than the photographs. Okay, yeah. when you're choosing your colours, if or if you're just saying. I want all three of them at that price that doesn't tag, matter. then it doesn't really matter, just check them all out. Um, but I'm loving these colours, I like the earthy oh, tones of them as well. Back to you, Love that. Right, okay, so when you get to the other end, we've got all these, all these ends to finish off. All you've got to remember is you want to be tidy. Leave the two that stick out the side, we're going to feed those in after. So you're going to go in and a bit like we did before, we're going to do a knot, we're going to go through there and then we're going to go hang on we're going to go the other way there we go around so you want to go from the front to the back around and over it i'm going to exaggerate the loop so you've gone around and over then you're going to go back through the middle okay and then you're going to go underneath that loop so you're getting your lark's head you're then going to pull that all the way down and you have to sort of tweak it down so pull it all the way down and then you've got your lark's head now what you're going to do and you're going to do that with those three four okay so you do that with all four of them and then you're going to feed this through so you can see where this has gone underneath those two so you take a something pointy but not sharp like a round nose plier and I'm just going to loosen that a little bit, mm -hmm. feed the end into there, and if you need to, just heat up. Watch out. I'm running out of uh, gas in there. Okay, that should do it. Just heating, heating that up just that's to stiffen it a little bit. That's because it's a man-made fibre, isn't it? So it'll it's, actually yeah, melt. It melts. Degree, yeah, it melts. Literally, that's what it does. And that's what you do with ropes. 
on, on the boat, you'll melt them. So pull that through and then you can pull that through to there, tighten that up and then if you poke that through, if you decide you want a, a, a double sided, it doesn't matter which side you finish with it, finish it, but I'm just going to pop that through there. Now don't cut it off until you've done them all, but I'm just going to show you. You then trim this at the back and um, you can use scissors or, or a flush cutter because it's quite thick cord. So I'm just going to trim it to a few mil. Let me just, there we go. And then carefully you take your um, lighter, if it's got any light left in it, and just burn, melt the end. And you can see, can we can we go close in that one? Sorry. And then you've just melted it back into there. Yeah, so the ends disappear. Oh. Yeah? Do you know that reminds me of that? Is it, it's like, is it like a chenille jumper? It is. It's got it does that. does look it's, like a yeah, chenille jumper, doesn't it? It's got that it? braided bit. So you can pop that in there and it's and it's absolutely amazing so you do that if you do it tidily then you can use these double-sided so do that for all of those and then all you've got to do is attach a clasp so that's, Love your, that. that's your whistle stop to that I'm, I'm looking at this bit here and if you yeah. didn't want to use a round yeah you, had you want a d-ring a d-ring yeah so, so why you, want, you mentioned the d-rings yeah yeah so you want two two of your d-rings perfect I would I would do I would do two with the D rings. Yeah, at either end of your bracelet or necklace. <laughs> okay. Because well, no, you could you could do something different the other end. You but. could you could um, again just imagine if I show turn this round. So imagine I'm going to try and squeeze in a few more findings. So we're strapped for time. On and gone. You get the idea, don't you? So you yep. need two yep. attached to your clasp. Take advantage of these deals. We're faster post, we're faster post, say four ninety nine. Solid still and silver. We haven't got much time, so we're going straight down sterling. to it. Yeah. No <laughs> no dilly dallying. Don't dilly dally on the way. <laughs> straight down to it, jewelry makers. Uh four ninety nine. Fantastic. <laughs> but the other thing you can do is actually you can put it inside there as a, a D ring you'd see on a, a collar mm. to attach your charm to. Yes. Yes, good. Straight down to me. those prices. Um, make the, yeah, because we're strapped for time and we want to bring you all these deals. So we're literally just going to go right down to, <laughs> right down to the low prices. Um, we're going to bring you a few different findings as wow, well. Wow, that's good. It's great, isn't it? Yeah. So obviously you will need to multi buy. Um, I'll bring you some more tubes. So if you want to create these, yes, bracelets. Um, if you want to make more of those, you need more tubes, basically. Right. Uh, as in this one? Yeah, but the difference is these are plate, that's sterling. So you can actually oh. make sterling silver ones. Oh, okay. It's got 925 okay. on it. All right, then sterling silver. Still doesn't even make, make a deal. And by the way, three mil internal um, diameter, so the yeah. cords will go into this no so problem. So it's perfect, yeah. Just heat the end and it will go in. Five pounds. Brilliant. So all of a sudden now you can say this is sterling silver. Yeah. And again, if you wanted to, you could actually solder a jump ring onto that. Yeah. And then put a charm on it. If you made a necklace, it becomes a, a charm carrier. Yeah, absolutely. They are stamped as well. I can see the 925 stamp. I don't know if you can make it out. Um, lots of you dialing through on this one as well. Three mil oh, sorry, Adam. Three millimeter diameter. Lorraine, Nicolette, loads of you there. Um, okay, let's do some jump rings. Again, closed jump rings. Oh, perfect. Yeah, like this. Yep. So I've used, I've used, so there's, yeah, we've got three, we've got stars, hearts and rounds, I think. Mm-hmm. So you just feed them, they're almost acting as a bale. Yeah. Okay. So almost act like a bale to your cord. So these, these are actually closed jump rings. Yeah. So you can open them, you'd have to cut them. Yeah. Um, but they work great. If you just slid those all on, they'd look fantastic. Um, that one's got the stars on there. Yeah, but you got you could. But you can you could if you do, if you if you want to sort of interlink because I've put them on different ones. I've fed two of different ones through that. Yeah, it gives you a great you get um, the effect. Idea, don't yeah, you? yeah, you get the idea. So you can easily Fab. use those two. Seven pounds and ninety nine pence, jewelry makers, um, for sterling silver and actually a size we don't oh. often see. 
because the other thing you can do is put your jump ring on onto your cord yep and then melt it into a into a hook oh nice idea nice idea right let's do the hearts ah oh, straight down to it so you can actually make your own loop yeah like that okay and you've put your clothes jump ring on it oh very clever um here you go so you can actually almost, it's effectively almost like soldering but with a with a cord with with, with, a, with the cord yeah because that's sterling silver hearts we're running out of time i need to be really quick um there's the hearts going straight down to that price tag let's do the stars i've got mm -hmm. a minute to squeeze all these in they're all on the website jewelry makers so no bother really just uh make sure you check out don't worry it's just um just so i can show you they're the stars jewelry makers and again you've got the got sterling on. silver which are on that bracelet um necklace sorry how oh, lovely now coming up on tomorrow's show i've just clocked this we've got lovely claire yeah you're just saying, saying yeah. today that i haven't seen claire in ages and i miss her um so as you can see eight o'clock nine two five sterling silver um class s clasps eight o'clock is the bees and butterflies projects with Aww. claire's uh with claire um then at 10 o'clock we've got the return of green angelite long awaited 11 o'clock is all about nuggets nugget mania so wonderful and then at 12 o'clock we have a donut gemstone with ge uh, donut bales um with our lovely claire as well Alison, we love you when you're back with us and uh, the uh, third third there we go fantastic it's been a wonderful day thank you for joining us we'll see you very very soon